What is up, Clever Coop family? Of course it's not. Why don't I just mark it off with tape? That would be the easiest thing in the world to mark it off with tape or just not move it. <sighs> what is up, Clever Coop family? Happy Thursday to you. So good to see you. Thanks for hanging out tonight. Um, appreciate you. How's everybody doing today? Good to see you. you caught up on the VODs, a crystal garden in your skull. That's wild because there is so many in the world hours of that content. So thank you very much for that. Um, appreciate you. I'm sick, says Ash loves Harry Styles because there's two exclamation points. First of all, don't yell if you're sick. Um, but also, I'm sorry to hear that. That's a bummer. Please take care of yourself. Please don't be sick for too long. Please stop being sick. Your pick today on Insta was amazing. Thank you, Savannah. I appreciate it. You know what? I've been feeling... It's, it's funny, I think all the homies right now, we're feeling a little bit of that body dysmorphia, not feeling super stoked on ourselves or the way we look. So I'm posting pictures because I'm like, I, it's, I just should, like it's not, I need to get past it. So it's just like, eh, you know. We get a shirt show off. Uh, Tiana, this was just from, um, this was from Cloak, the first Cloak shoot that I did a little while ago. I just found it in my closet fresh after this shower um so yeah thanks very much um all righty let's see here tarot of death actually this one is the magician the magician making something from nothing um i don't know a lot about tarot but i think it's fun as like a thought exercise i don't put any stock in it myself it's like this is magic but i do think it's just like oh this is what this card is supposed to mean does that apply to your life and you go hmm i have been working too hard or hmm i am getting in my own way and i think that's fun I just think that's neat. Cool pants. So Austin Nix, I, I do have, I do own cool pants. I'm not wearing them right now. Um, I'm wearing much more comfortable pants right now because it's stream time. And y'all know that I'm like, oh, I'm going to be doing a two hour stream. No, it's going to be like four hours. We all know it. That's fine. It is what it is. Um, and I'm actually looking forward to it a lot. Um, I also realized there is a week that I'm supposed to have off. This is like an office break, which is kind of sick. And I was like, I should really use that time to relax. Or um, we won't be done with Baldur's Gate 3 by then. And also Starfield comes out. And also um, Armored Core came out today. So I'm just like, <laughs> what if I just streamed for seven straight days? Ooh, that could be fun. Also, Movie Night. That's right, E-Page. Movie Night is a thing that I promised a long time ago. Um, and that was from a long time ago. And uh, that was from a uh, subathon. Um, maybe maybe this maybe this weekend or maybe during the actually yeah maybe that during that week that i have off that would be really nice um owen wilson asks uh but not that owen wilson this is the famous one um is asking omg what's movie night so one of the incentives that i wanted uh people to unlock in a subathon um which they did was um basically i'll pull up youtube videos uh that the audience submits whether it's funny stuff whether it's like documentary stuff whatever and we'll just like watch it together and it's gonna be a chill stream I'll probably be in my PJs. Um, it'll be like a Saturday night, probably. And I think it'll be a grand old time. Um, hey, we got a few new subscribers. Everybody, please give a spicy. Clever Coop, welcome to TTV Giant 0318, Shelby Squared, Fletching Witch, Lark Nest, and then TG Noble. Um, thank you so much, y'all. Those were all Prime subs. Thanks for using your Prime on me. If you are new here, I do read out tips, uh, though I get a little bit behind because I like to talk to the chat as well because you shouldn't have to pay money to be seen here um you can just hang out for free um i do read out subscriptions or subscribers i read out sub bombs i read out resubscribers all at the end of the stream um that that way it's all in one fell swoop um so that being said if you do those things i appreciate it it's very nice thank you that being said you don't have to do any of those things um it's very nice it helps support me but i also want people to feel like they can just hang out here without any pressure or obligation to be uh financially contributing especially if you're a youngin if you're a kid hold on to your money you hold on to your money. Buy yourself a boba. Buy yourself a boba. You've been working so hard in school. Maybe. I don't know. Or you're doing your best. Either way. It is what it is. Um, uh, hi, Damien. I'm currently building a one-shot inspired off Sword AF. Is that okay? Says Abby. Get, uh, uh, get, I can't. I, re I misread your name first, and I was like, I can't read that. And then I saw what it actually says, and I'm like, can't read that either. So, Abby... Um, I say go for it. Why not? I'm, I'm honored. That sounds great. Um, don't sell it to anyone, but otherwise live your life. Um, taro flavor is the best. Oh, thanks, damn. 
I had bought a uh, like a canned milk tea the other day, and it was taro flavor, and oh, buddy, it was so good. I will say I do prefer a good like rose and sometimes an almond, but if they don't have those, taro is next up on the list. All those like earthy flavors, those sweet earthen flavors. Um, so good to see y'all. I'm really excited for today. I've been wanting to play so bad. So. Anybody who's new here, uh, we will get you caught up in the story real quick. It's There's not too much to deal with. You know, they're, they're very piecemeal quests with like one overarching story. So it's pretty easy to like get you caught up. Um, and we also had a plan last stream where we'd start messing with everybody's uh, class in game. So you, you're you a cleric of such and such domain? Not anymore. We're going to switch it up. It's going to be great. Um, Rose tea is fantastic, says Tana Dance. Yes, it is indeed. Um, we got 100 bits and then 100 bits from Katie Marie. Thank you very much, Katie Marie. We got Mysterious Kyle with 100 bits as well. Thank you so much saying have a top tier stream. You know what? I hope it's a top tier stream. But that's up to you at the end of the stream where you would rank this compared to other streams. Do I say the funniest thing I've ever said? Do I say something? Do I misspeak and uh, have trouble speaking a lot? Like just now? Probably. Um, and we got Milady Katie with our first sub bomb of the stream. Milady Katie, thank you very much. I do not have a fedora. I do not have a trilby, but I'm still going to say thank you. Um, Milady, without doing the, <laughs> um, gifting to Tinkerbell, Zombie Zombie, uh, Miss Kickatrix, or Sickatrix, uh, Al Oopsies, Ali Oopsies, there we go. And then Onyx Pokemon. Thank you very much, Milady Katie. I appreciate you a lot. Um, that's very nice of you. Would you ever consider making music, Damien? Um, Savannah Vamp asks, uh, I enjoy singing by myself and every once in a while I'll put out an Instagram story where I'm like, oh, you can kind of hear me sing. But for the most part, I'm very self-conscious about it. So like, I enjoy it and I think I have an okay voice, but I think I get in my head so much and have historically through my whole life that like at this point, I'm probably not gonna get out of my head while I'm singing. And I think that does hold me back and make singing a little hard and make it sound a little bit worse. So like, eh, I don't think I would ever be like, I'm making music, here's my CD, but like, you know, um, one of my friends is getting married and I'm gonna be the minister of all things, which is wild. Um, but I'm singing a duet with the maid of honor um, as, you know, for their first dance. And I was like, yeah, I'll do that. Like at a friend's wedding, 40 people, sure. Everybody knows I'm not a professional singer, we're fine. But Damien and his minister era, I think not, Owen. <laughs> Drop that mixtape, <laughs> it's probably, look, it's just gonna be like party rock 10 times in a row. I don't even care for that song. Um, Katie Marie is also gifting a sub to Mouse Reed. Um, thank you very much, Katie Marie. Welcome to you, Mouse Reed. We got K Mac gifting to Alligator, Alligator, Alligator Anter, Alligator Anter. Um, I'm sure there's another pun that I'm missing there and I can't see, but K Mac, thank you very much. We got Austin Nix back with a vengeance, dropping five flipping gift subs. Thank you very much, Austin Nix. Gifting to, uh, <laughs> Va Valentine Violet, there we go. You, you dropped a lot of letters for it to be like Leet Speak, and I'm assuming you try to get the name, and I like it, it's a good name. But I was literally like, Van 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 Violet. Valentine Violet, Beetlejuice Babe, Binksy Baby, Professor Hulk, and then Suncat02, Austin Nix. Thank you very much. We've got Habley23 as well. Um, Habley23, thank you very much for dropping five flipping gift subs. And Habley is gifting to Green Witchery, A It's Matt, Wally B, Mag MP2, and then Stink Stunk. Um, thank you. Appreciate you. That's very nice of you. Um, all right, y'all. I'm so excited for streaming today. My God, I keep getting so many TikToks. I don't have a lot of time to watch TikToks lately, but I'm still like, everything I'm getting is just like, boom, 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 more crazy content. I accidentally fell asleep and took a mini uh, accident nap uh, <laughs> earlier. And uh, don't tell anyone. Um, and I left the TikTok running that was like a Baldur's Gate like guide. It was presented like a guide, but like midway through the guy was like, also, this is all just based on my opinion on what's best. And I was like, well, my God. So I fell asleep with that. So I probably have like a bunch of just wrong information rattling around in my brain. Thank you again, Habley. We got Demo Nacho. Dropping three flipping gift subs. Thank you very much, Demo Nacho. Demo Nacho is giving you the short one, Miss Jupiter, and then Actor Boy 52. Thank you, Demo Nacho. Then we finally got Tiny Lil Liza dropping a gift sub to Tony with a bunch of numbers. Thank you so much. Oh, y'all, Primal Hope just got home from work. Everybody, welcome on in, Primal Hope. They've had a long day. Please, someone present them some cake. Oh, speaking of emotes, because we have a cake emote, um, I'm going to re upload a different version later. Um, 
wait a minute is it not working oh there we go yes um we do have two new uh animated emotes from our very own lola chan um one is the blow a kiss goodbye and the other one is like anime laughter um lola chan is gonna uh you know slap together a different version that where you can see the ha 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 and the anime laughter uh, a little bit better if you're especially if you're in dark mode of twitch if you are in the dark twitch you will see all that there is to see um so yeah um i'm very stoked about that well done lola chan thank you very much for the excellent work um and your patience because i kept forgetting to respond to emails <laughs> um but i love it isn't that fun i love it quite a bit so we'll get a different version up um in a little bit um i haven't checked my email maybe they've already got it here i don't know and we got the deer king who is mostly a lurker but saying hi deer king welcome to you welcome on in thanks for saying hey dark mode best mode you know tana dance I'm, I'm very much like, you know, whatever someone wants to do. For Twitch, I really like dark mode because it's not beaming in my eyes while I'm like playing a game. What I will say is it, it drives me nuts when I post a screenshot of something where I'm like, look at this thing I saw on Instagram. And then I get so many random messages where it's like, you, you do light mode on this one. And I'm just like, yeah, man, like you don't have to look at it. I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it. You're fine. You're fine. Um, oh, bloodlust buns. That's a really nice message. Um, about my voice thank you um for anyone who is not able to see chat because you're watching on youtube in the future hi thanks so much for watching um i am now uploading my vods to youtube uh with a little bit of a delay um no editing no nothing just they're there so thanks for watching i really do appreciate it um it's very 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 nice of y'all to watch it and i'm glad that it's helping people out because a lot of people are like yeah for whatever reason i can't watch on twitch later so youtube is nice and it's like great um so that's really fun and so thanks for everything y'all i mean the first video is already at i don't know 112k or something like that it was kind of crazy and I, I love it um so thank you um and to everybody who's been giving like time codes in the comments too that's awesome thank you for a couple of them i did say like a hey, actual stream starts here you know but it's it's very nice when people do that so thank you i should actually go back and pin those comments i'm learning youtube very quickly trial by fire you know what i mean um but it's been very nice so thank you um and also something i didn't expect was um uh the ad revenue is a thing because of course it is but i didn't expect it so um i'm going to donate a big old chunk of that uh first video's ad revenue to um the fire relief efforts in maui um so when i do that i'll post that it happened and then probably post a link as well if you want to also do that um up to you um, and you also don't have to wait for me, but obviously the fires in Maui have been bonkers, crazy cuckoo bananas, insane. A um, lot of destruction there and a lot of people who have been displaced in a scenario that it was already super unfair and unkind to them. Um, it sucks because, I, you know, uh, native people of Hawaii or just people who straight up live there have been saying for a long time, like, hey, please don't come here for a while. We're actually having a really hard time. And then people were like, Bleh. like when my friend came to visit, um, she was like, in the airport on her way here and saw a big old group of people boarding for Hawaii. And it was literally like the day after the fires. And I was like, damn, like, I know what it's probably like to think like, oh, I have to end my vacation, but like, but damn, any hoozle. So that's gonna happen. So keep an eye out for that on the Instas. Um, Tiny little Isaac gifting to Tony. I already read that. Thank you very much. Happily, thank you for dropping 500 bits. Appreciate you a lot. That was very, very kind of you um thank you so much i will be um starting the game pretty soon here y'all i'll just read out what we already have i do see that there are some tips i'll of course read them out once i'm actually in game so thank you for that hi damien i finally been binged my happy marriage and i've been loving it you did amazing kudos as a dream boat thank you ghost kid i appreciate that i've been so proud of it um i don't know how many more episodes there are of this season but it's still a weekly release on wednesdays obviously i'm trying to let sword af have its its time but it's, it means a lot that people have been watching um my happy marriage so thank you very much um and we got Kayla Macaroni dropping 15 flipping gift subs. Um, thank you very much, Kayla Macaroni. I appreciate you. Kayla Macaroni is gifting to Simon Smiles, Jared Wagner, Charles Rich, uh, Freudian Theory, Psyduck Psy, uh, Sunkin, uh, Noctalia, Kaylee, uh, Castile is the son. There we go. I got there. Uh, Kaki, Kaki, no. Is it Kaki? No, it's Kai, 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 Kai. There we go. Um, Debbie. <laughs> Delby, Natalie, Zachariah, A, it's Kelly, Baron Rays, and then Timochi. That's the, I think that's maybe the worst I've ever done reading names so far today. 
um that's wild so um it has a 12 episode season well great that's good to know um sort of getting censored is a bit funny ha 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 says jonesy is sort of getting censored but someone just wrote sort of and just now the most recent sort of episode good and thank you bear famous i appreciate that how many of y'all were in the um live premiere um where we were you know wednesday morning my time wednesday morning we were hanging out and chatting it was a delight to watch people get certain reveals at that moment because I had been waiting on those for a while. I'm like, I'm gonna do this and then jerk you in this direction, and then pull you in this direction, and then pull you back in this direction. And it was just wild watching people go like, oh, oh my God, it was lovely. Hey, so many people, yay. I made you cry. I'm sorry. Well, thank you. Um, It's Barzupal dropping five flipping guess subs. Um, thank you very much. It's Barzupal. Appreciate you. Gifting to Zephyrina, Lau AZP, Cassiandra, uh, Matt Sunin, and then Fred Sturdley. Greatly appreciate that. Thank you, Barzupal. That's a really fun name to say it. Your description of the dream was amazing. Thank you, Demo Nacho. I appreciate it. I think that episode might be my favorite. It really might be. Not to say that there's anything wrong with the other episodes, but that one's just, I'm, I love it. And then finally, we got Habley dropping five flippin' gift subs. Thank you for all the sub bombs today, y'all. Um, happily gifting to too much spaghetti, Ice Lord Sane, a crystal garden in your skull, a Jizio, and then Brotography. Study Brotography. Only photograph people uplifting other people. See, it's not toxic. We're nice bros now. Tiarna is also gifting to Joffy and then Paperclip Cookies. Thank you, Tiarna. Appreciate you. Genocide official dropping 100 bits. Um, Oh, that's so funny. That's awesome. Um, thank you very much. And then Lil Kate's dropping 100 bits. Appreciate you, Lil Kate's. All right, y'all. I am going to get hopping in this game pretty soon. Again, we will get you all caught up. Thank you for all the sub bombs. The hype train is still going strong. I'm certainly not going to cut you off, but we can talk about it while uh, the streaming stuff happens. So thank you. Delby Sun Jackson says hi. Everybody say hi to Jackson. Hi, Jackson. Son Jackson, son of Delby. Uh, offspring of Gormak the Butcher. Um, Nadan, 273, 237. There we go. Dropping two gift subs to uh, Frosta Tratut. And then the Jabberwock. Oh, die, Jabberwock, die. I was reading it German. Someone doesn't like the Jabberwock. <laughs> Does Brillig and the Slithy Toves did Gyre and Jimble in the wave? On Mimsy where the Boar Groves and the Mom Rats out grave. You don't like Lewis Carroll, my guy? What's wrong with Lewis Carroll through the looking glass? Jabberwock. They Jabberwocked. So you could jabber run. Um, we've also got a few more new subscribers. Everybody, please give a spicy. Clever Coop, welcome to Just Click Lol Live. Uh, S Clementine Rose, Logic Sequence, Huntressia, Autumn Jaguar, Donuts Make Life, uh, Ciara Jean, it's Mimsy. All oh, Mimsy were the Bora Groves like the Jabberwock. We know it now. Um, uh, Nemi Emmy, and then that's all the newbies. All right, y'all. He kills the Jabberwock in the poem. Yeah, but he's not rude about it. His Vorpal Blade went snicker snack, as they say. And I'm assuming that's pretty quick. If a Vorpal Blade went to me, I don't think I'd have much time to think about like, hmm, hmm, what do I think? Hmm, what happened? No, it'd just be like, Psh. like that's what snicker snack means to me. It's like, Psh. and then all of a sudden he's galomphing back with his head, carrying it back to everybody. I'm assuming it's just like, pow. Whereas if you're like, die, Jabberwock, die. Like you missed your mark. You're, you brought your butter knife instead of your sword and you're just like, ah, da, ah, da, da. Uh, do you consider the Jabberwock he's a dragon? Um, I think it has dragon, uh, dra draconic elements. Um, I wouldn't say it's a traditional dragon. I, I see it almost more in my mind, like a cockatrice, um, sort of uh, dragony, lizardy, bird-like. Yeah. I think it's the kind of thing where it's not like a huge dragon, but it's big enough to be a problem where it's like, I don't want to deal with it. Like if we're talking like ostrich sized, but it's kind of dragony, I'm like, hmm. Mm, I'm all set. No, thank you. Uh, I will call in the professionals. Um, the, the Beamish boy with his Vorpal Blade. Um, all right. I feel like you'd be using it in the American McGee's game versions. Oh, yeah. What a cool concept that was. What a cool concept. Oh, you thought I was talking about the jam dance crew? You know what? That's normal, though. That's That makes sense. Amy Vorpal. I know the name. I know the name. And that I'm assuming that's where the name comes from, unless that's their birth name. I don't, I don't know. Just raise Lewis Carroll from the dead and ask. You know what? I don't know if that's where I'd use my 
raise one from the dead or maybe i would maybe i would do a completely inconsequential like you know what hey what did you think about when uh you saw the jabberwocky and you're like oh it's just like a big old monster and i'll be like okay thanks and then back in they go to the grave unless they were cremated instead it's like <laughs> um we also got wendell weed wizard subscribing for the first time a very spicy clever coop welcome to you all right y'all thanks so much for joining if you are new here again you don't have to do any of those things they're very nice i appreciate it you don't have to do it just make sure the only thing i ask is keep the rules because the mods work so hard and the mods have everyday lives as well and i have suddenly decided to stream like twice as much and they're just like bet we'll be here which is really nice so make their jobs easy just make sure you keep the rules we're a really chill community so you know the no backseat gaming thing too is a, is a tough one for this specific genre of streams i get it and sometimes so there's a difference for me when i'm just like where do i go i don't even know where to go right now that's just me vocalizing where my head is at but then other times i'll be like hey chat i'm lost as hell can i jump from this thing to that thing or am i missing something big right now and then that's when i really need i'll say chat you who chat um crispy shin first time joining well thank you very much appreciate you welcome on and then we got kristen caddy subscribing for the first time a very spicy clever coop welcome to you thank you very much also if you are a new subscriber you're able to join in on the discord so hang out with us in between streams do your thing are you gonna do armored core or wait a bit longer for starfield so in the creed we just talked about that i don't know because i feel like we've been in a game drought for like a while now where like one thing will come out and we're like yeah it's the one thing and we're all gonna play it and then everybody gets to talk to it talk about it and even if you're not playing it you at least get to like talk about it to your friends or get tiktoks about it and right now the fact that armored core starfield and baldur's gate are all going to be sort of coming out at the same time close enough that it's like a problem i'm just like oh my god i don't i don't know what i'm gonna do yet i will say when i guess armored core came out today but when starfield comes out it's gonna be midway through like a week that i have off which is cool because i forgot that that was even a thing um so maybe i'll stream more maybe we'll do you know alternate days i don't know i don't know but tell you what i'm gonna go ahead and hop into this game here little kates thank you for the 200 bits asking uh i'm going to my first comic-con tomorrow any advice yeah i do have some advice um take care of yourself it can get a little overwhelming at cons i'm neurodivergent and have anxiety issues and like one time i was just like running around the con and someone actually stopped me and this was before i was like in any way recognizable and they were like hey man are you doing okay and i was like yeah why and i like took stock of myself my breathing rate was up i was sweaty everywhere i might have been having a mild panic attack i don't know but I don't do great around a bunch of people with the heat. So like, take those breaks, get water. Finding a bit of cool merch is nice. It's not worth, you know, getting yourself hurt, feeling sick, whatever. Um, are you getting Starfield on September 1st or waiting for the wide release? I didn't even know that was a thing. I thought it was September 6th, the Manium Davis. No idea, no idea. Oh, Pax Kryptonia, you're liking Armored Core so far? I mean, it's a FromSoft game. So anyone who doesn't know what that means, um, we built this uh, stream community by playing uh, Soulsborne games, Dark Souls, Demon Souls, Bloodborne, all that good stuff. Uh, that's how I sort of got my start. And that's something I'm very passionate about. And I love it. Armored Core is being made by the same people. So it might be like robot mech suit Dark Souls, which sounds awesome. And I don't want to get too in my head and excited about that. Um, we were born of darkness, says Wayward Jaybird. Hey, what's up, Wayward Jaybird? we got our mods um thanks for being here wayward jaybird i know uh 10 15 elvis i was thinking the same thing we built the city on rock and roll i was like i might sing it i'm not gonna sing it all right y'all so um time for us to hop into the game now i did connect my larian account to this game which means y'all are now actually able to see the twitch extension um if you're not seeing it on your page once i load up the game maybe you'll have to refresh again i haven't loaded up the game yet um but basically you'll be able to um see what i have in my inventory see my character stats so when anyone's like who what kind of guy are you what kind of items you got like you'll just be able to see it and i think that's pretty cool so uh thanks for reminding me mods um what's funny is i actually did that at work today uh and then you messaged me and i was like ah, great minds great minds um all righty y'all so before i hop into the game here I do have to ask. Oh, Jonesy, it's your first Baldur's Gate stream. We will get you caught up just fine. Don't you even worry. Um, it, it'll be a quick one. Um, so before I hop into the game, we do have a tradition around here, all you newbies, where I ask a question of the day. And that question is, who do we have 
the chat today. We got Nick Noctalia, Shibugi Alarm Pants, Waver Jaybird, Cakes Capesk, Shibugi Alarm Pants, uh, 1015 Elvis. We got Katie Marie, Tiana uh, GACP, Curve Rito. We got Sam Saint Sam. Uh, we got Crispy Shin, Danksy Dam, I Am Bradical, Penguin Utopia, Jay Newcomb, Austin Nix, Shea Cupcake, or excuse me, Shea Cakes, um, Game Player, uh, Demo Nacho, uh, Cheyenne is trying, Loud the Small Ghost, Nadan. We got Confused Reese, Ghoulie Hubby, Bats for Brains, Bats for Brains, Lady Alma, Future uh, Rabies Victim. Uh, we've got X Ratete, Ratet. Um, we've got Tiana. I already read that. Uh, we got Sprout, Baby, Awkward Octopus, Zoe B, Lake Sharks. We got uh, Stacy Eight Four Four Gaming, Majestic Oatmeal, Ashley Terry Styles, uh, Tinkerbell, Florneon, Silent Cry, Kayla Macaroni, White Wolf Fan, Indigo. Uh, we got Milady Katie, uh, Splatana. We've got Clary Leo. Uh, what's up to Astra Tigris? What's up to a Mediocre Maven? Sabo with a bunch of numbers. Brooklyn Mode. Uh, what's up to Demon of Parks? Uh, Prince. Waiki, uh, again, M127, Butterfly69, Ness, uh, Arsenic Plums, Eerie Medusa, Isley Moon, Dylan Lantos, uh, what's up to Dark Princess, Kimmy Cola, uh, Jade Rose, Rachel the Lomacorn, Alex Daw, Dark Michiko, Skylar Babes, what's up to, uh, Miss Joe W, Gabbis, we got Queen of the Crow, Tiny Loliza, Nick Michelle, Blood Cutie, uh, Adelia Bedelia, F Farm Boy, we got Angels Will Fly, Bad Wolf, uh, what's up to, uh, Castile is the Sun, Undeserved Capybara, Arrows is Law, too many to count! That's right, y'all. There are too many people here for science to count. They don't have enough numbers for that. But tell you what, we're going to keep challenging them by having this community grow as it's been doing so much. And I really appreciate it. And I love that. Um, but if I didn't say hi to you right off the bat, I'm sure I'll say hi to you at some point during the stream. Just make sure you peep those rules. Make things easy for the mods. Be kind to each other. Be chill with the backseat gaming and wait until I specifically ask, hey, chat, I am confused. As opposed to just thinking aloud, you know? Um, but yeah, let's hop on to the, let's hop on to this here game. So how many people we got here that are completely new, um, that have never played the Baldur's Gate? The Baldur's Gate. The Baldur's Gate. And again, um, you should probably be able to see the game overlay now. Uh, never played it, never played it. So I'm, I'm confused. Uh, sorry, not, uh, not confused. I'm curious uh, who hasn't seen the streams either. Bloody Bella, first stream I've made it to. Well, welcome on in. Welcome on in. You're just as welcome here as everybody else. And again, I'll start reading tips in a minute. I see I'm 23 minutes behind. Sorry. I just wanted to chat with the community. I'm so curious why it looks so much better in my VODs and on my like preview screen than my actual screen. I'm just so curious. Oh, I can't change the refresh rate. I'm just, I just want to see if there's anything better I can do with fancy graphics. Fancy graphics. Any better graphics in here? Gotta love that music. <laughs> High lighting, ultra lighting. Um, po oh, you know what it is? It's the post processing is what it is. It's the post processing is what it is. Anti -alias aliasing, um, Nvidia deal. I mean. Let's get that. Let's get that balance between quality and performance. That's exactly what I want. God rays. We got the bloom. We got everything. I think that actually that might really help. Um. All right, y'all. Currently at 100 hours. Okay, so Hannah Noel knows what's up. Um. <laughs> so this is the game of Baldur's Gate 3. Basically, it is built off of D and D. Uh, 5e systems so when you're like this is kind of like dnd it's exactly like dnd to the point where like oh you're trying to do a sleight of hand check roll the dice oh you're better at that because you have better sleight of hand and you have charisma so you can persuade them so that's what we're dealing with right now so this is our main guy his name is damien we started off as a druid we ended up making him instead a bard because i didn't love the way druid was playing at this point in the game um even though they have their perks um, so we and everyone in our party here were kidnapped by illithids, also known as uh, um, Mind Flayers. Mind Flayers are a big old spooky monster in D&D, and apparently they're a thing in Stranger Things as well, that which I didn't know. Um, so that's neat. But uh, we were captured by them, and they implanted little parasites in our brain. Now, those parasites are what turn people into, I keep wanting to say nonaloids, um, into Mind Flayers. That's how they reproduce. Not good, not good. But for some reason, this whole group, everybody has had these things implanted in their brain and we're not turning yet. And that's weird and unusual. So we're trying to find out why that is. We're trying to make our way to someone, anyone who can heal us. And everybody's got different ideas. You know, Lazel's like, we have to find my people. We have to find my people in a, in a crèche. 
are people live in what is called a creche, and they can help you, and then Paul's and the druids like, mm, I can't do that myself, but I do know someone who can. And, you know, this guy's like, I like magic. So what we ended up doing last time I played was um, using the three people that I don't usually use in battle, pulling them into my party and deciding, you know what? We're gonna completely change up their um, class. Like Gale is a wizard. That's great, no. Gale. I'm happy for you. Don't get me wrong. I'm stoked for you. But what else can we make him? I want him to be a wizard of a different kind. To new horizons. Austin Nix, yes. So we do have the Baldur's Gate 3 companion. So now you should be able to, theoretically, um, where's, we're looking for a specific NPC over here. You should be able to um, mouse over the screen and sort of see what I'm working with in my inventory and with my character class and all that good stuff. So if you just hop in and you're like, what, what kind of guy are you? You know, you already know. How many companions are in that game? 10, 15, Elvis? I don't know. I know we already killed one because she was our enemy. And if we did an evil run, we could have had her help us. I don't know um, how many people there are like that. So far we found, I think seven. Ah, this is another. Withers. Um, he's a little Thy crunchy. Has been That's okay. Recorded. He hasn't met Gale yet, the wizard. Camp. But we're going to change oh, up his whole vibe. Of my services. Um, can you help me change As my class? Desire. So Gale is a wizard. We got to make him a different wizard. I'm curious about Necromancer, TBH. So we're going to do wizard. Um, we're going to choose the cantrips he wants. If you're new to D&D, cantrips are spells that don't take up. You, know, you can usually only cast a few spells per day, depending. Um, these don't take spell slots. You can just do it. You can just do them whenever. So let's take a look here. Bone chill. We've got fireball. We're gonna need that fireball. Poison spray is always cool. Um, shocking grasp is cool. Why isn't it showing me damage? That's weird. Um, friends, you can like charm someone. True strike is also good. Um, though not for a wizard necessarily in, in his vibe. Minor illusion, dancing lights. Um, I think probably acid splash. So you throw a bubble. So that's an AOE that you throw. That's interesting to me. Versus Shocking Grasp, which is close. You know what? Shocking Grasp is close. I think we should use that. Spells. Um, what kind of spells can we get? We have uh, Witch Bolt, which we've never really once used. Um, I'm going to take away Witch Bolt. We don't need that, but we do get Magic Missile, which is something that we haven't used yet, which is always very important. Hmm. Yeah, so uh, please forgive me that this is going to take a minute, y'all. I just want to uh, make some cool stuff. I want to make some cool stuff with these new character vibes. Um, he also has Featherfall. Um, Austin Nix dropping five more gift subs. Thank you very much, Austin Nix. Appreciate you gifting the Crispy Shin, Trident with a bunch of numbers, Brenny Lax, Maniac, uh, Ma Maniacal Sage, and then Amethyst Rose. Thank you so very much. You know what? I actually think Enhanced Leap is going to help us quite a bit. Um, I think maybe instead of Sleep, I would probably enjoy Fog Cloud. Let's do Enhanced Leap, just to be fun. Um, and then Abilities. Uh, we want a bonus to our Intelligence. Maybe I could do even... We do cast off Intelligence. Maybe I could do one less Constitution. I know that's dangerous for me, but like... Hey, I like living on the edge. Oh, I can't do that. All right, well, we're done. Great. Changing his proficiencies, though, he is going to be better in what? He's already good in Arcana, which is magic stuff. He's good in Persuasion, which is kind of fine and cool. Um, you know what? Maybe Gale knows more about... He knows magic and history. He should probably know religion, too, right? Wouldn't that make sense? Gale doesn't need Persuasion. Gale needs religion in his life, I guess. Um, cool. We're going to confirm that. First playthrough. Uh, yes, Elhan Hassos. Um, we, I did a little bit of early access, but then, you know, so I know this is a little bit housekeepy at the beginning. We'll get into the major gameplay soon. We just made our way to the, uh, the forge in the Underdark, which is a spooky area. And we are trying to track down a cultist that a lot of people aren't happy with. There are like three different, um, quests that sort of got us over to here. So subclash, uh, subclass. So right now, Gale does evocation. Evocation spells focus elemental energy into powerful attacks and enchantments. Those who specialize in the school are known as evokers. Learning evocation spells from scrolls only costs you 25 gold per spell, not 50. That's fancy. But there are all these other ones. Abjuration, they summon wards, banish enemies, nullify magic. So this is all protecty and defendy. We got Necromancer, which 
probably we're gonna try out um get to raise the dead that's always neat um we've got conjuration where you get to uh summon creatures and objects or banish them in space that's neat enchantment um you add different things to things around you like that sword is all fiery now divination you get to change time and all that stuff that's kind of sick illusion you fool people and then finally transmutation you're gonna change a pumpkin into a bird um that's my vibe but i want to try necromancy because it just sounds kind of cool so what kind of spells can we get now um obviously we're gonna want find familiar so we can summon a little creature um a little creature friend and then also ray of sickness sounds kind of cool but we should probably do something a little bit more helpful to us i've done a lot of damagey spells shield increases your armor class by five i mean that's kind of awesome um expeditious retreats color spray blinds enemies long strider none of these are particularly awesome i'll do a uh, feather fall Help out. wizard level three let's go um oh boy we're starting to learn a bunch of things so first of all knock is a great spell you get to automatically unlock something super uh important to unlock that being said switch and hold person hold person is really good um and we've already got a rogue that can pick a bunch of locks but he's not on our team right now i just realized that hold up everyone he's not on our team um we should instead enlarge slash reduce that's awesome yeah you know what i'm gonna have gail be a lot more just like helpful in general just oh purely like helpful spells you know what i mean um let's see magic missile is important i don't i don't think he needs thunder wave right now and i don't think he needs we already have someone with feather fall so let's give him find familiar oh he already has those level twos find familiar and let's do um enhanced leap that'll be good cool boom one or two more thing or one or two more levels and then we'll make him a proper necromancer we're gonna do this for a couple more people and then we're good to go so sorry it's taking a minute give me a minute just give me a minute we have more cantrips which again we can just cast whenever we feel like it how neat is that for all of us um blade ward is good that protects us more spells don't mind if i do uh let's see I think maybe now we, what do we want? Misty Step for a little bit of Teleporto, Telepotato. Oh, Scorching Ray is also awesome, but we're gonna be getting a better spell real soon. Um, Misty Step is good as is, what do we want? What do we want? There's too many options and people are watching. People are watching and I know that they're there. I know that they're watching me. Do, do, do. Uh, uh, excuse me <laughs> excuse me ice lord sane is asking a great question how did you get over your first time dm jitters when you uh started sword af what to dive in uh want to dive in but i have a bad hesitation with it well i'll say this uh ice lord sane i was extremely nervous i didn't really get over the jitters the point is i kind of just it was like a do or die situation like it's a thing i wanted to do and that i know i could do at the end of the day so i did it um scary easier said than done but i still felt good about what i did and um you know at the end of the day everybody else is on your team they want you to do well they really do so why not you know if, if you fail a little bit your friends will be there to pick you up you all have the same goal of um things going well and i will say like to be fair to myself and to your expectations like i've been studying improv and doing things by you know flying by the seat of my pants for like a very long time um oh we finally get to animate dead hells yeah hells yeah um oh blink is great too pain death fireball i mean i think we kind of got to do fireball I think we kind of got a new fireball hypnotic pattern lightning bolt god lightning bolt is just as good as fireball oh that's so good uh deck save versus deck save i don't i don't see the difference other than fire versus lightning damage I don't want to do that lightning. Oh, wait, remove curse. That also seems like it's going to be kind of important. Slow is also very important, I think. Getting to, like, slow an enemy, that seems kind of sick. 
but probably we're gonna want to do a lightning bolt as well except okay we're finally good what's up nick meyer you're telling me these balls are gay i don't even know what that i don't quite get the joke yet but you're welcome here y'all nick is a good friend of mine what is up nick everybody please show, show nick some love um nick is a handsome mother goose you may know him from tiktok you may know him from the cloak shoots you may know him from his own twitch streams um nick thanks for popping in my friend um hope you're doing well we are uh, obviously playing some Baldur's gate today what i'm doing at the start of this here stream is um uh changing up everybody's class because i've just sort of let them be all like kind of vanilla you know compared to what they could be right now um and that's silly of me to do i could be doing so much more so i am um but thanks for popping in my friend good to see you um all right y'all i think it's about time for me to so I, anyway um ice lord saying i hope that was helpful in your question um let's also deck out gale now he's a proper necromancer he's gonna need some cool necromancer vibes um don't spam omg i'm sorry uh hi i love you Dave. oh you're good nick don't don't you worry i mean well don't worry about uh, things on my end if you're if you're uncomfortable with the attention so it goes you say what you need or don't need but point is here you're good to go we're on your team buddy um all right nature snare that looks better uh he's not proficient with those bludgeoning weapons um actually let's sort real quick because i know we got that witch staff we got that whole witch staff situation yeah we're gonna want to do the staff of crones right so i'm gonna staff of crones here nick kroll yes it's our it's our dear friend nick kroll it's like mm, hi everyone i'm doing the girl voice that i do and you're like that's not really that close but i guess i do still find you funny it's like i know um witch staff haha <laughs> non-alcoholic gin the witch staff the staff of witches um whenever the wearer is healed their weapon becomes coated in magic eh, we're not going to be hitting people that much with our way up homes but i guess we might as well try um protection from evil and good from the ever seeing eye that's kind of sick yeah we'll just, we'll just wear all these goodies um we also want to take all these goodies to learn skills a bunch of skills and battlings um any better armor for you my guy my wizard friends my lovable wizard friend blazer of benevolence ah yes that one's entirely made for bards which he's not but you know what giving it to him wait what does sorrow do oh sorrow's way better why would i ever why would i ever not use sorrow huh. uh, folks i think we're using sorrow um cool focus stride um he's not proficient with his armor fine 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 all right so we're gonna equip him real quick just get him all ripped out just get them all dripped out boom gail's got a spear mother father you're in trouble now learn that spell you got this um you did it you learn it now uh all right does everyone feel more or less caught up on everything in terms of like how to what this flipping game is and what our goals are as soon as we actually you know enter the the battles as soon as we enter the battles you will see um you will see exactly what this game is. Brave sickness. Yeah, we don't need that. Yeah, it's cool. Cool. Uh, to camp you go. I died doing the first fight. I'm ashamed. Uh, so Siren, Sirena Rose or Siren Arose. I'm not sure which. Um, there's nothing to be ashamed of there. Actually, the beginning of this game is a little tricky, especially if you're not super familiar with it. Um, and guess what? That's okay. Guess what? You're allowed to fail sometimes. You're safe. All right, great. So that's Gale. Now he's a necromancer. We love to see it. We love to see it. Um, we're going to swap to a different character in a second here um, because we deserve it. Gosh dang it. We deserve it. Um, now we got Shadowheart. She is our cleric, but I think we can probably make her a little better. And that's Halzen. He's our new druid boy, but we can't even use him yet. Um, all right. We have got Moon Escape drop in. Six, six, six. Box, box, box. Thank you very much, Moon Escape. Um, and they just say, mm. there's just a smile emoji. So thank you, Moon Escape. I appreciate you. Ah, I literally thought he said, ah, mother. Ah, mother. Thy name has been recorded. Hi, mommy. I shall be here in thy camp 
for whenever thou hast need. Oh, Nick, if you are still in chat, I do see that you are texting in the group chat. I will get back to you soon. I always stream on Sundays, but maybe I can stream a little later. So she is currently a cleric, but again, God, I love that you can make anybody anything. I kind of want to make her a monk. I kind of just want her to beat the hell out of people. <sighs> but we need a cleric. We do need a cleric. But, oh God, she could be a paladin though. Ooh, she could be a paladin though. How about that? Let's, what, what are her subclasses? Again, she's trickery domain right now, which I always find so interesting. So clerics, if you're not familiar with D&D, you may think of them as like holy people of the cloth. They are trying to, you know, heal you through the power of light and good. But no, a cleric is just a devotee of, of, a of like a specific deity and they focus so hard on their learning and their training that they end up actually being able to do all the stuff. So something like um, the knowledge domain, you know, they're all about intellect and being smart little geese. War domain, they're basically pad uh, paladins i don't know why to think tempest domain you're basically a wizard okay and this one you're basically a druid okay i'm starting to see why we would be maybe just a normal <laughs> trickery domain or life domain cleric honestly life domain so she's just full-on heals you heals you heals you i don't hate that let's also look at what paladin would look like um oath of the ancients for paladin um you fight on the side of light in the cosmic struggle against darkness to preserve the sanctity of life and the beauty of nature Oath of Devotion! Following the idea of the knight in shining armor, you act with honor and virtue to protect the weak and pursue the greater good. Boring. Or Oath of Vengeance. You have set aside even your own purity to right wrongs and deliver justice to those who have committed the most grievous of sins. All right, so that's a little bit holy war. I don't know about that one for me. Um, Let's go ahead and say... I'm going to keep her with Cleric for now, and we're going to try Life Domain. I think Life Domain would actually be kind of interesting for her. Yeah. Yeah, let's uh, let's try that. Cool. Abilities. She casts with Wisdom, and she definitely needs Strength and a little bit of Constitution. Charisma? I don't know why Charisma's up here. Charisma doesn't really do anything for Clerics, right? This is just so she's not, like, spitting on someone when she talks. I think that'd be fine to take away some of that and give her a little bit more... um. Honestly, strength. Or actually, mm, wisdom. Oh, we can't boost wisdom right now. Damn. We can give her strength, though. I mean, that kind of seems good to me. Uh, she's got history. She's got religion. She's got medicine. I guess medicine is a good one for her. Yeah. Okay, great. So we're good. All right. Now we got her. Thanks, everybody, for popping in tonight. I know there's a lot of people watching, and I know it's not the most action y thing right now, but we're going to get there. Don't you worry. We're just completely rechanging everybody's vibe. Takes him. Um, all right. More hit points, and now we get to have more spells. Your ally cannot be targeted until you attack or harm a creature. Oh, but we're going to be doing that all the time. Austin Nix, thank you for dropping 10 flipping bucks. I appreciate you, Oodles. You inspire me to keep going even when I have a rough day. I thank you so much. So, Austin Nix, I really appreciate you, and that's very, very nice. I do want to say to you what I say to everybody. If I can help inspire you in some capacity, that's awesome, and I'm happy to hear that. But your decision to keep going for another day, that's already in you. You can see you can see a bird walking down the street and be like, oh my God, nature is beautiful. And that can be what inspires you. But you're still making the choice to do it. And the strength is yours. So if there's a day where I'm not streaming, if there's a day where I say something on stream and you're like, oh man, that bums me out. Like, you know, point being, you don't have to tie yourself to me in, in so much. Like I'm honored, but I'm just saying like, give yourself some credit, right? Because you're doing the thing. You're doing the thing and that's, actually awesome it's actually incredible um if you're feeling low and you choose to still be here and, and hang out you're amazing you're amazing truly you did it and you are here um and i'm stoked that you're here so protect a creature from attacks increase its armor class by two protect ally against attacks from aberrations celestials elementals faith fiends and the undead we haven't seen too many of those yet i will say inflict wounds versus guiding bolts maybe we would do I just want create water. Create water seems so important, as well as command. Commanding a creature is very important, too. Um, I don't need the evil and good stuff yet. We'll be protected in other ways. Bet Novice, I appreciate you very much saying you helped me a lot with my own stuff. Hope I can inspire you back one day. But you already do, Bet Novice. Like, I may not know who you are. I may not have seen your name in chat before because you're a first-time chatter. But that's kind of my point, is, like, we are all going through tough times. 
we are all dealing with individual things that other people may never know in our in our specific you know life stories right but you're here and that's pretty sick and i think you can be very 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 proud of that um oh spiritual weapon we get to just have a special weapon next to us that's fighting all the time how can she only have a few weapons prepared I mean, excuse me, how could she only have a few different uh, skills prepared when they all seem so damn good? Uh, prayer of healing can only be used outside of combat. Mm -hmm. Warding bond, uh, they gain resistance and help and all that good stuff. Protection from poison. Uh, enhance ability. I mean, that's cool, too. It's all really cool. I like all of it. I guess I don't need inflict wounds and guiding bolt. That's the problem. I really like inflict wounds. It's so good, but like... We don't need it. She's our cleric. We don't need to do inflict wounds. Let's do... Do warding bond. I think she's just going to go full protector mode. And a cantrip. Yes, new cantrip just dropped. Produce flame. That's always interesting. You can always just do that on somebody. Um, in fact, yeah. I'm going to do that. Prayer spells. We already got it. Eats. Okay, so she needs a good feed. I think having her be Sentinel is probably good because Sentinel allows her to, like, attack haters when they get close to her or try to attack other friendos, and I don't think there's anything else we would need unless... Ooh, wait. Heavy Armor Master. Will she be able to wear heavy armor now? Question, do clerics like her already have proficiency in heavy armor? Now I am asking you, chat. This is a backseat gaming moment. Warcaster? Oh, in all caps, says Thalia the Tree. Okay, I will check out Warcaster. You gain advantage on saving throws to maintain concentration on a spell. You can also use a reaction to cast Shocking Grasp. Okay, so that's like Sentinel, but better. You're right. Um, so we're going to do that. We're going to do that instead. Thank you for the heads up. Finally, level five. Life clerics do, others do not. Oh, so we do have heavy armor proficiency as a life cleric. That's really interesting to know. Okay. Um, preparing spells. We now have level three spells. I so wish we could get more spells. It's insane to me that she does not have truly that many spells. Um, protection from energy. Uh, remove curse is probably going to be important. Call forth spirits to protect you. Nearby enemies take radiant damage or necrotic damage per turn, and their movement speed is half. That's kind of incredible. Um, daylight. Oh, mass healing word. Heal up to six allies. That's going to be probably very important. Mass healing word. And then who do we not need? We already have whole person somewhere. Let's do let's do remove curse too. That could that could come up. We're just going full healer. All right. So now she's good to go. Um, we can swap out her weapons in a minute here which we actually should do real quick thanks again for your patience y'all patience y'all we will get to proper gameplay soon um all righty um we've got now curve rito dropping three dollars i say now that was an hour ago i'm sorry and again for anyone who said this too earlier like i do take my sweet time getting to the tips because i want to be able to talk to chat outside of that as well hope that makes sense hope that's understandable and if not i don't know um <laughs> I guess it maybe isn't the nicest response, but, um, ooh, there is that really strong extra morning star situation. Weapon enchantment plus one. This one does necrotic damage to everyone, including the wielder, but we have resistance to it. I'm curious enough to try it. I am curious enough to try it. We can have this thing. We definitely need a shield. This one is kind of okay, I guess. I think we need, uh, do we already have a crossbow? We do. Um, better armor, saving throws and checks, dex for dexterity, sure. Undead creatures get radiant damage, that's even better. That makes sense for her, we're good. Um, uh, I'm gonna actually hold on to that just in case. Oh, spears are good for her. She does fine with spears, that's actually kind of sick. Maybe that's better. I think that might be better for her. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and go with that then, maybe. Yeah, she can't do swords. She can do an axe. Chance to inflict upon the target a penalty roll. The attacker's HP is whatever, then whatever. Um, hmm. Hmm. I'm going to have you wear what I have you wear. 
Whenever the wear is healed. Okay, well, that's going to be good for her. Um, I'm going to have you have this good old spear. Nice. Um, so Curvrito says, Hey, Damien, I'm sick this time around and I've been trying to push through so I can meet deadlines for things. Oh, Curvrito, I'm sorry. I know it's way easier said than done, and I know I'm the last one to take this advice, but like, you know, theoretically, if you're sick, maybe it's better to let yourself just relax for a little bit not have to worry about being sick and then you can actually heal up and then you get to like you know not, not be sick later sooner faster harder better faster stronger you know what i mean and i know i'm preaching the choir and i know i don't take my own advice but we're talking about you right now Curvito. okay we're talking about you right now um okay dang we really are light on armor for people that we don't really work with too much um necrotic damage is halved okay well that's fine We'll be fine. Everything's fine. Um, all right. We got her going. We're good to go with her. We get it. We got it. We go with that. Um, and then we increase there. There we go. Now we can actually see what we're doing. Nice. Um, and then finally, we got Lazel, who we're going to switch real quick. Lazel is currently a fighter, and the fighters are really strong. And I kind of like her build right now, but I, out of sheer curiosity, I'm going to see what it'd be like if Lazel was something else. Ah, I show you is in my camp. It is. For whenever thou hast need of my service, as thou desire. All right, so she is currently a fighter, and she's damn good at it. My question is, we don't have anybody who's been a paladin, and we don't have anybody who's been a monk. And I know a monk is a super big shift in vibe for her. Um, but it might be kind of cool. Because her cantrips are just battling, battling, battling. But pal Paladin is kind of cool. You know what? I think just for the sake of getting into the game, which I really want to do because we're, we're an hour in. Um, kind of just I'm just going to make her be a, a fighter still. And then we're going to see how that sits with us, right? She's a level 5 fighter. We can just deal with that. We're going to see if that boosts anything for us. It doesn't. Um, all right, great. She's a normal old fighter. She broke up with her. Maybe she turned into a monk. Look. I know we got a lot of Riz. I don't think we would turn anyone to like an ascetic monastic lifestyle. Like I'm breaking up with you. Just I'm like, well, guess head. I'll surrender myself to the Lord. Um, all right, let's see here. The two and a great sword, it's so good, but I'm just, I think this hammer is better for now. Um, all right. Yeah, no, no monastic lifestyle for our girl, Lazel. She's busy. Um, gnarled tree branch. Not usable by humanoids. Okay, so that would literally have to be used by... I don't know what a gnarled tree branch would be used by. Oh, and we got a dead goblin child. We can just keep that in storage. I don't know why we're holding on to that. That's weird. Um, all right, cool. Most normal reaction to a breakup. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty chill, I guess. Um, sorting value by type. Okay, cool. Great, now let's hop into the game. We haven't played with any of these characters in a while, save for, uh, save for our boy here. A good time boy. Um, well, let's try it. Let's go. Go to bed. Time to sleep. All right. Oh, I completely missed this. Oh, and I also didn't finish reading out. Uh, oh, Cavrito stuck. Okay, I'll get to it, sorry. Oh, the owl bear baby. So we rescued an owl, owl bear baby. Someone killed its mom. And we don't know who did that. So um, we told it it could come to our camp and it might. So I know you can't see behind me. I have a plus four from charisma, plus six from the spores that we walked through, plus three in persuasion, and then another plus three in persuasion. We're gonna be fine. We're just like, please, let's, let's look at your little legs, buddy. Are you bleeding? Are you fine? Click on the dice to roll. As long as it's not in that one, we're good. Five. All right, we would have been fine, but we're gonna get up to like a twelve or way more. Seventeen. Lord, have mercy. Look, cut. I just want to rub its little tummy. We are. We would do okay in medicine. We do okay in persuasion, and we do okay in survival. I will say, I, persuasion is actually the best one we got. We'll be great, but if we say it's barely a scratch. You'll be fine. I kind of want to show it. I want to show it more love. I want to say, even though it's, we have less of a boost here, I want to say, hold still, I'll make it better because I've never loved anything more. In fact, hold on, this is the thumbnail. Hold on, get ready. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, hold on, it's, it's thumbnail time. How's, how's my hair look, everybody good? 
Something I have to keep in mind now. We're doing YouTube, everyone. We're, we're doing YouTube. It's the big time. Hold on. Oh, the baby. Okay. Jojo, jump up. No, I'm kidding. It's stupid. Um, I'm going to use medicine. I think it'll be better to use medicine. It's a wisdom check. We can add the bonus from guidance. Shadow heart. As long as it's not a nat one, we're good. Yeah, there's two nat ones. We're golden. Success. As the wound closes, the cup begins testing his I weight. I love it on so the much. It reminds me of my good colossal cat. How did this happen? Teeth, claws, bigger. Who are we killing? Who hurt my baby beans? Its name is Baby Beans now, by the way. We're calling it Baby Beans. You fought something bigger than you. Why? Strong, fight, win. Take on something closer to your own size next time. Too big. Wait. We're strong. teaching it what his mom Show couldn't, because someone killed it, and, and we don't know quite who. Charming, once you get accustomed to the smell of rotting flesh. It speaks English. <laughs> well, so we we are using speak with animals as a skill. Um, we were a druid. Again, now we're a bard, but we're magic enough to just straight up do that. Did we rest? Is that? Yeah, we're good to go. All right, so now we're finally good to join in the proper game. Um, and we're actually going to turn off. We had non-lethal damage on because we were trying to not kill some people. Now we're going to do it. Um, so let's see here. We got K. Colsia 420 dropping five flipping gift subs. Thank you very much, K. Colsia. Appreciate you. And then K. Colsia is gifting to... Oh, I can't leave camp. Why can't I leave camp? But well, why can't I leave camp? That's my question. Oh, Shadowheart really needs to talk to me? I don't I don't get what the deal is. Not as bad as it doesn't let us leave camp. We already did the long rest, didn't we? No, no, we didn't do long rest. I tried and it didn't let me. Okay, there we go. Hey, Colsia, thank you for gifting me Miss Rue, Becca Death, a Sparrow Plays, D. Krylwe, and then uh, Shang Dangus. Appreciate you. All right, so now we can read out Curve Rito's tip. Um, thank you very much. The Curve Rito, in addition to being sick and, and working to meet deadlines, says, trying to do what I love and get shmoney lol. Pretty happy to be here as usual. I'm sending good vibes and green hearts. Thank you for everything. Well, I appreciate you, Curve Rito. Again, just please take care of yourself. I don't sleep enough and I'm really trying. So, so do what I have not and be out. super no. healthy. Why would I bury a weapon? These two have battled before. They have been at metaphor. odds, and that's why we're doing this I now. I don't know your metaphor, but if you need help digging, I will find a shovel. So they need to be friends now. We're going to be like, all right, we're having you work together on this field trip so you two can stop being such negative Berthas and be friends, okay? There's something I've been wanting to share with you. If now's a good time. Listen, we just left camp. And I have a girlfriend in this game, but okay, fine. Um, and then Shang Dangus is gifting a sub to Manders. Shang Dangus, what a wonderful name. I appreciate you. Um, thank you very much for doing that. Again, I know I'm really behind on tips, y'all. I will read them out soon. I am so sorry. And we also got some new subscribers here. We got Goral WTF, I am the Goo Man, and then Vet Novice. Everybody, please give them a spicy. Welcome. Thank you so much. Owen Wilson. Oh, yeah. So, uh, Carlac likes us a lot. We've given her a smooch before on the forehead, which to me personally in my life, a smooch on the forehead is, <gasps> woo! It's just the most, like, heart-flipping thing. It's difficult to put into words. I think it might be easier to just show you. Act one. A beautiful Here's girl is tadpole. with dark hair and bangs. Connection. Oh. Come into my mind. Barrett, we're with Carlac in this game. Are you sure? I'm sure. I trust you. Mistake. What am I going to see? How I came to be who I am. How I found my way to Lady Shah's embrace. So Lady Shah is a spooky, mean god, and she serves her and really likes serving her. So we're just kind of like, how did that? Why are you? They're not known for being nice. What's your deal? Oh, and the mind parasite we all got connects I us. So. don't remember how it started. Only how it ended. I was fleeing. Oh. 
Oh. Was that scar not in a different kind of location? Like her face was, it was like up here. Uh oh. They blew down the house of sticks and now she's in trouble. Kylie and B, thank you for the raid. Welcome on in, everybody. Thank you so much. I uh, I do want to read this. I do I do want to watch the scene. Then we'll give you a proper welcome on in. Thank you, Kylie and B. Oh no! Wait. So does she like the wolf or not? Oh, they saved her from the wolf. It's just another mask underneath that. She asked my name. Oh. I can't remember what I said. I can't remember anything before those woods. All I know is she saved my life and gave me a new home. What if they sent the wolf? With Lady Shaw. What if they sent the wolf? It hurts. That's all I remember. You actually really could have Something just said sparks that. sparks in your memory about Selunite rites of passage. You heard once about how they were... That's why she hates the statue of Selunite. Saloon. Maybe she used to be a Selunite. Um, thank you so much, Hylian B. Welcome on in, y'all. Appreciate you. If you don't know me, my name is Damien. I stream Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday. Um, wait, Hylian B. I'm just putting it together. Is that B Zelda by chance? Or is that a different person? I'm just curious. I'm I'm checking your name here. Okay, you are a different person than B Zelda, but that's okay. Yeah, I'm sure you can. Oh, wait, it is B Zelda. Hi, B Zelda. Good to see you. Welcome on in. Thank you for being here. Y'all, I got to play D&D with B Zelda at Gen Con. They are the kindest human in the world. And I really appreciate you quite a bit. Um, B, it was so lovely meeting you. Oh, wait, no. Okay, so you are a different person. Okay, that y'all, Hylian B is a totally different person. Remember everything I just said? Scratch it. Shake the extra sketch. Hold on. Scratch that. Reverse it. But thanks for being here and thanks for the raid. And I believe you when you say you're nice. I'm gullible, but I also believe you. Um, thanks so much for the raid. If y'all don't know me, my name is Damien. I stream Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday. I'm a voice actor. I'm a Twitch streamer. You may also know me from the YouTube channel, Smosh. Um, uh, Wednesdays are a big day for me. You can hear my voice in the anime, My Happy Marriage, which comes out weekly. You can also see Sword AF, the D&D series I produce on Smosh. So here we go. That's, now we're here. Um, thank you for the raid. We also got, I never had a little lamb welcoming those new people on in uh, with 10 flipping gift subs. Thank you for the sub bomb. Welcome on in. Uh, and thank you, I never had a little lamb. Gifting to Red Panda Ninja, Hawthorne HG, Harley, Nick, uh, Vanox, Xiaod, uh, Scrub Zaddy, Lil Panda Onesie, Lily Gherkin, Fantasy 3x3, Dark Cross, and then Emerald Hope. Thank you so very, very much, y'all. I really appreciate that. Um, all right, I'm going to hop back in a game here. I've been a little distracted today, even though my ADHD meds shouldn't be wearing off for another couple of hours, but it sure feels like they are. <laughs> Maybe it's just because I don't sleep very much. Um, you look like you were wearing a moonstone. Is that commonly worn by Selenites? <laughs> You're reading too much into things. A childhood bauble, that's all. No Twitch extension? A dichotic there is, there should be. doesn't mean they own it. Has anyone been able to use the Twitch extension? Because it should be there. I did enable it. The extension is top left. Thank you, Hylian B. Uh, Dichotic, maybe get a little refresh? They work for me, says Moon. I have not tried. I feel that uh, the extension isn't working for me. Mine doesn't have info. Hmm. That's weird. Let me really quickly check on this. I do want to hop back into the game uh, before too long, but let me see. That would be under um, the extension manager. Where is the extensions? I did enable it. So why it is activated for overlay Baldur's Gate 3 companion. Baldur's Gate 3 companion. Um, enable the Twitch integration in the in-game settings menu. Here we are. Sorry about this here. So let's go options and have here something like um, the Twitch extension or whatever. Or of us. Yeah, there we go. So, back. that's on me. Thank you very much for asking. And now we are here. Now we are here. Everything's fantastic. Ganz fantastic. 
Um, no wonder you're so, oh, excuse me. No wonder you're so dedicated to Shah. You feel like you owe your life to her. Lady Shah. <laughs> yeah, I'm on, I'm on a first name basis with your god. We're chill. And those who saved we me. We smooched once. And taught me her ways. The Mother Superior. She made me who I am. Everyone else is just At listening like. As best as I can remember. We, should we go? She taught me. Trained me. Punished me when I failed her. Which was often. Sounds a little culty. Yeah, I, I kind of want to say sounds like abuse, but I feel like she's already fe she's already um, sharing this with me so vulnerably and is like really scared to do so. That I think the first time that I'm like, you're being abused is probably going to make her go like, ah, no, never mind. I don't want to talk to you anymore. I think we might have to be like, hey, that sounds tough. Have you thought now that you've had time to digest, have you thought about that there are other ways that you could be treated? Because I, I personally wouldn't treat someone I cared about like that. Perhaps I was. She sent me on this mission after all. All right, so that's the end of her her little quest there, her little, her little line of speech right there. Miss Spooky, thank you for the 200 bits. Appreciate you. All right, now we're finally playing the feud. Um, oh, it's gonna be so weird not having a Starion because we were just stealing everything before. I guess we can just do whatever later and like go back and steal a bunch of stuff. Wow, lots of executed drow. That's that's a big deal. We can always raise them up too. Um, but for now, we are trying to hunt down specifically. Um, let's see. Nair. Nair is their name. Uh, the Sovereign Spa wants the head of the Drow Nair. So there are a few different people in Quest that are like, we, that Nair person, they gotta go. And we're just like, oh, okay. Um, they're like a cult leader. They're big old meanies. I forget exactly what they did, but they probably deserved it. I'm friends with B Zelda. They're the best. So glad you got to play with them at Gen Con, says Noella RH. Oh, that's awesome. That is the person I played with at uh, Gen Con, not the one that raided. Uh, dropping 1069. Nice. Uh, thank you, Noella, for doing that. I appreciate you. That's very nice of you. Yeah, B Zelda is truly, truly, truly kind. I've been watching it you fight, Shadowheart. Your skills are improving. My skills were just fine to begin with. Come on, Shadowheart. Save the compliments. For Lay Zelda to say anything nice at all ever, that's such a big deal. I wish Shadowheart had the, like... Sometimes you do have to be the bigger person to be like, Look, I know we had a fight before. I really like your shirt today. And then you just, like, you're like, I know what this is and it doesn't fix things. But you're trying. So thank you. You know what I mean? Like, sometimes you just gotta go with that. Um, now I will say... What did you mean before, Gail? Oh. A woman with shadows for eyes, you said. Nearly. That if the eyes are the mirror to the soul, yours have dark curtains across the mirror. No offense taken, I hope. Not necessary. Okay, so if it's red, that means we're stealing it. So we gotta be kind of careful about this. Hell's foot soldiers. This belonged to a man. Oh, Nera's already dead right there. Okay, well, that's the whole thing. Locked? Are you locked? Yeah, let's gonna take that club. Um, someone, I think it was Gale. Yeah, Gale just got that, like, unlock spell, right? Or did we end up even using it? Because I was like, we have a Sterian, and then we super didn't. Um, yep, we don't have it. So let's let's just try to unlock it. Let's just do all normal. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. You seem to know a good deal about our condition, condition again. Everything really. Not a bit too fine of you. What net one? My batoot net one. Gosh dang it. Just try again here. At least we got rid of that nat one early. We're gonna be fine now. Five. Okay, actually, we will probably get that from this then. Yeah, we're good. All right. Oh, so many goodies. And also a deed of ownership. Let's read that. That's gonna be important probably. Oh God, I need to clean out this armor. This is terrible. This is so terrible. Um. Great resistance to cold damage. Yeah, okay. Oh, we can give that to Carlac though, because it's just normal clothing. Um, I need to... <laughs> I need to store so many things. Um, it's insane to me. I can't believe how much I've made this person just a pack mule here. Um, that's okay. Everything will be fine. No worries. Yeah, no things. Uh, antidote, antidote. Mother's loathing. Oh, that's right, because we took down the um the witch previously, and which means there was just so many different things to handle. Um, all right. Uh, weights. 
or rather let's see um type where is the deed of ownership you there where is the deed of ownership bring me the deed of ownership we literally just grabbed it we literally just grabbed it where is it i'm sorry y'all deed of ownership there it is let it be known from the Fadrim to the Firelands, from Morndiver to Spawning Deep, the Iron Hand gnomes with the blessing of the Shield of the Golden Hills declare possession of the tunnels, open spaces, peoples, and contents of underdark territory beneath the Western Heartlands. Ignore this deed under penalty of imprisonment or death. Approved and signed, Wolbrin Bongle. All right, so there is a war between the Deep Gnomes and the Deep Elves right now, and I don't know exactly what's going on here. I will say the Deep Gnomes kind of got rocked by um, the Deep dwarves oh the deep dwarves are who they're in war with um but when we ended up like talking to the deep dwarves they were immediately like this is potentially triggering and i'm sorry but like um the dwarves we were like oh we should hear them out because there's two sides to every story and they were like that gnome who is my slave escaped and we were like oh okay we're all set and they were like give us the gnome and we were like nope and they were like then die because we love doing the things we do and we're like okay so I feel like maybe we'll side with the gnomes or nobody. We'll just wreck this whole place, but super not down for everything that happened there. Corpse lies before you. Um, I'm gonna leave first before we do that. Cause I want <gasps> fancy boots, fancy moon lantern, fancy sword. Ooh, that's awesome. And it's a finesse sword. Oh, oh. ah, ooh, ah, ooh, ooh. Wait, Nair had a Mind Flayer Parasite. I wonder if we took too Jack long to get to this person. Eye. A lantern, it seems. Though no light flickers within. Yo, I think we took too long to get to this the person because I don't think they were supposed to be it. dead. Um, Arcana would help us investigate this. Examine the dust within the lantern. Yep, says Dichotic. That's wild. So I guess the fact that I got here and then took a long rest, maybe that wasn't... Wow, I wonder what they would have said. There's so much to... There's so much to... That's wild. This game is crazy to me. In the best way, really. This is pixie dust. Used pixie to illuminate dust, a eh? lamp. All left behind after a pixie's death investigate with more detail oh that's not great we're gonna have to try that again let's try that again all right six three damn it there's no god ah, i mean we could if it's max no that was max and it didn't do that sucks a lot at least it's karmic dice, so we're gonna get some good ones now because we're due it. So look, watch. 17. Ah! Oh, better be good this time. There we go. Now we're set. Um, Tiarna dropping 369. Thank you very much, uh, Tiarna. And also, nice. Uh, from the 69. Any update on the white, white? Oh, dyeing my hair. Yeah, I realized I have a cosplay sort of like in the chamber where the costume is ready. I'm just not in a place with my body where I feel comfortable doing it, but I need to and want to. Um, where having purple hair will still be necessary and good. So I'm actually waiting a little bit and hopefully I can get to a point where I just do it. Anyway, um, though we love the purple, also just finished another u unit and got a high distinction. That's really exciting. I'm, I'm assuming that's an Australian thing, but it's probably like graduating with honors, I think. Um, definitely did a celebratory dance. We'll continue to use you guys as parallel play while I study in the near, uh, in the near one. Love you, Coop. Well, I appreciate you a lot. Thank you very much, Tiana. And congrats you no to you. Or wick. It was not fuel that lit this lamp, but magic. Then, first of all, we're going to have to cast Speak with Dead. Oh, no. Someone else has that amulet. Shoot. So we cannot speak to the dead. We cannot speak to them, but maybe Gale can raise them alive. Also, where's our raise dead spell? Is that just not here right now? Weird. Gale, what kind of spell you got, my guy? I thought you were supposed to be able to animate them. Yeah, you can animate them. Spell is not prepared. Oh, shoot. 
That's very silly. Didn't even think about that. Let's get rid of... I don't think we need... We're not going to need fog cloud, right? And you know, tell you what we don't need is chromatic orb. Because it just has never really worked for me. And I think magic missile is going to be better. Let's have animate dead. And let's do... I don't think we're going to need... Enhanced leap right now. Maybe we will. Maybe we will. Shoot. Oh, this is hard. Um, enlarge and reduce. Fog cloud. Magic missile. Enhanced leap. Find familiar. Um, we don't need grease. Cool. There we go. Cool. Um, so we have animate dead, but we don't have talk to dead. And I really would want to talk to him for sure. Um, hmm. Damn. This all sucks. I really shouldn't have traded out my people. You know what? I'm going to really quickly run to camp. Go to camp. Hey, what's up, Dernask? That is my friend right there. We were literally just talking about the Shez cosplay that you made. That is lovely and glorious and good. And I appreciate you. Um, we're going to have... We need um, Will to come back. And why are they showing everyone's helmets right now? They We really... Literally, that's not how it's supposed to be. Also, I think we're glitched because I keep saying to not hide. There we go. There we go. Um, where is... We're going to have Gale return to camp for a minute. What's on your mind? How much I don't need you right now. I question the wisdom of that decision, but I'll be here. And then where's Will? What's up, my friend? Curvito says, I'm kind of lost too, kind of. All right, so I will get you up to speed. No problem. So right now... While we are still going through our quest to get this parasite removed from our brain, and everybody in our party is dealing with that. That's the thing that gives us the psychic connection that you probably saw earlier. Um, we are also dealing with the fact that we have to get through the Underdark. And while journeying through the Underdark, we found um, uh, this society of mushroom people, and they are having a real hard time um, because of this war between the Deep Gnomes and the Deep Dwarves. And it's a whole thing. Um, it's a huge bummer, actually. So we are trying to do our best to get to the bottom of that and do that quest while also continuing on our merry way. Um, I hate that it sometimes just forgets that, like, hey, we have this set to, like, not show that. Okay, great. So, Will, my guy, I need you to um, talk to this guy that died that we are surprised he is dead. Very surprised. Um, all right, Will, what you got for us? The corpse regards you lifelessly. As corpses do. Um, how did you get trapped? That's interesting. So we're assuming that this was a trap and that's how he got killed. So that's weird that we knew that, but I'm going to say, did you come here with the Dwerger, which are the uh, deep dwarves? Mercenaries. Absolute unites. The absolute is a god that some of them worship. <laughs> First, I thought he was saying they were absolute units, bro. These mercenaries are beefy boys. Um, hey, we got Extruder dropping a thousand bits. Just saying love you, man. Well, I appreciate that. That's very nice. Thank you. Thank you. How did you get trapped? Corridor. Triggered old trap. Gave oh, so in. nobody killed him specifically in battle. He just died from a trap? Potentially, that was on purpose from other people. Moonrise he came from the Moonrise Towers, Towers, which is the place we have to go. That's how this sort of ties into things. Noella, thank you for the 100 bits. Put a slice of bacon on a pentagram and say cosplay and I appear. Absolutely, Dernesk. That makes so much sense. <laughs> I love that. In camp. Oh. Safe passage. Remember when I said that we killed somebody earlier who could have been on our team? We're kind of wearing her armor right now, too. Well, we get two more questions. We can ask dead people five things. Orders of general. Order of operation, sure, 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 sure. The spell's power waves. You can ask no more Star's Eye says, why is the scene low-key giving me uh, the heebie-jeebies? Because well, we're talking to a dead guy using dark magics from an amulet. 
I think it all tracks. I think you're not the weird one here. You know what I mean? Um, all right, going to camp. We're going to swap right out. We're going to have uh, Will leave again. Um, hey. Okay, Will. Will. Well met. Well met. Are More like sure? well sitting out. The blade and all right, and then Gale is once again being a sneaky guy. That's so goofy. Um, Holy beans! As of an hour ago, we got Jepperhead dropping 142.69. Um, Jepperhead, Lead on. thank you so much. Uh, y'all, if y'all don't know, Jepperhead is always an extremely generous mother goose. Um, nice they often drop very generous tips and um, then don't say anything. There is no message attached, so I will just what say thank you, benevolent, kind, later. secret what benefactor. Um, I really appreciate it a lot. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, that was really kind of you. If you say so. Just don't expect me to put all my eggs in the same basket. That expression must sound curious to give Yankee year, given the way they're birth. So there's a dude. Gail is also trying to hide against so I just don't want to hide. Okay, uh, Wiki. I don't know who Wiki is. Um, it is a bummer that they're trapped in poison. And we did have the opportunity to be like, oh my gosh, we can like, you know, save ourselves from poison. We don't have to be poisoned anymore. Oh, so this is one thing that we'll like you. here. Um, let's get everybody back over here. We're gonna ungroup Gale. And um, I'm assuming, you know what happens when you assume, you're usually correct. I'm assuming we can fireball this poison away. What? Weren't we able to fireball some poison before? Really? Um, there's a double doors over there that bridge. Oh, I guess if fireball were an issue, we would be able to like do it. Yeah. Um, I wonder if we can safely. I'm also curious about like poison cloud. We did just grab a bunch of cantrips too. So I'm curious about cantrips. Um, that we could do here. Uh, fog cloud wouldn't do anything here. Protection of good and evil, no. Mirror image, no. En enhanced leap. Now we could just leap to the other side of the room. That's an interesting one. Um, how about you, Lazel? We gave you a bunch of goodies, right? She got uh, Revivify, which is actually a huge deal for us now. We got Warding Bond. Produce flame. Um, can we also? Yes, create or destroy water. Maybe raining would bring down the um, the poison cloud. I'm willing to give it a shot. I'm gonna save first, because I really don't want to waste a spell slot. Well, if we do, we do, you know? Um, call forth rain and extinguishes exposed flames and forms a water surface. Ooh, cause, okay, cause water-based surfaces such as water, steam, ice, blood, and poison to vanish. I love that. All right, so get, you know what? We're good, Shadow Hearts. Shadow Heart, we got, we got use for you now. Creator destroy water, amazing. Um, oh, but it's a poison surface, so we need to create, and then maybe it rains down, and then we get to destroy that surface later? Let's just try it out. Let's see if it works. We can't... Okay, so we truly can't just wash away this water. Well, so it goes. Mug. I guess we're just kind of stuck here, then. Ooh, save for poison cloud. All right, yeah, I mean, I guess I'm just going to have to run up and disarm it later, which is... Very silly, but so it goes. Um, we'll check that out in a minute. No time to rest. There's a way to go up here too. I wonder what that does for us. Get a lay of the land. <clears throat> Granite chair. Also wonder if we can like float above areas. About your queen, also, there's no your one here now. What happened? Just is it glitched? Because there's no one here in game. Isn't this place supposed to be teeming with life? Scroll of web. Life and unlife. Eyes like onyx. Teeth like daggers. There is none more perfect. Stuff over here, too. Clearly, that's a jumpable. Oh, this is all maybe jumpable. Can we go through all of this? Ooh. Okay, y'all. I'm starting to see that there might be some cool. I think, I think there's some hidden paths here, too. So let me go ahead and try to, with my normal guy you know, uh, un <laughs> undo that door, get through the poison. And if I'm wrong and I get screwed over, fine. Um, but again, Jebberhead, thank you so much for that extreme generosity. That was very, 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 very nice of you. 
Um, you, you didn't know. have to do that, Seize and you did, day, and it's I very say. sweet, and I appreciate you. More now than ever. Careful you don't pull a muscle in your haste. All right, Shadowheart, can you do anything at all here? I guess less for, like, the saving throws on poison? Move curse, revivify. I mean, we have restoration, so we can remove that poison when he's poisoned, because he will be poisoned. Never wanted the easy path. Double oak doors. Unlock. Okay, well, he's immediately poisoned, so that's fun. Um, great, you can do it. You can just do it. Um, total bonus, but he's poisoned, so it's disadvantage. That actually sucks a lot. Oh, and we have to go with that one, so it's less, because it's disadvantage. Damn it. Try again. We're going to go through this as quickly as possible. 15. Great, we did it. Woo! Go through it now. Come on, everybody. We're good. Everybody on group on up. Roll on through. Oh, wait. What? Is there nothing down here? Maybe we could feather fall down there. Hello, everyone. Why are you stopping right there? There's no time to waste. Need to keep going. Yep. Poisoned. Everybody's poisoned. That's super awesome. You're a creature from all these things. All right, so that's not ideal. Um, I also wonder if we can teleport to that. Somebody's skills. Quite a sight. But I won't be able to get any closer this way. Still breathing, despite everything. Oh, so poison isn't doing direct damage to us. We just, um, lose... We just have disadvantage on things. So, yeah, I'm very curious if, like, can Gale Misty Step for that? We did give him Misty Step, or Enhanced Leave. Um, casting at a higher level doesn't grant any benefits. All right, so Lazel has the best leap, probably. Let's give her a shot here. Will be done. Let's see here. Let's have her just straight up stand on the edge there. That is interrupted. Invalid target. Oh, damn. We're so close, though. That's interrupted. So I can't, I can't jump anywhere from here. So why, why this door, then? Why that door? Is it just a funny, silly joke that you made me jump through poison and that's a funny little silly joke? Because that actually kind of sucks if you did that. Game. Game. That's interrupted. Target's invalid. All right, well, wait, she has the Githyanki psionics. Triple a creature's jumping distance. Do it. She's got a super enhanced jump right now. Path's interrupted still. Well, dang, y'all, that's very silly. That's interrupted. That's interrupted. That's interrupted. Okay, well, that's kind of stupid, and I hate that a lot. But I guess that's the name of the game. It, not everything has treasure behind it. So there we go. I guess that's why it's a trap. It's a tarp. Um. Oh, I guess we do have to cut his head off, huh? Yeah. Done. Livernair's head. Great. Um, but I am curious, is there stuff over here to grab? <gasps> That's a thing over there. So then given that, Gibbons that, deface statue of Shar. Oh. Sure, defaced by the absolute mark. I can think of no better target for vandals. How does Shadowheart feel about that? Because that's her god. Statue of Okay. Whatever. Oh, action, not reaction. Path is interrupted. Okay, well then, I guess that makes sense. So I can't go up here. I can't go up here. I feel so silly. I keep trying to find cool little spots because I know there's got to be one. There's got to be some kind of cool little spot over here. I know I can jump over here. There's a skeleton. We got to search him. Unfinished sending. Okay. A component of a magical sending. Hastily scrawled and incomplete. Seal the lower temple. Grimforge taken by unknown force. Many soldiers, one face. Infernal, their leader, the cut nose off abruptly, ink slashed through with blood. Okay, so maybe we will be fighting an infernal, which is basically, um, you can, demons, demons, you can just say demons, we can just say demons, it's demons. Um, which is kind of a huge deal. Um, and I know the Grimforge is a very fancy, like, item forge place where we get to make ourselves cool weapons if we play our card right. So I think that's gonna be an important situation. Are you serious, dude? Why, why the poison? Why the poison? Um, all right, again, thank you very much, uh, Jebberhead. That was very, very nice of you. Um, we got Soul Galleon dropping six, 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 bucks, bucks, bucks. Thank you very much, Soul Galleon. 
and Soul Galleon says, and I uh, quote, um, won't be able to sit through the whole stream tonight, but I'm looking forward to uh, what I get to see. Also, Sword AF was wild in the best way. It was, I was an emotional wreck. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. It definitely was a, um, more of a gamble to do, uh, you know, some emotional parts of the story. And I think we had to like earn that with the audience. You know what I mean? Like a lot of D&D has a lot of goofy stuff and a lot of serious moments, but you can't just walk in and be like, we're good actors. Look at us go. But you know, I, I know that our cast has the chops to do it. Um, don't forget Gail. Did Gail also not come? Jesus crepes. Jeez, um, crepes, you guys. Jero alive. Thank you. Appreciate that. Um, but you know, it also takes a lot of trust on, on their part, um, to allow me to do things like that. Broken cane. Wait, where was that? Wait, it was the broken cane. That sounds kind of cool. Yeah. Okay, and I want that. Whatever that is. Gale is the I can fix him trope. That's amazing. Uh, the the affliction. Um, I'm really glad that the episode made you cry in a good way. You know, I, I'm really proud of the cast. I knew they could do it. Um, I trusted them. And I also thought that, you know, like, so there's, there's, I'm of two minds about this, right? So Chance has the most D&D &D experience by far in that group. And he does a great job. Um, he plays like a regular home game and I, again I know, I know i don't usually talk about small stuff here i like it to be my own thing on this stream but like I'll, I'll talk about this a little bit i feel like it'd be a fun little chat um so yeah i i i trust chance to like you know he sort of he knows the storyline mixed with gameplay aspect pretty well you know and already did from his own gameplay so like you know, other people needed a chance to figure out the game and a chance to shine and all that stuff. So I was like really proud of him for like having a character choice that allowed him to take more of a back seat sometimes, not have the big haha -ha funny moments, but be just like a part of the story and drive it forward, right? So I wanted to show him off. And then Amanda has like learned D&D &D and you know, is still figuring out the game, but is really trying hard and connects a lot with his character. And I was like, all right, so other people like Shane, you know, for example, are, they're gonna use parts of their character Still along right. with their so skills and create the story through that, you know, while playing the game, it's gonna be a little harder for someone like Amanda who's just new to it. So like, I want to show that off. Let's figure out how we do that. And so we did. Um, and I was really proud of that. All right, so we just went through that whole way and nothing really came of it. I guess there's nothing over here, but maybe something to the West. I guess the Grim Forge would be to the West and that seems important. Um, so yeah, that was sort of my thought on like the pacing and how long it took us to get to that more serious stuff. Um, ooh, fancy, fancy. Um, yeah, I really shouldn't have taken that long rest because apparently there's like dead skeletons, dead drow. Like there's a lot of dead things around here that maybe wouldn't have been dead before. Dark Justiciar armor, that's so cool. Wait, these are all worshippers of Shar. Uh oh. The skeletons, you realize they are all clad in the same dark armor. Dark Justicia uniforms. These were Shah worshippers. The same as me. Yeah, yes. Yeah, um, uh oh. Ah, whatever killed them made an enemy of a powerful goddess. Still, if whatever managed to murder a group of Sharans is still around, we had better watch our step. Yeah, so that's not great. Like, something went down here. We really shouldn't have done a long rest, but we did. And we all chose to do that, right? That's all of our fault. Um, I am fully encumbered. I have to sort by weight and get a bunch of stuff out of here. Like, this is wild. Oh, well, I guess the lumps of flesh and the alchemy pouches. Dear God, I didn't realize there was so much in that. Okay, well, that'll, I mean, that'll do it. Um, Grove annals, we don't need that hammer. We still have not used the war horn. That's so funny to me. Oh my God. Wow. Okay. So the war horn y'all is something where we can summon a bunch of ogres to help us fight. And I picked that up so early in game to the point where it's kind of silly. Um, okay. That's actually really goofy. Um, what else can I just toss? Bunch of fish, fish pipe. Oh, that's Halson's pipe. Um, broken cane, uh, fish head. Yeah, we don't need a roly poly fish head. 
uh devil foil mask i am gonna inspect that i'm also gonna inspect the um the thing that we just got the uh flipping fairy lantern thing examine beneath a layer of dust the mask still gleams an instant smile and wide searching eyes seeking its own kind i am gonna hold on to this in case we need it for something around here because it would make sense Oh, yeah, the special boots. I forgot about the special boots. Um, we get Misty Step with this. That's awesome. Can't be enwebbed, entangled, or ensnared, and can't slip on grease or ice. Um, actually, this is kind of the same thing, but better. So we'll for sure take that. Um, who else can use this? When you dash, you gain wrath for two turns. She doesn't need to dash. But Lazel, or excuse me, um, other person might. Um, Shadow Heart might. Um, cool. Everybody gets new boots. We're new boot goofing. Um, where is that fairy thing that I picked up? The pixie dust. What's up, Dapper Kens? You love this section? Well, that's good. I'm glad. Then you came in at the right time. Did you ever? Good to see you, my friend. Hope you're doing well. Um, oh, it's a poisoned apple. It's a poisoned apple, is it? Ooh. Wine goblets and wilted dreams and rotten carrots, so it seems. <laughs> uh, I need to inspect that whole thing. Um, broken moon lantern. Examine. A thick layer of dust coats the bottom of the lantern. Glass is cracked. It's metal bent beyond repair. Use? Okay. Let's use it, the broken moon lantern. Broken moon lantern catches your eye. Its glow now snuffed out. Glow has been snuffed out. Is there a different way I should be inspecting this? I do feel like there's, I'm, I'm probably missing something. Broken moon lantern. Hmm. Noella RH is gifting us up to Juro Live. Thank you so much, and welcome to you, Jiro Live. Appreciate that. All right, so, um, actually, does Shadowheart need that Dark Justiciar armor? I guess we did just get rid of it. That sucks. Um, I'll have to come back at another time for that. Hmm. I'm curious. I do feel like there's something I'm supposed to do with this. Again, I, I TikTok told me something about it. They were like, blah, 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 broken moon lantern. Um, there we go. Oh yeah, and I have that alchemy pouch that we needed to get through. Um, ooh, the light crossbows. Um, oh, hand crossbow. Oh yeah, I did end up reading as a, um, as a bard, you can have two hand crossbows and they're kind of sick. So I'm just like, okay. Uh, I'm just gonna send all those to camp. We might as well go and be valuable up in some capacity. Um, our latest ones. We romance now. So we're, we've, we're definitely, uh, we're sweet on Carlac. We're sweet on Carlac, Kens. And she gave us a smooch, and we're very in love. Um, all right. I know I've been going so slow today, y'all. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Um, dip potion of diminution. Uh, let's see. Elixirs. Elixir of bark skin. Elixir of resistance fire. Elixir of Colossus. I just want to keep using Elixir of Colossus. Fire resistance is probably good. Um, let's see here. Potions. Uh, glorious vaulting. Uh, greater healing sounds good to me. Um, glorious vaulting. That's kind of awesome. Featherfall is great. Uh, potion of speed. Let's go. Um, uh, looted oil of sharpness. Basic poison. Um, we've got also, I think that's it. I think that's everything. All righty. I'm so curious. I'm so curious what more there is here because I know, I know there's a lot to do with the Grim Forge. I got to get down there somehow. I feel like it's going to be a Misty Step, Misty Step situation since they just gave me a Misty Step boot. And we opened that door that doesn't let us go anywhere. Are there going to be creepy little elevators here? There's got to be other stuff. Maybe there's another entrance to the Grim Forge. Okay, so you know what? I'll ask this. So we got here by boat. We went here um, via boat. Um, we kind of snuck here through like, you know, lying to these other deep dwarves and being like, oh yeah, for sure, bet. We definitely got here because our friend 
uh, let us have the boats because he died and they were like seems feasible um so I'm curious as to whether or not there is another way around and that's how I have to get here so I am going to go ahead and ask this is we're, we're turning off the no backseat gaming thing I am honestly asking you here is there another entrance to this area and I am done with what I can do right now is that what I'm dealing with or can I do more with where I'm at that is what I ask of you I can honestly tell you says Dylan Lanto so I am again asking now chat um ooh cragged rock okay we climb down here that's what we do there's cragged rock I'm good huh there's a way down to the f you just gotta explore all right got it got it got it uh well we got it we did it we're here thanks y'all a wooden chest and a rib cage oh dude oh and there's writing on the ground there must be a stockpile nearby harper rune stockpile um left out in plain sight like that no the harpers are too smart for that so then there must be a diggable stockpile near here nothing 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 but dirt nothing but dirt nothing interesting buried here curious if there's buried stuff but i will still look at those nothing other treasures um rib oh if there's a rib cage right there maybe that's the secret oh i didn't want to pick it up damn Lucky. nothing Sticky. um oh perception failed oh it's a mimic Ooh, we haven't fought a mimic yet in this game. Oh, that's so cool. So Galleon, thank you for the 101 bits. Appreciate you. And I still uh, didn't... Uh, oh, I did read. I did read your tip. Thank you. Wow, this will be an interesting fight. Oh, I get surprised. Whoa, they're all mimics. That's so cool. That's such a smart thing that they did. Wait, what was stolen? My weapon was stolen. Oh. <gasps> You slimy little poop man. I don't like you. And they're all level three. Okay, so that's a that's a little bit of that's a spicy amount of health for a level three. I think we're just gonna have to merc it. You know what? I think we're just gonna have to merc it. And I want that weapon back, so I am going to do as much damage as quickly as possible. Because it's important to me. 80% chance to hit. Let's go. Boom. Oh, but it saved on the extra damage here. But she does get a second attack because, again, she is our special old fighter. And we are of a level to get spe extra attacks now. And isn't that just great? You know what? We'll long rest before too long. Action surge. I don't care. Let's go crazy with this. Um, I guess we can't do a disarming attack because it's not holding a weapon. But we can do... A concussion smash. Yes, we can. Boom. Oh, so much. Wait, did that miss that time? Uh, I might have missed. No, it used concussion, concussion smash. Um, and we get to do it again. Ten more damage. Look at you go, Lazel. You're our special little guy. Um, all right. So now we have Shadow Heart as our new kind of cool, cool, cool uh, cleric. We have a few spells here and there. Mostly it's healing. But we also have things like Guiding Bolt, which can be a really strong level one. Um, and you know what? Maybe we'll do Spiritual Weapon after this. Kind of cool. We'll do... We'll just blast this thing. Tui! Hey! Nick Dunn got murdered! And so now we also get to do Spiritual Weapon and have it attack our enemies. Monk Lazel, right? So we didn't end up doing Monk Lazel. Um, oh my god, we get to choose what kind of sick little weapon we got? That's so cool. Let's do um, spiritual weapon, great sword. Nice. So that one got surprised now by my great sword. Yeah, I mean, that's how it goes. That sucks, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Maybe you kind of see why how that feels to you now? Maybe you kind of get it a little bit, how it feels to have that happen at you? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Wait, I didn't get, oh, I brought in Firebolt. I didn't bring in Firebolt. Oh, that's right, I chose Lightning Bolt. Lightning Bolt is my thing. 
Um, now I wonder what the hit path is like on that. Cause that looks a little weird. Oh, so it's all in this direction. I kind of like that more than fireball. That is kind of interesting. And again, yeah, I just want to use all my new moves. You're right. You're totally right. Woo! That's a lot of health for it to lose. That's kind of awesome. Sorrowful Lash. Um, it pulls the creature towards you, which I don't really want to do, but that's extra damage. Now nah, we're good. He looks like such an Australian like hunter right now because he's got the like speeds. Like, oh, I'm gonna get it. Look at the size of that mother. F Look at him go. I'm gonna kill him. Oh, now he used the lash on Gale. How silly. How positively silly. Oh, and that pulled me in, and I still don't have my weapon. That's actually awesome that that happened right there. Um, so if I tried to, oh, man, I would have to. I'm kind of screwed here. Um, 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 okay, I can do other things, but I, I sure did get excited about potentially not having to uh, go without it a weapon for this entire fight. But fool me nine times, shame on me. Um, let's see here. I want to do, I don't think hideous laughter is going to help this thing. I could disengage and then run away and then grab that item. Do I have enough movement to grab it? Um, no, but also at the same time, it's not going to be healthy for my guy to be right here because he is very vulnerable. He's in a very vulnerable place. Um, so we're going to have him go on up. Yeah. Or actually, jump might be enough to get up there. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Grab it. Yes. Grab all your... Go wow, it really disarmed everything on me. It ate so many... Th oh, wait. No, we found this. Oh. <gasps> Oh, cool. Wondrous gloves. We can give people even more bardic inspiration. I've got my weapon back. I can't use, do that yet because it needs to... It's a whole action to do that. Um, Can I fix the broken thing? Okay. Um, all right. That's fine. All right. We're good. We're good. We're good. 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 And turn for him. I will ascend. <laughs> I will ascend. You sure will, buddy. Um, is that's too far. This is just far enough. There we go. Tui! Do your sweeping attack, Lazel. I know you can do it. Hit them both! Nice. That's some good damage. Hey, what if you did another sweeping attack? Wouldn't that be crazy? Actually, no. You should do... Mm, can't do disarming attack. Do normal ass attack. No, let's do your sweeping attack again. Let's go! Tui! Nice. Lazel, you're, you're killing it. Girl, you're killing it. We like your vibes now, I think. Um, 15 health left on that thing. I think we could probably... Can I hit them both here? No, it has to be one or the other. Shoot. I'm curious. Um, firebolt. Did everyone get a stronger firebolt? I'm curious as to how that happened. Um, I want to do... You know what, Lazel? You're getting warding bond. There you go. Now you're getting better health. Also, Shield of Faith. That can keep creatures from attacks. It can be... I wonder if it overwrites. I hope not. Let's see. Nope, Lazelle is just super protected now. You go get him, Lazelle. You got this. You're good. You got this. Oh, uh, cantrips increase in damage as you level up. That's really interesting. I didn't know that. We also have not summoned... A sweet little beast yet but i guess we could just can magic missile this thing to get it going um no no yes find familiar i want a little buddy i want a little buddy i want to cast as many little buddies as possible because we deserve it what what is going on with this camera um we can have a crab help us. Um. Oh, the frog poisons people. The rat also poisons people. The raven blinds people. And the spider also poisons people. A lot of poison. A lot of poison here. The cat just distracts them. I say, let's find a raven. I am a bird. Yes. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. We're great. Crab is such an odd choice for a familiar... You know what? You say that. You say that, and then all of a sudden, boom! You need a crab's help. Um, all right, let's let's do let's try this. 
That is so good. I'm gonna love having this weapon just here all the time. So Lazelle's got that huge armor boost. I mean, of course nothing's hitting her. That's awesome. It's such a smart move. Um, Sword of Screams. That's also kind of sick. So equipping that is unfortunately our action. It does suck. No one's more angry about it than I am. I get it. I hear you. What did we just discover? Because I just heard that noise go as though we found a special little thing. I'm just curious where it was. Oh, it's right over there. Great. Toy chest. Ah, there is no toys in that chest. I know. I'll tell you that much right now. I'll tell you that much right now. Um. Oh, anyway, um, here's Wonderwall. Go, bird! Um, rend vision to blind it, or just dash and hide and disengage or dismiss. Um, I think we can just blind this one. That seems kind of cool. No, don't hurt a bird! You bastard! You hurt my baby bird, my silly baby beans! I'll kill you. I'll eat your family. I'll eat your family! Boom. It's okay, we'll bring it back. Also, it's not uh, live or like real, but that's fine. Um, we're, all, we're also gonna lash this thing to us. Boom! Yeah, doesn't feel great being lashed to me, huh? Do they have eyes? Um, shiny red aviators. Allow me to show you the most horrifying thing you've seen so far today. Um, it's that. Fainting attack, let's go! Oh my god, Lazell is so strong like this. I'm kind of liking our team comp like this. It's mm, kind of great. One health left, you're killing me. Saddle heart. Uh, show him what day it is. Or do we just hit him? Yeah, we just hit him. Shadow Heart, show him what day it is. Damn it. Come on, man. Stupid. Anyway, here's healing. Um, Random Sword, do a murder. There we go. I hate the camera right now. I actually hate it quite a bit. Um, Don't really know what's going on. But I'll tell you that much, it sucks. Okay, great. Money! Give me your lunch money, Doug. Ooh, a fancy looking axe. Isn't that nice? Um, so these wondrous gloves are kinda awesome. Someone else needs to have them so I can give them bardic inspiration and it'll like help them out. Oh man, Gale and Shadowheart don't have any gloves. Shadowheart. You deserve some special little gloves. Not just normal little gloves. You get special gloves. Look at you go. Look at you go. Um, um, oh, wait, where, what happened? This is so weird. Everything's being really weird right now. Um, where was the flipping? There it is. Moon Lantern. Okay, so there's still nothing to inspect with a Moon Lantern. Fine, fine, fine. Um, cool. Toy chest. How are you liking Bart so far? I love it, Dungeons and Cry. Nasty Oops. surprise. You daisy. Caution is warranted here. Nasty surprise. What what kind of nasty surprise was that? I didn't even see what happened. I do think that's maybe my main critique with this game. Because I it's like a 10 out of 10 for me, but sometimes the camera is pretty rough. And beyond that, sometimes it's like, oh no, you triggered this thing. Something's rumbling. Uh-oh. And it's just like, what happened? What happened? Another chest appeared? Okay. Oh! Oh, I just picked it up. Can I use it? No, I just have it. All right. Great. Um, another chest appeared, you say. Um, I am gonna ask where, because I sure as hell don't see it. Path lies before me. And also, this is the Harper's Mark, so I am again curious. Is there anything to dig up over here? It's, oh, it's in the Mimic. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I would not have seen that. Guaranteed. Harper stash. There we go. Oh, wait, I got to disarm it. Yeah, Harper stash. Um, uh, disarm number one for lockpick here. Oh God, it's a level twenty for disarm. All right, well let's add the bonus of guidance. Uh, we get up to a plus eight. Let's get a fifteen and just roll it on. Let's just do that. Oh, buddy, we're doing it. But I've been so wrong about so many of them. You can't be like, oh, how did you know? Like, one out of 20 times, I should be right. Um, and now we get to lockpick it. It's so crazy that I'll get a seven and I have to redo it. 
Oh, okay. Well, this could work. No, it actually couldn't. It was impossible for it to work. Great, 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 great. Cool. Failure. Try again. <sighs> things are things are getting better. Try again. I swear, I'm about to have Gale just be like, get your, get your knock skill out of here. 17 now. You son of a bastard. You absolute son of a bastard. Guess we could always just take it home and have uh, Astarion, like, pick the lock once we're back in camp. I'm just going to keep going because I have so many thieves tools. I'm fine with it. There we go. 22. Wow, I can't believe how well and easy that happened. And it was very normal for us. Um, wait. Okay, I was about to say, you... Potion of invisibility, a silk land, a little money, and then a scroll of evidence. I'm assuming the scroll of evidence is way more important than anything else because the rest of that stuff kind of sucks. The first few inches of this scroll are written in formal elaborate script. To the Emerald Enclave and those deemed worthy to see this record. Greetings from those who harp. Know ye that the one known as Ketherick Thorm, Paladin of Shah, is guilty of crimes against body and spirit. They include, but are not limited to, Murder, slavery, and desecration of temples most holy. Let our intent be known. In alliance between the Harpers and the Emerald Enclave, united, we may end Thorm's reign of terror. The High Harpers eagerly await your good word. Okay, so it gave us some story, which is neat, but also, and in a much more real way, I do sure wish that I could have done, I could have gotten more money or better items for all that we used that for. But you know what? That's okay. Everything's fine because that was one way down, which says to me that if we went down that way, there's probably like a few ways to go down here. What are all these strands I'm seeing? I didn't realize this was a strand type game. Um, we got Riley from finally dropping five flipping dollars. Wow, it says that was almost two hours ago. I'm so sorry. I've just been zoning. Maybe the ADHD meds are not as strong as they were before. Uh, or maybe I'm just focused on a game. Maybe I don't have to blame everything on medication. Maybe that's okay, too. Um, ooh, can I jump? Can I jump over there? Or can I mess this stick over there? Um, doesn't look like there's much to be done over there. But at least I have Misty Step now, and we know that. We know this. Um. All right. You've been having too much fun, says Genocide Official. You know what? That's what it is. Just too much fun. There's also that plaque that I didn't read. It might be like, oh, Holy Order loves walking down a different way. A gilded chest. I don't see where that is, but that seems important to me. Why is it just showing me where that is all the way over there? Okay, so clearly we got to get to something over there. That seems important, right? Gilded chest somewhere. I still... So, question for people who have played this game, because we've already spent time trying to do this. Okay, so clearly there's something over there, too. Maybe we, do, maybe we should explore over there or like near where the docks are oh you know what the docks are over here maybe there's a way around we should try that we should try that um i'm gonna go back over here real quick um am i missing anything with that poison room or is it just a sneaky little like ha 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 you thought there was treats and now there's not there's just poison ha 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 anyway riley fofiley thank you so much for the tip riley fofiley says and i quote uh, I took a poetry class in college, and part of the final was memorizing a poem of our choice. I memorized Jabberwocky, so I smile when you recite it. Picture me on the city bus in Cleveland, speaking gibberish to practice. That's actually super cool. Um, I love that. Uh, that was a thing that we did in school every single year as part of the curriculum. I don't know why that was a thing in Georgia, but it super was. Um, okay, I guess there's a normal way to get over there, so I won't waste my, my misty step. Um, but that's so fun. I love that. I guess we have that in common. Look at you. That's pretty neat. Um, I do picture you on a city bus. I don't know what you look like, but my brain's like, hmm, you're saying Jabberwocky on a city bus. Pretty cool. <laughs> Dylan Lanto says, on that midnight train to Georgia, even on a midnight train, they're leaving. They drown. Public on that midnight train to Georgia, even on a midnight message. train. A uh, cursed letter. Let's read it. Or crease letter. Crease letter. Jam, like a phoenix from the ashes, Grimforge has risen from the dead. 
I've heard of a drow cultist gathering Dwerger in the old city's halls. That the absolute means to recruit them, I've no doubt. Yet it's what they might seek amongst the ruins that most troubles me. Not failed me. Uh, you've not failed me yet. Go to Grimforge, cling to Shadow, and bring word of the cult's intentions to Last Light. I'll be waiting. I don't think it worked out well for them. I think they're the deadest person I know. So far. Uh, oops. Money! Thanks for the money. Sorry, you're dead. Dear Grem Grem. Sorry, you're dead. Thanks for the money. Sincerely, your grandson. Have fun at the funeral. Um, there is a goddess here. I imagine that's Shar, right? You did Jabberwocky. I did something by Herman Melville. So, Donesk, uh, <laughs> Jabberwocky was an off year because they made everybody do Jabberwocky. Otherwise, because I think you did, you won a few times too, right? Um, in your, in your year, because I think you were the year ahead of me. Um, I did mostly Edgar Allan Poe poems. Um, stained cask. The tap is sticky from use. Oh, combine items into the cask. No, Sister Nesk, really? It surprises me. I feel like you would. Unless you just didn't want to, which is also okay. Stained cask. Maybe do I, like, fill up a bottle with wine? We can try that. Fill up a bottle with wine. Uh, invalid combination. Okay. Mm. I am curious. You know what? I'll just actually go ahead and ask because I don't know and I don't want to spend a bunch of time trying a bunch of things that don't work. Well, what do I use here? What do I use in the sticky old cask? What do I use in the sticky old... You got a mug? Oh, maybe that. That's not a bad idea. Maybe there isn't. I don't know if I have a mug right here. I have a carafe of wine. Can I just refill the carafe? Nope. Um, yeah, I imagine a cup or, a or something would work. That makes sense. Didn't I? No, I did pick one up. There we go. A mug. Valid combination. Nope. All right. I have no clue. It was right below that bottle. Interesting. Hmm. Well, what you gonna do? It was right below that bottle. I don't, I don't know. Stained cask. Inspect too. I'm gonna inspect. Tap is sticky from use. Poison. Oh, poison by end. That actually. That's interesting. So I'm assuming maybe it's not what's needed now because we've already got so many uh dead friends here poison oh, poisoned beer barrel that's so interesting oh what a cool what a cool thing that you said thank you so that was a good example of when i'm asking for the backseat gaming i'm like you gotta tell me and then you did and i appreciate it um i don't know man i just mod here says wayward jaybird hey that's fine and the, the less the mods know about poisoning someone discreetly, the better. Oh, that's so many deep gnomes that are dead. No, we really wanted to save them. Is that why? Oh, no. When I did the like thing that when I showed up and a couple people were dead, was there any chance of me actually saving these people? Because that sucks. Yeah, you missed a whole quest. Oh, no, Floridian. Oh, no, I missed a whole quest. That sucks. But you know what doesn't suck? Alyssa Montrose is dropping 10 flipping gift subs. Um, thank you so much, Alyssa Montrose. I feel so sad. Was it like a super big important quest? Oh, whatever. I'm here. We've done two hours of gameplay. There's no way I'm backing out now. We only got like three hours left to stream. Um, Alyssa Montrose is giving you a shiv. Amanda Anderson, Chaotic Evil, uh, Moa Kino, Frish, uh, Finch Fries, Jamanier, Jamanier, Jason N20X6. Fair smiles, dungeons may cry, and then Mona Lisa Tisa. Thank you so very much. I greatly appreciate that a lot. Um, that was very nice of you, Lisa Montrose. You get a cool item out of it? All right. Well, I guess we'll find other cool items. I just like. Deep gnomes killed under the yoke of slavers. I hate that. I will take the. Uh, there's the trade option? Bit inappropriate. <laughs> That's gotta be a glitch. Um. I will take the lives of those who took yours. But also, you know, I don't see why I couldn't maybe just look. Also, no, they were in, in bondage. I can't imagine they have much to take. Oh no, it's so disrespectful how that happened. Um, ooh! That's awesome! You just get the invisibility spell when you wear that ring? Yeah. Um, sorry about the whole death situation, but I deserve that. 
I'm trying my best. That's my payment for later. When I fix things for later. You know what I mean? I'm gonna do it. Ooh. Hey, man. No one's more pissed about you being dead than me. And that's why I'm gonna fix it. Um, let's take a look at the rings we got. Because I kind of want this guy to have it. Uh, caustic man's important. When you heal a creature, you gain 1d4 bonus to attack rolls and saving throws. Uh, that goes to you. And then you get sneaky ring. Speak with the dead. This is light operation. I mean, I can, but I don't have my guy who does that. I don't have the guy what done does that. But maybe, actually, maybe Gale should actually just... We should probably switch out for that spell, huh? Eh, that's probably a good idea. It's probably a good idea to do it. Yeah, let's go ahead. Or, actually, we have scroll of speak with dead. So here's what we'll do. Gale. Gale, we need you to learn this. Gale. Gale. Come on, Gale. Yeah, Why don't you learn it real quick, my guy? You already know it. That's great news. Then let's swap out your spell. Well, actually, let's give this back to Nanyang. Um, These have stayed interesting. And now, oh wait, I guess I just dropped them. That's very silly of me. Did, is it? Did I? Did I drop them? Hold on. Yeah, okay, scroll speaking code. Casting it on myself. Or casting it rather on, oh god, which one? Um, This one had the special ring, I think. Thank you very much for the five bucks, C Zizzle. I say, I love Sword AF. It's easily my favorite D&D &D series. Uh, ooh, oh, beans. Um, my favorite D&D &D uh, series I've ever watched, and I hope it never ends. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. We got some We got some fun announcements coming up. But don't you worry. But I appreciate you a lot. Thank you. Psychotic says there's an interface thing that you haven't discovered yet that I think you should have. Would you like to know it? That's fair. Sure. What's the what's the interface thing? I appreciate you asking me. That's very nice. The corpse has nothing to say. All right. Well, lock pick. We've already proven we can definitely do this super well. We're you know let's just start off with a fourteen. That makes sense. Let's start off with a fourteen. Oh, we could, we could! Potentially, if there's more than a three. Yes, great. If you left click on an item slot in the inventory screen, it shows you everything you can equip, even those on other characters. I did actually know that. I haven't been doing it. So, uh, thank you. I appreciate it. Double iron doors. So, everyone in this area is just hella dead. That is a huge bummer. Tell you what, we are going to switch to Lazel because she has so many deep pockets. Uh, take all. We do need to grab all these things. Oh, the scraps of a night full of feasting. It was a night full of feasting, and everyone was happy until the, the death. Oh, interesting. So this is kind of part of it. You're supposed to do some murder. So the people who worshipped Shar also did a bunch of murder at these people. That's not great. That that does definitely complicate things with um, her being a worshiper of Shar amongst our groups. Hey, that's an on fire cauldron. Someone's been here recently. That's not great. Just let me grab the tray, damn it. I have to get up on the table. Being so bestial. Someone cooked here. That's funny. Someone cooked here. Jesse. Uh oh. Perception check fails. Uh oh. That might be worth a look. There is a button. Can we press the button? Can we reach the button? Yes, we can. Oh, there's so many goodies here. I'm so stoked to explore this. I want to stream all night. It's not a good idea, but I might do it. Um, can I also make it up here? Yes, I. Hello. There's so many glitches right now, and that's fine. That's okay. It's just kind of wacky. Um, dinnerware. Yeah, I mean, let's obviously take the dinnerware. Can you jump to the dinnerware? Yeah, you can. You can jump to the dinnerware, Lazel. Let's go. Oh, silver cake stamp. We deserve the cake. We deserve that cake. Um, Boz. Um, Damien, are you on fire? Why? Why? Well, golly gee, mister. Why are you on fire? What can you stop? It's making everyone real uncomfortable to watch you get charred. Um, hey, how about you heal him? 
There we go. Hey, does everyone else want to jump down too? Maybe? Does everyone else want to go down there? Looking ahead, dude. This, this, is, this is harder than it should be. There we go. It's harder than it should be. God, everyone keeps jumping back up. They're like, yeah, we'll join you. We'll do that. All right, yeah. Um, All right, yeah, Jimmy's mom. Uh, thank you again, Alyssa Montrose. Uh, from Lone Frog almost two hours ago. Oh, Lone Frog, I hope you're still here. I'm so sorry. They dropped 50 flipping dollars, which is very generous, and I appreciate it a lot. I just feel like I may have missed it, and I'm sorry. But uh, Lone Frog, thank you so much. Saying, you have helped me through so much. Keep up the amazing work, and thank you so much. That is really, really, really sweet. I appreciate it. Um, yes, generous Mother Geese in chat. Um, Lone Frog, I will say to you what I said to someone else earlier in stream. I am happy that I could help you get through some things, and I am honored that I could help inspire you or distract you or whatever it may be. But again, that being said, whatever you have done, you have done of your own volition through your own power. You know, if if I did something and it made you go like, ah, oh, neat, like, great. Oops. What stones been pried loose? What stones been pried loose? There. Um. Then awesome. But in general, like you have done the work. You're the one who's made awesome things happen for yourself, and I'm happy for you. And that's something you can be very proud of and should be. Um. So thank you for your kind words. I'll happily accept them. But still, um, I think it's pretty flippin' cool that you are getting through what you're getting through. Someone is still stuck? No, no, they're not. They're here. They're fine. Everything's fine. But thank you. Um, except for successful. It's a trap. It's a tarp. Okay. There's acid on the ground. That's not great. And now we're going up this way. I am curious if I missed a different way to go, but I guess we're always going to have to double back at some point. Wait, when you said it was a trap, what does that mean? Ochre jelly? We haven't had to fight jellies before. This is a level five. Oh, this seems like a big deal. So I've never, I've never fought a jelly before. They have opportunity attack, they have slashing resistance, and they have lightning resistance. So good thing I have swords and a big <sighs> lightning -y laser beam from Gale. Um, all right, well, it's good to know. No lightning, no slashing. Um, piercing should be fine, and fire should be fine. So let's try, let's see, they have 52 health. I think it would be a good idea for us to use, and I can't imagine they have, let me see what else they have. Yeah, they don't have much wisdom or charisma or intelligence, so they're not really thinking too much. They're just kind of strong. Um, low AC as well, so they're kind of easy to hit, but they don't, no guarantee we're gonna do a whole hell of a lot when we do that. So let's take a look here. We have Legacy of Kenya, Burning Hands, and then um, a Flaming Scimitar in your hand that deals three to 18 fire damage. I say we do that. It's a level two evocation spell which is great, but that also just means that any attack that we do, like any proper attack, is gonna be kind of busted. Um, let's try it, we havenven't done this yet. Click to confirm. Doodly scoots! All right, um, so we received that weapon and now we get to do a mobile flourish on this guy. You know what, let's, mm, yeah, let's do this. Boom, oh, that was some good damage. Um, and we also get to teleport to him now which means that we would get to go past. We get to go past the acid, which seems important to me. There we go. And now we can hit it with an opportunity attack when we need to. Feeling good. Feeling real smart about the stuff we just did, folks. Feeling real good about it. Other good thing is Lazel has a bludgeoning weapon, not a um, slashy weapon. So now we get to do damage to this thing in the same way. So even though it's level five, I think I think we're gonna be kind of okay here. Or maybe we won't, and this is where we die, and that's fine too. Um let's just yeah, let's just hit it, I guess. Anyway, here's wonder. Yeah, yeah! Good damage, good damage, only eight left. Look at their look at them go, only eight left with the damage. Look at them go with that. So no lightning bolt for this little fella. Uh we can do fiery little laser blast. Dewey, there we go. And uh, we got one down. Um, let's dip his spear in. Oh, acid is not the same as poison. Good to know. Good to know. Um, all right, that's a thing. Moving. All right, we got one more little laser blast thing to do. Sacred flame versus guiding bolt would be pretty good. Let's. You know what? Let's. Uh, 
I think this thing is going to go for Damien, who has weaker AC than Lazel. So let's do... Oh, we don't have anything left. Oh, she's almost out of spells. Um. Uh-oh. Then... Huh. Okay, we didn't... We... I'm going to take credit for this one. I didn't really think about that one too well. I didn't think this through, so that's fine. Um, so then I will just bless. I will hashtag bless Daniel at a level three because that's what we've got left. Wait, what does level three do? Effect and additional target. Oh, got it, got it, got it. Then let's, um, we get to bless everybody then at level three. Um, additional target per level. Damien and Lazel and Gail and myself. Everybody's blessed. Um, hashtag bless again on Damien, I guess. Um, no target. We're just gonna say yes, we're good, finish. Everybody's blessed. Nice. And then also, uh, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. We can just leave it there. <gasps> There's another one up there. Damn it, I had no idea. What's it gonna do? Ochre spots him. Oh my God, that does a fair amount of damage from that level five. Okay, that makes sense then. Ogre Jelly done got killed. Um, ooh, pickaxe. Yeah. Um, all right, so we've still got that flaming blade. I say we do defensive flourish. Nice with a critical hit. Look at us go. Bonus action for Misty Step. So I think because it's all the way up here, right? It's all the way up there. I kind of want to Misty Step over to this which makes the most sense to me. Because otherwise, I'm not going to be able to hit it for a bit. So it'll be good to have someone here. Oh, anyway, I'm going to soothe its uh, bones with a song. Enter. Victory awaits. Victory awaits. I will eat your family. <laughs> um, main hand attack. Let's just do the thing. Nice. Another murder for us. We're the good guys. Nobody worry about it. Um, great. Does she get to Misty Step too? Why do we all get to Misty Step? That's kind of sick. That's kind of rad. There we go. Yeah, why not? All right, Gale. I know you can't do any of your normal stuff, and that does suck for everyone involved. But what if... God, we really specced full into lightning for this one, huh, folks? Um, Paths interrupted. Now it's not. There we go. Do we... Six damage, whatever. That's fine. Um, oh, I guess I also could have pulled it off um, the, the ledge. That would have been kind of sick. Um, we're doing... I wonder what a level three guiding bolt would look like. Oh, that actually does a lot of damage. Yeah, let's try that. Oh, that's really cool. We're doing great. Nobody worry. Everything's awesome. Oh, you know what's really fun? I know we can attack it with advantage. Oh, it's too heavy to shove. No. Oh, that would have been so cool. That's all right. 22 damage potentially versus defensive flourish melee. Sure, we're going to use a bardic inspiration. We'll be doing a long rest in a minute. Here anyway. Oh, that's not as much as I wanted. Um, but anyway, we're wonder, bro. Um, we're interrupting me. I wish for you not to do that. Laser. Tui. Nice. Look at us go. We really did it. Good job, everyone. There's torches down here. I don't think there's anything else to look at down there. Oh, yeah, there is. There's a heavy chest. Loth's candle. That's also a thing that we should grab. Books over here. That's the thing we should grab. Um, I'm curious if this is the end of the path and if there's just a little treasure treasure trove little walk along Ooh, there's definitely gonna be stuff over here Are you kidding me if you can ever oh yeah what is that what is that? oh no if you can ever if you can ever like hop from one little lily pad to the other you do it you do it target is too far but we could target is too far but you definitely can't okay that's fine everything's fine uh, do you think chess makers make a lot of money in the D&D universe? I would say my initial thought was like, oh, yeah, they're everywhere. But my other thought is, no, they're everywhere. It's a dime a dozen. They're the ramen noodles of this world. So I'm thinking maybe not. 
maybe not a whole lot of money in chess making. It's just like an average everyday job. Like it's your first job when you're like a teenager fresh out of school. You're like, well, I should do something. Like I've got this whole summer and it kind of sucks. I, I want to work for like more money, but you know what? Right now I just, yeah, I just need to do something. At least get my parents off my back. Ah, oh, jeez. You know what I mean? I guess I'll make chests. I guess I'll make cranks and chests. Um, hey, Shadowheart, how do you feel about, uh, healing your boy? Um, you know, I think we do need to do a long rest. Oh, wait, no, we have short rest. What am I doing? No, never mind. Wait, but does Shadowheart get, uh, spell slots back? She doesn't. She only has her channel divinity, which is that thing. So, you know what? We'll go a little bit longer and then do a long rest. And again, I'm going to be streaming so much tonight. I don't even, I don't even care. So now we do a little hop, skip, hippity hop, jump a -roo. Um, now I do a misty step because I need to. Can I just do that at any time now? Oh, it's a short rest that oh, makes me awake. Um, can y'all group up, please? Can y'all come on over? Are y'all able to jump, please? Yeah, look at you go. Of course, Lazelle can do it. She's our athlete. Look at our athlete go. Wow, we're really, we really found a cool path here, huh? You can tell this used to be a bridge. That's the cool part about this. So Lone Frog, I really hope you were here to hear uh, my uh, my response to your very generous tip. Um, but if not, I hope you see this another time. I thank you for the tip. That was very kind of you. You didn't have to do it. It's nice that you did. Thank you. We're obviously gonna go around that door in a minute here, but is this a thing that we can do? Is there anywhere to go down here? Invalid target. I keep feeling like I'm gonna find secret little hidden paths, but you know what? Maybe I'm already on the hidden path. Maybe I'm already there. Maybe the real hidden path is the path that I'm on that I actually have to kind of work hard to find. Um, anything here? This looks very suspicious. Is there something I can dig in here? Nothing interesting buried here. I feel like we're spoiled because the first like two times I tried to dig, it was like, oh yeah, there's definitely a bunch of treasure right here. And now it's just like, no, there's nothing, me lord. And I'm like, ah, oh, well. Poops. Poops McGee, I say to that. That's right. It's a new kind of cuss. Get ready, because I said it, and I'm not going to unsay it. Open crate. Ah, oh, cool. More little spooky hats. I love it. Hmm. Hmm. It appears to be a crate of some kind. Hmm. All right, so it's a stone bed, and there's a skeleton praying oh they were like as i lay me down to sleep i pray the lord my soul to keep <gasps> and they just like had the soul ripped out of their body um he was like what you said to keep your soul and i did uh bro was oh, he missing his head no he's fine he's chilling that's a real normal looking guy i miss carlock wife and astarian wife yeah i wanted to change things up and try some other folks but like we'll get back to the carlock wife and astarian wife god what a way to say it what a way you just said that just there. What are you doing saying it like that? What a funny way to say the thing that you meant. Um, all right. There's probably some sneaky stuff going on here. That's a skeleton who didn't want to die. You, you died at work for sure. He was like, time to do my usual rituals at the mirror. And they're like, hey, I'm so sorry to bother you. We are actually here to kill you. And he's like, I can't finish my mirror stuff. They're like, I'm so afraid not like I know you're just doing your job, but I'm just doing mine The boss did tell me to do a murder at you and he's like, oh really today. Yeah, we have to do a murder uh, Today at you and he's like oh, that sucks uh, Grim Forge a history see that one's gonna be important. Let's check out the Grim Forge a history uh, The binding of the book is the dark justice are here and the blah, blah, blah. cool. Um now we know everything um We can Deposit all this to the camp. Deposit you to the camp. Send you to the camp. Over to here and the camp. Don't need any of these now, do we? Hide armor. Boots. Arrow of lightning. Water. Blue cap. Engraved pen. I'm going to keep that engraved pen. I feel like that's going to be important. The toy chest. Yeah, we're sending that away too. Rib cage, we don't need all this. Uh, withered chisel set. I don't think that's needed, but I'll hold on. No, I'll send it away. Tin coop. Um, orc. Uh, okay, I think we're good to send this all to camp. Cool. 
I wish he had so much more uh, holding capabilities, but also I understand why he doesn't because he's a bard and not a strong, strong boy. We found a journal. That's going to be important. Ta tablet fragment, tablet fragment, tablet fragment. These are all important. We need all of them, probably. Um, all right. I think that's kind of it on this area from the look of it. Um, I will ask. Backseat gaming is turned on for a brief moment. So I made it all the way over here from that other location. Um, have I done everything over here? What needs doing? Um, we just found uh, more secret little stuff. A hand-drawn map. Highly detailed. Lower level circle is, is seen as something. Hand-drawn map. All right. What is expect? It's so weird to me that when they're like, you found a map, they don't just show you the map. There was extra stuff you couldn't do because of the long rest. Okay. Um, has he been to the thing? In your general area, yes. In the worm forge, no. Okay, so yeah, I figured in the general area, I still need to do stuff. But in the worm forge itself, we're too chilling. Sharon's journal. Oh, man. Okay, cool. Hell's forces. Hell's bells. All right, so I'm going to try to open that door. Intricate door. I think it's just the way through again. On the other side, there's another area. Got it. Okay, thank you. I appreciate the help, though. Hey, there's that 14. There it is. All right. Oh, business. Nice. Uh, pretty cool, huh? Um, contemplation chamber plaque. Let feast the eyes of the faithful. Know your goddess. Know her command. Yeah, I think I botched that one, huh? Sorry. Doing a little hop, skip, jump. A little hop, skip, jump. Landing all at once. Nice. No time to rest. Um, Juro Live, I have heard of that mod, and it sounds super cool. Um, I think I'll save stuff like that for, like, future playthroughs, but just knowing that there's a mod out there that adds so many different things to a playthrough is kind of sick. Um, all right, so we did everything. Wow, look at how far we've come. Oh, yeah, you guys remember those uh, dead gnomes? I do feel pretty bad about it. Um, there's got to be a way to get over there now. There's got to be more little sneaky little secret things. I wonder if... What a if. Nope, I can't go up there. Can't go through there. Then I'll go this way. I'll go this way. Um, we have got that Nova dropping five dollars. You know, I need to read the things that are here already because I am so behind, and that's a little embarrassing to me. So I apologize for that, folks. Um, thanks for your patience, dear. That Nova says, "Hey, Damien, I got my driver's license today. I celebrated by getting a new commander deck. That is super cool. Congrats on getting your driver's license. Please, 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 be so safe." Don't watch TikToks and drive. Don't text and drive. I know that sounds obvious, but please just be so safe. But it's awesome that you did that, and I'm stoked for you. And I hope you're proud, because that's a really cool thing to have done. Um, What commander deck did you get? I am curious. Um, I am quite curious. I love me some good old magic in the gathering. I know that sounded like I was lying, because I stumbled through it, but I actually do a lot. Um, There we go. Pretty sick. Hey, pretty cool. Um, we've got another... Oh, there's a lot of smoke powder over there. Is the trap going to blow me up? I should probably grab those first, just in case. And a collapsed archway, you say? Yeah, doctor says I got to stay off of it for about a month. Yeah, sure collapsed archway. Can you believe time. it? I played football in college. Nothing. I get out of my car and I got a collapsed archway? Yeah, I hate, I hate that it's zooming away so far. I just want to look at the chest that's right there. Can I do that? Can I please do that? Black staff. Define ring. Uh, where'd that collapsed archway get off to? You gotta collapse that archway. I'm way too big. Oh, but not if Gale makes us teeny. Enlarge and reduce. What's up, man? Make a creature smaller. Make me little! Yeah, I'm so reduced, my guy. Now I can go through there. Way too Are you kidding me? What's the point of having a reduction I spell if I can't... Things. Can I reduce you again? It just undoes it? No. 
are you gosh dang it i'm i'm livid i am <sighs> oh i'm so mad but i guess maybe we could have just gone through there and that's what the button was supposed yes. to do anyway so i guess i have to undo that now too using all my spell slots oh it just re-reduces me great Time to embiggen him at a level three. This is what a mess. What a mess this is. I hope we get into a battle now. I hope we get into a battle now because I just, I feel I'm a big, strong boy and it's my special, special day. Familiar. So, Rachel, Z, I don't think having a familiar would help us because I don't, I don't think I can um, have them like explore all this stuff that I would otherwise want to. Like if there's a bunch of treasure in there, I don't think you get to have like a ethereal familiar help you out wow i'm such a big boy you're going up there you're the you first live person i've ever seen one of those moon lanterns i do have one of those moon lanterns i oh first let's try to trade with you is there anything good just toxin and a mug of beer don't drink the beer from down there i straight up can't emphasize that enough um see now i could sell all that stuff but i whatever um yeah, okay. Uh, ooh, you know what? Oh, he only has three monies. Uh, no thank you on the selling. I do have a moon lantern, as it happens, right here in my pouch. Shit. Good thing, too. He cursed. Uh, you won't get far without one. The death darks clogged the top land. Clear to moonrise towers. Only a moon lantern dispels it. The uh, death dark? What are you talking about? Shadows, thick as a Dwero's skull, sucks the breath right out of your lungs. Go on up if you fancy. Me? I'd sooner take a swim in the dark lake. So you keep saying things that you like you think like I would know what they are. Um, is that someone around that is alive or not? Because definitely it looked like he's not here and they just sort of had that programmed in for when people didn't botch this quest. That's the way to go to the Grim, uh, the, all the moon towers. Also, it looks like there's so much more over there. I'm so curious. There's gotta be more everywhere. Hmm. Also, y'all, I don't know what I just peeped in the chat. I, I'm walking into a conversation that's already midway through happening, but I just wanna say like, the mods are doing the best they can with like the no back seating rule it is a very difficult vibe to figure out um specifically um due to the nature of this game and how much there is to know and how much can be useful versus how many people just like pop in for the first time and they're like i want to i did you know why don't you try it like this so like it's it's just give, give them some grace like they're trying to figure it out and if you're just like what the heck dude like i i, I get it you're, you're for sure trying your best um, as they are as well. So, yeah, it's never a personal thing. They're just trying to figure out what exactly is the best possible way to do this. Um, okay. The corpse regards you. So, like, here's an example. WDH says, be aware. If you go through there, you can't go back. That's a really great thing to know that majorly affects the game. But also, it, so, like, I guess it's, like, how... I don't know how to define that versus backseat gaming, but that is helpful, and I needed to know that. What is your profession? You asked if I knew about a future. Yeah, didn't you do that earlier? And I said it was fine. What is your profession? He's a, he's a harper. Oh. Um. You can okay, swear it is. Um. Well, you're valued. Yeah, right. You got so much money, dude. I can tell. You're rich. Threat to border skate. Hmm. That name doesn't ring a bell. Crikey, that name doesn't ring a bell. Um. Where are you from? Last I'm just like, yeah, we're done with the questions. I'm just like, um. So where are you from? The spells. Got that true ways. Riz. You hit him with a. How was your day? Questions. Followed by any siblings, and then you just go like, oh man. Having an older sister is crazy. So anyway, can I take you out for a nice boba? 
um all right let's see here we got a few more new subscribers who i haven't shouted out everybody please give a spicy clever coop welcome to sophie calico uh macamonte uh drail 87 and boo lancer cam tunist ordinary olive uh and welcome to y'all thank you for being here riz off the charts right oh gosh i didn't want to teach you all my secret technique but sometimes you just got to pass it on so where are you from originally they that one's crazy um all right so clearly there's stuff up here and i don't know how i'm supposed to get up here but i do have a pretty nice misty step situation that i feel like i can do this is another place that i could just jump to i'm just gonna misty step and everyone else can kind of figure it out as they see fit there's a oh there's something grabbable down there too now now was i down there before did i do that did i do a that thing I, I did. I did do that. Okay, so I just didn't grab the thing that was, like, around that other direction. Um, so that's fine. I also didn't grab their inventory, which I should do. Definitely want to steal from them. Wooden trunk. Oh, there's all these goodies. Wow, who knew? Chopped up pig? Yeah, I mean, you gotta have a chopped up pig. It, it, otherwise, you'll go around an adventure and people will be like, Do you have a chopped up pig? And you'll be like, no. And they'll be like, ha! Be gone with you back to the trials. Back to the trial lands with you. You don't have a chopped up piggy. Um, what are those squares on the ladies? So it is warding bond. Um, Shadowheart and Lazelle help keep each other alive with this little warding bond that they have. Kristen Caddy dropping 366. Thank you so much, Kristen Caddy. I appreciate you. Um, let's do a quick little warding step over to here. It's Anakin, is what he sounded like he said. And, you know, honestly, I agree. It is Anakin. Um, so it looks like he's going to go on a little solo mission right now, because I have no idea how... Well, actually, we do have a mystery step with... Um, oh, we don't. Oh, she needs a long rest to be able to do it again. Gail, can you do it? Nope. Wait, Lazelle, can you do your crazy flip and get the Yankee jump? Oh, no, you can't. You can you do it. Can you do a normal crazy jump over here? Do high. All right, so then... Damien's gonna go on a little solo adventure right now with a map of Moonhaven. This war map details a detailed plan of attack, the uh, detailed soldiers, and detailed merciless silence. Well, that sucks. Uh, pick up. Skeletons over there. Skeleton right here. What you got there? Dark Justiciar mask. Again, like. I feel like Lazel is gonna get so many goodies here. We didn't expect. I need to find that forge, he said. Okay, so I, I feel like we're getting maybe closer to where I would need to be. And hopefully, you know, if I go the right way, great. And maybe I can unlock a fast travel point. If I go the wrong way, then maybe I would at least find um, the path on how to open this for the rest of them. I think I'm just, like, playing this in reverse. Starting at the end of the maze, if you will. Oh, some levers. There we are. There we are. Oh, I don't know what Misty Step is, and at this point I'm too afraid to ask. So Harley Nick... You're definitely allowed to ask questions. Don't worry. Ooh, scimitar mold. Yes. Okay, so I know we need to find molds in order to actually cast weapons for ourselves. Um, so Misty Step is a sort of magical teleport um, uh, spell that we get from... I think we're wearing a ring right now that does it. I don't know for sure, but I, I'm pretty sure it was a ring. Um, so I'm going to send these to camp. I definitely have to get some weight out of uh, this, this pack here. Um... Got too many things, y'all. Just too many dang things. Too many dang things. I'm just, I'm just jonesing to let them go. Send them on to camp. Be like, get out of here. Can't you see? We don't want you anymore. Get out of here, you son of a bat. Can't you see? You're not wanting here anymore. You stole my wife. Um, I am going to sort things by weight so we can see just how heavy everything is. Oh, the scimitar mold is definitely huge. The warhorn is also huge. How is everything? The alchemy pouches. Again, that's not that bad. Not that bad. I guess we just have so much stuff that maybe that's the problem. I don't really need these scrolls. We can give them to Gale later. Send the camp. I mean, that'll do something, kind of. Um, lots of poisons. Yeah, I just need to divide up all my things again uh, between other people because I just have so many random things at this point um mistress of the night and and friends 
Um, but that's about the goddess Char, so I don't need to hold on to those. Bottle tentacles I don't need right now. Yeah, I guess I'll just um, deal with that later because I just have too many, too many things. I also wish there was an option to be like, hey, I have a lot of food on my person right now. Can I send all the food to camp? You know what I mean? It's just picking out each individual piece of food is kind of like, hey, okay, like, you know, but whatever we're doing it we're, we're playing the feud let's pull those pull the leather crawl oh that could be a way to literally send them over from that so maybe we're supposed to kind of be divided right now. what's what do you do you lift it yes you do interesting so then i wonder if when lift lifted like that what it's like over here oh and there's a splint mold okay so you know what i'm gonna play this in reverse here wait where did you go where'd you go where'd you go it's over there all right so that that seems kind of important they'd be able to jump there and i'd be able to bring it down to them later a splint mold seems for the food sort by type and then you can click shift click your items send a bunch to camp at once thank you swifty with uh, whiskey but i i did do it by type and even like even then I think it mixes in some other things. We definitely need that splint mold. I'm curious if I just click if they... See, there is a way to jump over to that. I knew it. Hold on, Lazo. Check this out. There's got... That has to be the thing. And I... What sucks is I tried that. I was like, hmm. Hmm. I don't know if that'll work for me or not. And it, apparently, it looks like that's what I'm supposed to do. Target is too far. Target is interrupted. Target is too far. So... Actually, Gale has this special, special thing. Enhanced leap. It's going to enhance your... Wait, hold on. Doesn't grant any additional benefits. All right. So, Lazel gets a special, special extra leap. Can you do it now, Lazel? I crave blood. She can! This is the way we go. Lazel, you're doing your special stuff now. Oh, Dark Justiciar Helm. I mean, we're just going to have so many goodies for our dear friend, Shadowheart. This is great. Oh, man. So then this begs the question of how do we get you to do other things and help everybody get over here. Um, we, lo we love a split up. We love a split team. That's how it works in horror movies. If we split up, we get more things done and it'll be fine. It'll be fine, you guys. Um, assuming this path is not... Ooh, it leads to a chest, though. I'd say it's not the path forward, and that's fine. Always split the party system, I'm not sure. Yeah, I mean, I think I kind of have to now. So I'm going to ungroup Lazel as well. Proceeding. Lazel as well is her sitcom. Um, and then I'll be using Gale to make other people have little jump roonies there too. Uh, rows of books. Nice. There's none of them, though. You can't grab none of them, though. Um, we've got silver ingots. Maybe we'll have to use that in order to actually craft those things. Who knows? That, to me, looks like a forge. Oh, I've seen this part on TikTok. Oh, we're going to be doing some cool stuff, and I'm actually very excited. Um, candle. Nothing on the table. Nothing on the table. Nothing on the table. Hey, 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 hey. Um, now we can see. Oh, see? I wouldn't have seen that. Forge construction log. Uh, we got to make sure there's books. All right. Uh, I'm going to take that one. Ooh, and there's pretty music now, too? Ooh! Oh, and there's... Yes, that is a teleporto. Amazing. So I'm still going to have Gale and all them jump over. Um, Because I don't want to, like, make uh, Damien teleport away yet. But, like, awesome. Cool. Great. That looks also very important. A forge plaque. You got to brush well or you get forged plaque. Centuries of blazing heat have smoothed away the plaque's inscription. Cameroon, that was almost my title for the stream today. I was like, uh, we're in the underdark today. So I was going to be like, she, she, she explore my, nah, see, that's worse. Cause I was like, she explore my underdark till we balders my gate three. I just wanted to be like stupid and not make any sense. But at the same time, people might be like, oh, you like explore underdark is a little too maybe maybe, maybe too you know a little too, a little too so we found a scimitar mold which is great so that's a sword we found a mace mold we found a splint mold and splints are types of uh, armor there is a scale mail mold over here 
I am very curious. Uh oh. Hold on. Animated armor. <gasps> oh, Lazell, no. Don't be murdered. Don't get a murder done at you. So scary. Um, I do. Maybe we could like snag that and then bolt. No, I think Lazell can. I mean, they're level four. It's three level fours though. That's kind of tricky. So let me actually um. Battle hard, Gale. Homies. What's up? How you doing? I'm gonna go ahead and need you to also enhance your lead. Battle hard, you're leading us now. You gotta get over there. That's real important for both of you. Okay, Gale does that. Then. All right, great. That, wait, why? Why? Why would you jump back? Why would you jump back, Gale? Um. All right. Oop. Forge overlook plaque. Forge your blade in the fires and raise it in the mistress's name. Lady Gaga. Um, okay, Lazelle's just right there, uh, chilling with us. That's that's great. That's really great. That's happening. Um, so now we're all, no, we're part of it. Part of it. All right, Lazelle, now you can lay down the flipping law. You can lay down the gosh dang law, bro. Straight up, lay it down, dude. All right, so, God, the camera in this area is a flipping nightmare. Is this balance or tactician? Uh, which one's the middle one? We're the middle one, whatever that may be. Um, so where's, okay, so there's, there's a couple of these guys. There's actually four over here. That's wild. Um, so maybe we'll save like a Gale area of effect attack for that one. So we'll have Lazel grab this scale male mold and then attack the one that is like literally right there. Using her laser blasts. Use your laser blasts. Do use your lasers. Disarming attack range. Yes, disarm it. Um, ooh, that'll be interesting. Weapon dropped. Nice. What? What is that weapon? Do we get to have it? <gasps> Great sword. Medium good sword. I love it. You love to see it. Um, another shot. Okay. Well, yeah, we couldn't hope to hit twice. Keep fighting. All right. So, she does not really have um that many attacks left but we do have cantrips so we can use those um we can also heal a couple times like this um so i think i think we can be okay it's not ideal certainly not ideal uh did some damage okay that's fine we're gonna be good having another body in the fight is always helpful too they can at least throw potions whatever oh they have both dashed oh okay that one didn't have to dash though look at this attack Lazel is still doing okay, thanks to all the boost from, um, oh, okay, from Shadowheart. So, Warding Bond also combines their health together, so Lazel and, um, Shadowheart do take damage together, which can be a blessing or a curse, depending. Um, that's 22 health, this is, all right, so let's do, does it still not have its weapon? Did, is it still dropped over here? Yeah, it didn't pick it back up. So that's fine, we don't have to worry about that one as much now. Um, disarming attack melee. Let's just do it. Nice. Weapon dropped. Great sword. Cool. Oh, God. Don't hit me. When a person does that, dude. Sucks. Sucks that you tried that. Actually, very rude. I'm pretty disappointed in you. Um, absolute power. Extra damage. That's awesome. Wait, where'd it go? Oh, it just got knocked back. Because I'm like, that's kind of sick. Um, cool. Cool. Shadowheart now has the ability to merc this thing. 65, 65, or what's this? 25. Yeah, we're definitely gonna, um... Actually, healing is a good idea. Oh, she's not close enough to Lazel. Hold on. Um... Yeah, heal, heal your buddies. Get a treat. Um, and then I guess that's the end of your attack. Is Gale gonna turn? Um, oh... Gail, not enter the f Gail, you dumb mother father. I will eat your family. Do you understand me? So stupid. Thanks for the very soft, like, wink. Hey, I think something might be up from Gail. Um, we have protection from undead. That could work well. Honestly, at this point, let's just start blasting. I think we'll start blasting. Uh, I'm almost dead. We might as well kill it. Oh, come on, man. We do our special little lash move. We can't. All right, then let's try. Um, how far can we go? Try that. 
we lash from there maybe we don't have enough movement to do any day anyway is it possible to hear the heal the bad guys you can yeah i mean not i don't think with that uh skill it would happen but you can for sure yeah it's the whole thing um bonus action for second win for lazelle we can definitely heal her up in a second i do think as much as it sucks to waste a weapon attack on this guy um we've kind of got to that was just a weird little like sting of music i was like okay um bonus damage let's go yeah okay there we go we did it we're gonna do a long rest in a minute so i might as well action surge we're we're gonna we're pretty toast i just feel bad because like i really want the damien character to like stay over there and help for a minute a concussive smash 60 percent. let's go oh man that sucks okay at least we did that that's fine sacred flame go murder oh come on two health golly gee um all right great enter these critical hits on lazelle that's wild will damien not get xp from this fight that's a great question i am actually curious will will bard damien not get xp from this fight because i guess we could always you know misty step back but also yeah i don't know how i get I don't know how I get back down there at this point. There's no way for me. If I tried to do this. Oh, I guess I would just lose health. You'll be fine. Experience is shared. Okay. Because I was about to say, like, I can jump down there. I'd rather not at the moment. All right, Gail. Show them what time it is. Show them how happy you are at your birthday. You know. I will say that like victory music is a little cheesy as it is right now. I, I still like it, but they're just like is kind of like <laughs> All right, yeah, you just keep going man. That's fine. Yeah, just like 15 hits per turn is actually probably fair and cool Um, Great love that for all of us involved uh, Go get them little champion uh, disarming attack, maybe? Nice. Oh, it's saved. Damn it. Um, heal yourself as a bonus? Isn't there a quick travel sigil? Lister, I think everybody would quick travel through that. And I, I don't know if I could do that with everyone else in combat. I think it would be a, a bummer. I think it'd be a bummer for us, actually. Not a bad idea. It would be a bummer. Um, she doesn't have enough movement to do that, but she can do singer. Play? Yeah, let's do it. Nice. Yeah, they can just like stay there, I guess, and keep doing their thing. Um, all right, Gail, you gotta. You know what? Bring him down here. Bring him down here, Gail. Let's get him going. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Don't don't do that. It's my birthday. All right. Well, Gail, you just keep missing. I'm really I'm really glad Gail was able to make it here today. Pretty great. Ah, uh, there we go. Now I'm glad you guys are here. <laughs> um, hey, let's try literally all that again. Great. Ah. Mm hmm. He might have something really good though. Like, there's probably gonna be something important on his person. But I guess you know what? He would only fall down. Oh, he would literally fall like. If we push him, he's not getting pushed. He's getting like yeeted. He'd just be getting yeeted into oblivion. Got to focus. Damn. These are not the most useful people when they don't have spell slots, which, it, you know, makes sense for sure. 100% um, chance to hit. Let's go. I can shoot three of them? Oh, man. I didn't know that. I didn't know I could shoot three magic missiles. That's kind of awesome. All right, Lazel. Show them what time it is. Show them why it's your birthday. Damn it. There we go. It's your birthday. Oh, thank goodness we got a heavy crossbow. That could have sucked. Um, <laughs> let's send that to camp right quick. Oh, God. We have so many things. Um, incense. Uh, uh, that's why everything is heavy. My God. We. Oh, yeah. We used her to steal all that silver. That'll do it, huh? All that fancy, fancy silver and that cauldron and that helmet. And all these silverwares and a bunch of forks and a smoke powder barrel. And a 
all that right there. Yeah, man. I'm telling you what, right now, that's crazy to have on this person. A flute? I did not know we had a flute. Oh, we also have Nair's head. I mean, that's a whole thing. Forgot about that. That's a whole thing for sure. Um, she's out of movement resources, and that's fine. Because Lazelle's here, everyone. Lazelle is here. Or not, excuse me. Shadowheart's here. Come on. I guess you can just start searching for the body. Oh, we're fine. I do miss using Karlak and Asterion. Maybe we'll keep one of these folks. Tui, tui, tui. Nice, nice. Very well. That's awesome. That's awesome. Things, nice. More things, nice. So I'm assuming, yeah, this is how I get my peoples over to me. So I wonder what else there is to see here because clearly that area you go down to the Sacred Forge. There's another great sword. We deserve it. It's a treat. There's more skeletons down here. Has taken its toe. I should rest. Yeah, we should all rest, dog. But so I'm not going straight down there yet. That's that's for sure a boss fight if I've ever seen it. I didn't even need ready to burst. Oh, lava just like explodes down here. That's crazy. Okay, good to know. Um, in for a surprise. Don't say that. Why are you? Why are you being weird? Don't be like that. Um, pew pew pew. Great. So now that we have all those things, we'll send them back to camp. I do now. Okay, so clearly that's a way forward, and there's a way forward down back there. We can do a long rest because we have the waypoint, and it would be great. Said. I really want to, um, I really just do all of these. Wow, I can really just send all these along, uh, except for Revivify. Yeah, send to camp. Send to camp. Great. I'm gonna save. Yeah, I can really just, uh, for all of these people, just have him use the special, special guidance anyway. thing over here. All right, man. It is time. So we're going to lower that. We're going to send it on over to here. I still want to use Damien to go the other way and see how I was supposed to get to this area. That's actually of a lot of interest to me. Um, hold on. Am I not at the spot yet? Oh, I'm not at the right spot yet. You need to go up there, which means... So there's a reason they gave us those boots of Misty Step. So I could get there with my special cool jump, which I can't do now. So let's use Damien, see if we can explore the proper way to get down there. And then after that, we'll go explore that, like, side chasm thing. And then we'll do our long, long race. So how am I supposed to get over here? What did I do? Um, let's see. We got... Uh, Kristen Caddy dropping 366. I can't believe I keep forgetting to read these out. I'm so sorry. Kristen Caddy, thank you so much. That was two hours ago saying just started getting interested in D&D. Thank you for helping me understand it more by taking time to explain it. Excited to get more into the world. I love that. I'm really happy to hear that. And I am happy, more than happy to do it. Um, I have no problem explaining it because like, you know, having people get frustrated at you for asking questions is like a very subtle way that you know, any kind of community is gate kept. You know what I mean? Like, no one wants you to have to experience that. Like, that that really sucks if you're, like, afraid to talk and to ask. So, like, I think it's great. Um, yeah. Alrighty. I'm really glad to hear it. Uh, so where... Okay, so Iron Ladder. Curious. Curious where this is all gonna lead. It's gonna probably be like right next to the starting area, and I'm gonna be like, oh my god, it's so obvious. Oh, it's just right there. Uh, that looks like a giant person. Oh, that's how they make the statues. That's a really cool little detail. I love that. Let's see here. I'm curious if I do the door or do I do the ladder? Um, I'll do the door for mm. sure as hell can't really see what's up here. Gotta love those angles, huh, game. Um, I'm gonna try the ladder real quick. We might as well. We're the ones that can lockpick in this party. We're a sneaky little bard. We're just a sneaky little bard. 18. Ah, oh, nat one. 
<laughs> that one it fails no matter what. Um, Demo Nacho drop in six, six, six bucks, bucks, bucks. Thank you very much, Demo Nacho. Demo Nacho says, and I quote. Uh, hola, Damien. The latest episode of Sword AF was amazing. Thank you. From the backstory to the humor, your description of the dream blew me away. Um, I really appreciate that. I have a headache, but got my ticket, so I'll be going to the UK later this year for my vacation. That's so cool, and I love to hear that. Um, I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful time in the UK. Um, thank you for your sweet, sweet words. And I'm sorry you have a headache. Didn't you have a headache last time, too? Come on, Nacho. What's going on with that noggin? make that noggin not be so angry at you all the time gotta make that noggin feel better i'm sorry to hear that you're feeling that though nat one count 15 is that right wayward jaybird are you really keeping track of my nat ones oh man that's uh oh a harper key inspect that all right well you... the, pressing the t button to inspect doesn't really seem to do much very weird to me um, so I should also probably check that letter and whatever it had there. What's that letter say? Undelivered letter. Master Ketherick, my whip has finally coaxed some particulars from the cap, uh, from the captive Harper. To wit, she has revealed the location of her stockpile on a rocky overlook. I investigate it, but I found the chest in question is trapped. Any attempt to open it might break its contents completely. The spy refuses to reveal how to open the chest, even under threat of death, only crying Lux Splenda with every lash. Some type of watchword, no doubt. The interrogation continues, and again, please accept my most humble apologies for my earlier oversights. Rest assured, I will not misidentify any more of my fellow Sharans as spies. May they walk forever in shadow. Justice Yar, Sybil. What was that watchword? Looks splendor. Looks what does splendid. It mean? Um, so we we failed investigation there. What do you think, Shadowheart? Do you feel like investigating that letter, maybe? What do you think about that letter? Wait, if we fail, then no one else gets to do it? Stupid. Oh, stupid. All right, well, anything else? Book of, book of stacks, book of stacks, book of stacks. Ooh, we get so many scrolls. We can give those to jail later so we can learn them. Um, all right, more skeletons to search. Some more skeletons for sure. Oh, I think we found the way. This is how we are supposed to get up here. No, no, that's way too tall. No way. We've been down here for sure. This is not, I guess we could misty step up there, but that's that doesn't feel like that's the, the way you're supposed to get up there. You know what I mean? Or the way they originally intended. Way up homes. These are Religion weapons. successful. I would recognize the Night Singer's blades anywhere. A dog, take them if they're good. If they're good, you should take them for sure. Why wouldn't you? Um, large bottle, long, got a club of long stuff. Um, bones, bottled blooms, cabbage, another large bottle. Send them along. All right. Sort by type. Go, 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 go. Great. Um, man, we are, we are, hey, uh, we're asking for a shout out for Aiden. How's it going, Aiden? How's it going? I hope you're having a lovely day. Um, Canticles of the Dark Mistress. Let shadow fall where light doth creak and silence took the din. Let blackness into lost our semen, bid our lady in. Behold, Shar, who sighs our path. Behold, Shar, from a hope one. Behold, Shar, the primal die. A goddess of the night. Behold. Everybody loves a good cult song. Again, shout out to your 10 year old son who's in chat. <laughs> Thank you very much for, wa for watching. Uh, <laughs> as I'm making jokes about cults. Wee. Everything's fine and normal. All right, let's unlock these double doors. Man, so many lockpicks to not have a star. Oh, difficulty class 18 and we don't have a star in here. Oh, that's killing me. That, all right, well, obviously that's not gonna work. Eh. Try again with thieves tools. I don't wanna use all my thieves tools. I'll try four more times. Not for one, you poop on your poop. Ah! 
wonder, do I have the scroll of Nox? Nox scroll would be great. Nope, I sure don't. Eh, this is fine. Do I have a, um, potentially a, an alchemical thing that would help me with my sleight of hand checks? Would that be a thing? Ingredients, make the ingredients. Um, coating. Elixir of bloodlust, elixir of bark skin. Um, I guess we'll do. War grenade. Oh, sorry, web grenade. Got it. I was like, most grenades are for war. Helpful grenade. We did it. We saved you. Um. We got it this time. I believe in us. Oh, wait, a 16. What we got? Oh, I thought that was before the flipping bonuses. There we go. Net 20, baby. Oh, no. Dirty 20. That's fine. Everything's fine. We did it. We did it. Um, oh, God. No. No, I can't do that. Wait, Hellboy level 3? Maybe. This might be fine. This might be more fine than we expect. I expected... Oh, God. Um. This is all fine. This is all fine. Everything's actually super fine about all of this, really, when you think about it. Target must be metal. What do you mean, target must be metal? Uh, he's holding an axe with a wooden handle. Gosh, that sucks. Um, maybe Crown of Madness. Uh, hold on. Uh, maybe I want to do something that's going to really help out with a higher level of damage here. Um,. Crown of Madness. Oh, it's not even a humanoid. Gosh dang it, dude. That sucks a lot. Right there. Um, I guess anyway, here's Wonderwall. We just murder it. Scroll of Burning Hand. Yeah, what scrolls we got? What kind of scrolls we got here? Fear. Project the image so frightening it makes targets drop everything and become fearful. They will be easier to hit and cannot move. I feel like that might be the way to go right there. We have things that can do a lot of damage for sure, but I think like doing something that makes it so that enemies can't really get to me right now is gonna be the way to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and also we can do Bane on everything so it just keeps missing us. All right, so I think that's the plan. So let's do let's do a little bit of let's do a little bit of um, scroll of fear, and we just do. Oh, we get to do it directionally. Okay, okay. Very cool. Come on, please work, please work. Is that thing immune to fear? Is that thing immune to fear right now? Is that what's going on? A palm will strike it just so it doesn't. Oh, actually. Wyvern toxin or drow poison. That's the one, dude. We're gonna drow poison our weapons here. I think we already did. I think we already did. Coated in drow poison. Yeah, that's the move. All right. Okay, great. Oh, it missed. Haha, -ha, I'm too good at it. Fearful. Okay, so those are running away. That's great. Now, that guy didn't get fearful at all, and that's actually a huge problem for me. And now nothing's fearful because I, my concentration is broken. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm in death saves. Okay, so here's what we do now. I'm going to go ahead and load up right before we did this. And maybe we come back when we have friends. Maybe this isn't the direction you're supposed to go alone. Maybe that's not how you do it. I know, and I'm not trying to save scum, but I'm just like that. We'd waste time. We've got bad dropping twenty dollars. Thank you for the generous tip. That's very, very nice of you. Saying it has been a, a great week, and I wanted to pass the good vibes to the coop. Thank you, bad. I appreciate you a lot. Um, uh, lots has happened, but today I found out my hubby gets to come home two days early from work. That's so cool. So stoked and riding the vibes, so thought I'd spread the good vibes to the coop. That's lovely. Bad, I appreciate you, and thank you for sharing those fun vibes. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for your hubby. I hope you all have some great time together, even more time together than you expected. That's so cool and exciting and fun. I love it. <laughs> all right, so I will ask at a certain point, everyone remind me and remember. Ooh, shield mold. That's awesome. Everyone remind me and remember that at some point we have to uh, come on back to the locked door. Is there something in that locked door? God, I really wish people could just come over to where I am. I really do wish that. Um, but they can't. Clearly they can't. Um, so we'll have to remember this. Can you mark stuff on your map? Very well. 
You, you can put a custom mark on the map that says Ivan Otera. Okay. Okay. That's very good to know. Where was I? I was right here. Um, and the door was right. Like, where was it? Hold on. Um, the door is right here. I'm gonna, oh, poor skeleton. Um, okay, so there's a... Oh, um, okay, cool. Uh, lock door with hater uh up oh, with haters okay cool locked door with haters great there's several haters um great so you go right there my guy what to do 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 yeah that's the hater room the hate locker um but bad i'm really stoked about that and thanks for sharing your good vibes with us Eventually, we will long rest. Eventually. You know what? If I long rest, I wonder if they come back to where I am here when we leave camp and not where they currently are. Because that might be kind of important for me. That actually might be a real game changer. And we really need that long rest. Real bad. We really do. Um, so there's... Uh, we definitely can't make that jump. I'll tell you that much. Mitsu says they don't. Okay. Well, that's too bad. I wish they did. Does it matter that I wish they did? It sure would be nice if they did. It's the thing that I want. But I guess I don't get the thing that I want. Um, That looks super important. The orb of dark vision. Okay. Oh my God. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Yeah. Well, oh, there's a trap. Is there one right there? Oh, cool. I'm glad you found that. Um, Target too far. Not enough space. Ah. So already we can't get over there. Oh, oh my god He's not having a good day right now He's having a rough time, you guys He is having a minute Just give him a minute to have his minute Because he's having a minute Nothing down there either Again, I guess it all came back to this location here The bol the boulder is conflicted Says Liv That's very funny. Uh, Perception check uh, oh, footprints. I see footprints, worth a look, worth a look. Uh, Okay where are the footprints where? I don't understand where you saw that. Hey, we got Amanda M. Davis dropping. Six, six, six. Sub, sub, sub. Thank you very much, Amanda M. Davis. Amanda M. Davis is gifting to Brexit, Dark with a bunch of numbers, Elrooks, Car Carolinus, uh, Nana, Nanami Haruka, uh, Mikey Sense, and then Crow Kitty 666. I appreciate you so much. That's very kind of you. Thank you so much. Cameroon says you do the echo so well. Thank you. you know what? That one felt pretty good. Survival fails. Any sense of this mess. Oh, come on, man. What happened here? What happened? I don't know. I feel like, oh, come on. Mess. Other people need to be able to tell me what happened. What happened here? It's hard to make any sense of this mess. <sighs> that sucks. I guess this is the recording where they're like, you have to make him sound really dumb. Just make him sound like a big old dumb dummy. A big old dumb, stupid old. I don't know what happened at all. Okay, so I think we've sort of exhausted this route. Oh, no, we haven't. Because we could theoretically hop to down there. <sighs> uh, I guess we would have to misty step. Huh. Yeah. So I'm just, I have no, uh, the dormitory. Oh, the dormitory is. Come 17 points to murder a house. Mm -hmm. And forget. I am just so curious how the hell we were supposed to get up here in the first place if I didn't misty step from the side, also known as how do I get the rest of my team up here? I'm very confused. And I don't need to be directly told necessarily. I'm just very curious. Or is this the way you do it? Do you just figure out Maybe we start from over here and then have to find a secret hidden switch. And then from the, actually, maybe that is it. Hold on. Oh, actually. Yeah, maybe. It actually sounds about right. You'd start over here and then jump to the thing. Yeah, you'd go from like here to here. I don't know. It all sounds potentially doable. Um, Any hoozle. It's have. time for us to do a long rest. We need it so bad. Holy beans. Um. 
you have enough camp supplies and yeah you get all your stuff back great um let's see and i think it might be time for us to switch out a couple of our peoples as well i might want to get asterian back um gale is cool shadowheart is cool i miss carlock um lazel lazel is great as a fighter i miss carlock because she kind of does the same thing as of right now I'm gonna go ahead, you know what i'm gonna actually go ahead and transfer these to um yeah maybe we just swap out carlock for lazelle um and that's all we really need to do right now one you know what we're gonna shadow heart you're gonna carry all this heavy stuff you're gonna carry all the heavy stuff if you want to be so important you're gonna carry all the heavy stuff um change shirt we're gonna add that send it to camp repair we're gonna send that to camp these two as well send it to camp 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 uh we didn't end up needing those spears so i think we're good on that um hand axe plus one i mean that's kind of cool but i think we're all set um let's send it all to camp um but lazelle is going to give you your special justiciar helm isn't that neat your special little treats um what else can lazelle drop and give to people uh enfeeblement uh special healing item hill giant strength the thing better sword that only works for them so we don't need that uh bu -bu 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 -bu. scroll of fireball scroll of slow dusty book forge construction log so these can all be sent to camp these need to stay with you yeah great all right lazel time for you to screw off we'll miss you kind of true way Right, group all Lazel. I'm afraid you have to go back to camp. Wait for me. Uh, I'm not arguing, remain here. Great. Um, all right, so then through that we get either Asterian or Karlak. Let's get back our lady love Karlak. Oh, hello, my darling wife. Um, what are you thinking about? Your beautiful face. Um, you and Mizora seem to know each other. How? Yeah, let's. We should talk about our dialogue options too. It's been a minute. We were both part of Zariel's inner circle. Oh. Her by choice, me by force. In the grand scheme of things, I'm inconsequential to Zariel. Sure, I've got the engine, but I wasn't even. Zariel's a big old mean fighter. devil. Um, she fed uh, me like a child. Found her in servitude. Mizora right, envied we'll the here. attention, I suppose. I'm sure when Zariel gave her the order to hunt me down, Mizora was delighted. You think she'll keep coming after you? I don't know. You think she'd have more important things to do? Devils and their pride. I think we can do better. I think we can do a murder there, no problem. We can save her. I can see why you were so keen to escape. <sighs> no kidding. The fighting, the chaos. The betrayal? <laughs> it had the makings of a good stage show, but I did not want to be one of the players. She just has so much personality. Gosh, I love her. She's wonderful. Oh, she's just so wonderful. It sounds like all we need to do to fix your engine is find some internal life. Let's hope Damon is as good as he seems. Because we have a lot of Once that, actually. Once my engine's handled, I can focus on more important matters. Tadpoles, cults, frosty pines. And smooches. Karlak, I'd love to be able to touch you properly. Where would you start? Oh yeah, we raised her up before, but we can still do that. Um, I'd kiss you for as long as you'd let me. All night, and then some. God, we better find a way to call me off. It's so sweet, uh, Karlak. Why don't you join hey, our party? You. Come on, we're heading out. Help. So I think Kale is too. He's got too much utility to let him go right now. We didn't. Even, we haven't even been able to raise a single zombie yet, but I do want a Starian. I mean, if we have a Starian, we're almost a fully, we're almost a fully like melee build or almost fully like a martial weapons build, except for me, where I'd be kind of the spellcaster for everybody. Need something. Need something. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, all right, let's check out the traveler's chest. Check it out real quick. Excuse me, sword by type. Um, all right. So obviously Carlac needs some goodies now too, and we also got to get the special armor. Look at that special armor. 
for um um uh, shadow heart i can't i always forget the name shadow heart i'm just like spooky lady angry 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 lady spooky okay so uh the dark justiciar male which does extra stuff for strong pipples is going to love this so much for her we got this dark justiciar mask it's very important Sparkle hands is great for when we oh loot of the Merryweather bard. What does that do? Play the spider's liar is a class action. I haven't seen that yet. We haven't done that yet. Huh. Merryweather bard. I guess it just doesn't do anything. I guess I'll, I'm gonna inspect that actually. Let's examine. An old lute that hums with the voices of numerous sprites and spirits. That actually does sound kind of important. Um, we'll probably have to check that out later. Um, oh, we had also found those special that special clothing that I thought Carlac could maybe use. Right? Didn't we? Prison keys. Um, where'd that get off the Key green die? Okay. Um, toy chest. I do wonder if with that special key it would be able to open. Or no, it literally is just a tiny toy chest. Okay, well, whatever. Alright. Let's uh let's check this out. Shadowheart, you've got armor that's only kind of okay. With the Oak Father's embrace. How would you like to look just like everything that you've been running from? Pretty cool, huh? Pretty sneaky, sis. I guess we won't get to see how it looks on her until later. Um, uh, Dark Justiciar's mask. Intimidation plus one. Pretty cool, huh? Um, okay. Versus, hold on, what was the other thing that we got? The special dark helmet. Uh, dark Justiciar helm, swathed in shadow. Uh, constitution saving throws, and you get extra saving throws when you're attacked and you're in shadow. That kind of seems important. You're gonna go ahead and have that. Um, Hide all the time. Yeah, cool. Um, Gail still got that silly old hat that we should maybe swap for. Yeah, yeah, we need to swap for that. Giving people bardic inspiration and then getting a benefit from that is kind of going to be for us. Um, all right, all right, cool. I think we're going to be okay. Um, I think we're about through soul gut. We're also, yeah, he's also hanging out here. Um, great, 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 great. More books we don't need right now, but that's fine. Um, we're gonna grab all these and give them to Gale because Gale keeps using all these special scrolls as well. Um, and I think it's also time to start uh, divvying up all the other items that we have. You know, you've got uh, like these, all these different elixirs, and I guess they don't take up too much. Potion of speed, yeah. Let's give that to Carlock because why not? Um, ooh, the Sword of Screams. That looks like it's gonna be so flipping good. Um, just don't wanna get rid of it right now. Engraved pin, we still didn't look at that. Is that a Harper's pin? Yeah, it's a Harper's pin. Okay, cool. Cool, I think we're good to go in a minute here. And I do kinda like the, the vibe that Carlock has now with her, um, with her build, so I think we're gonna be okay. Um, I would love to bring back in Asterion, but I think Gale is gonna be maybe more important for right now. Um, I will probably switch out. What what do we not want to use for Gale? Is Knock? We need Knock back. Does he not know Knock? He just doesn't know it. That's wild to me. Um, we don't need Melf's Acid Arrow. That's stupid. Blur a mirror image in, in large reduce whole person. We also don't have whole person on. That's this is all fucking crazy. Um, protection from good and evil. Uh, fog cloud we don't need. Let's get whole person. Okay, we don't have knock. That's wild. Um, cool. <laughs> Learn more spell. Okay, there we go. Oh. Transcribe scrolls to spellbook. 
Greater invisibility is kind of huge, but we can't use it yet. Stone skin. Yeah, we can't use either of those yet. Fear. Detect thoughts. All right. Common reactions. Um, cool. Great. You real quick. We don't have knock, but I guess we could get guidance next time we try to open a door. That's fine. Um, perform is great. Reactions. Perform. Um, all right. Let's let's go. Scroll treats are expensive. They are, but we don't buy too much anyway. That's kind of fine. Does anyone else have anything they need to say to us? No, we're good. No, we're good. No, we're good. Oh. All right. Time for us to do a long rest. We have earned it. Look at us go. Auto select. Bring them on back. Nice. Oh, sneaky little, little thing happening. What's going on? Everyone better be fine because I love the Elmo. Hurry towards the sound. I could have left it because animals aren't my concern, it says, but they might be. <gasps> the babies! No! Are you okay? Are you best friends yet? Having bad dreams. Oh, I love the owl bear so much. What's going on? I thought something was wrong. Oh, I don't have my... I guess I don't have my speak to animals while I'm sleeping. Just a bad dream. Oh. It's all right. Okay. Goblins had me in a cage. Poked me with pointy sticks. Hush now. It was just a nightmare. We're safe ah! here. With Master. He'll settle in. Give it a little time. I love it so much you two looked cozy together had dreams aside he's still young i remember gonwick would let me sleep under his cloak when i was a pup it i'll helps. cuddle all of you don't worry did you call me master just now I, I i suppose i did you've been good to us to both of us gonwick would be happy i'm with you i think like it here warm fire Scratch reminds me of Big Brother. Wait, did you say you had a brother? Used to. Mother ate him. Oh, okay. Well, you're both welcome here. <gasps> I love you both very much! I would Thank die you. for you! They remind me of my cat. One is huge and stupid. <laughs> And I love her very much. That's awesome. All right. Oh, Scratch wants to talk to me. Yeah, hell yeah, we'll talk to you, my guy. Let's talk to the doggy. I've got a long you also got Nadon dropping six, 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 five, 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 six, 66 cents. Thank you so much, Nadon. Well, obviously, we're going to throw that ball for you. Uh, let's see here. Um,. Nadon has been dealing with a bit of a, a mental health dip over the past couple weeks, and these streams definitely helped me get through the worst of it. Uh, things are starting to look up now, so I just wanted to give you a big thank you to you all. Oh, Nadon, I'm happy to hear that you're feeling better. Yeah, those dips aren't fun. I went through one kind of recently. It's just like when it happens, you're just like, well, here I am. You know, I'm I'm going through it. It's It sucks, and I think the important thing is, like, saying to yourself and knowing, like, well, this isn't forever, like... I know I can get out of this, but it's just still not fun to, like, chug through. So, I'm really happy to hear that you're feeling better. Um, and thank you for being here. Appreciate you. And that's over. All right. It's only fair that you enjoy it, too. But if you feel like throwing it, I wouldn't mind that at all. Heck, hey. Right, there's the ball. I'd sure like to throw it for you. Where is it? Oh, it's supposed to be. I will say it's a little rough that they're like hanging out just by this flaming cliff, and I'm like, hey, go ahead and pass the ball, my guy. Like, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they both do it. They both play. Oh, I love it so much. What? Onto the stairs. It's smart that they did not add in a bounce mechanic. Oh, that makes me so happy. 
Oh my heart. I'm gonna just drop it right here for now. Um, drop. Drop open. Hi, Owlbear Cub. How you doing Hello. today? You are not food. You are friend. He knows. You like it here, huh? Nice here. The caves smell like rotting meat. Goblin cub smells like goblin. And you, so you like you like the rotten meat at the cub. Oh. oh, I love it so much. I'm going to pet him again. He said more, so I will. Yep. Yep. I'm going to keep doing it. Oh, it won't let me do it again. I love it so much. It makes me so happy. I want to be next to it all the time. I will say because we're in this uh temple of Shar, I don't want to lose out on anybody's uh actual like speech paths here. So I am going to talk to people and see how they feel real quick. I'm going to check in with the, every I'm going to exhaust everybody's dialogue. I know that's not always the most fun thing, but about your quarrel with Shadowheart. It is over where I am concerned. That's a relief. We won't survive this if we don't stand together. It is through conflict that we strengthen our bonds. She had a knife to your throat, dog. I do not dog. recommend Shadowheart seek it again. The next resolution may not end in her favor. These dreams linger in my memory. Do you think that strange figure will come back? It is a certainty. Damn. I had assumed our parasites served a Gaith elder, but I believe they serve a greater master still. Interesting. Greater master? Who what that be? A question that burns in my belly day and night. Elders and collectives abide by their own tenets. It would require a powerful creed to unite them. And now this voice, this creed, finds our own ears. Mm -hmm. If it reaches this plane, it may reach. We also others. still haven't looked at her Githyanki Kresh, her like whole um group of people that are like her. Um which I should actually definitely do um because if there's if there's if we're getting into a situation where it's like oh you can't come back through this other area it definitely sounds like oh we've got to kind of do that I thought the name was baby beans yeah he's baby beans that's baby beans over there right there y'all that's baby beans Shar's blessings upon you yeah i don't know so let's uh talk about uh Char. i'm sure you do but please try to understand that it's not something i can just talk about freely my apologies. I to cry. Fine. Just keep out of matters that don't concern you. Good. Okay. Um. That being said, I don't have problems with Shah worshippers. That's what concerns me. Oh, I guess I can't get her to give me guidance. That'd be kind of like, yeah, go ahead and convince me. I'll give you some magic to help you do it. Oh, good. This is where we use our 25. God dang. Very well. Perhaps there's potential in you. Let's see how you handle this. I am indeed a disciple of Shah. I knew it! Get her! Mistress of the night and lady of loss. I assume you've heard of her? Yeah, there's a little something called God. Maybe you've heard of it. Um. Um, honestly, your faith is your own concern. I won't judge one way or another. Curious. Most are afraid of my lady. I think I did well by joining you. Most agreeable company. And the other matter is, I want to get to know you more, Adoha. You already know my biggest secrets. What more can you ask? Any siblings? Where are you from? Um, tell me something about yourself besides Shah, besides Tadpole. What? Besides my life's calling and the greatest problem I've ever faced? Yeah. Well, I like night orchids and can't swim. Is that the sort of thing you That's meant? very sweet. Um, I have to point out night orchids to me if we ever pass some. It's a deal. Oh, that's sweet. No. Anything else you care to share? I can't. I mean, I literally can't. There's certain things I can't remember right now. That armor Shall does suit her, though. I'll tell you that much right now. All else. All who worship her know this. I have had certain memories suppressed. Voluntarily so that I can serve Shah without compromising her. 
If I manage to return to Baldur's Gate Dog, that's so culty. Like, I want to support you. I really do. But sometimes you support people by telling them, hey, you're not, that's not very good. That your memory's suppressed. That seems extreme. Of course. It is an act of faith, not to be undertaken lightly. Okay. Shall will reward me when I succeed. Yeah, it is sounding a little more um, culty for sure. I want to talk about all that's happened to us. Fine. What's on your mind? Um, what do you think about what happened to the Druid Grove? I suppose some would commend our actions. Goblins would have raised that whole place to nothing if it weren't for us. No yeah. excuse to rest on our laurels, then. We definitely did We've kill an entire um, problems species. to contend with. Um, don't other matters leave. Um, all right, so Starion, we're all caught up with. Halson, I think we're fine. Will, we need to check with Will, too. Well, well met. Um, how does it feel to be a devil? It's said that anyone who bathes in the river of blood emerges as one born anew. It's a lot like that, I imagine. This sounds actually way worse. these pawns on my head, curling upwards like a mammoth's tusks. I feel these ridges snaking down my neck. See, that would be really Not to mention a few bumps and prongs in unmentionable places. That also sounds but very uncomfortable. I haven't seen my reflection just yet. Be my mirror. What do you see? Well, you're wearing a stupid helmet right now that keeps showing up. Um, um, quite the handsome devil, if I do say so. You know, that's a, that's a bardic thing to say. A little, a little sneaky, little silver-tongued fella. <laughs> I can't tell if you're being silly or serious. I'll accept the flattery either way. I suppose I'll grow used to the new me. Horns and all. Yeah. The people will see a curiosity. Maybe even a beast hungry for their souls. But I will it, it is a bummer of a glitch that, like, every once in a while, people's safe. like, when I say and hide helmet, every once in a while will pop up and be like, guess what? We're not doing that anymore. Again. Um, I wonder if it's rude to say to a warlock that they shouldn't be in their pact anymore. I'm curious. Very curious. Let's see. You should get out of this pact. A possibility oh, that's he approves. Okay. Away countless nights. You can just kill that I don't devil. Have a clue where to start. Other than play her games and play by the rules, that's the only language devils listen to. We can absolutely kill her. Um, why obey her at all? What could she do that's worse than what she already has? Or versus just attack her the next time she pops up? We can have all for it, but it won't so much as chip one of her nailed claws. She'll escape to the hells, and if we succeeded, my life would be taken in exchange. <laughs> My contract That's is true, very Sarah. clear. Yeah, they're feeling self conscious. I've been self conscious no lately. I hear it. I feel it. She'll have to let me out of my pact willingly. The only way out is if I can out bargain her. Money! Wish that Money can solve the problem! The on our backs and the worms in our heads. We could beat her if we put our worms together. Um, we're we just can. being clever with them. I'm sure of it. We're just. We're just being How like little I jokesters. You see me as more I love this. This is great. Pet. It is great, you guys. Everything's fine. Everything's went back to being normal and fine. Great is cool. All right. I think we're about caught up today with you. Oh, we need to check in with Gail, too. How can I help? Again, yeah. Gail's, he, I mean, uh, yeah, Gail's not supposed to have that thing. Um,. I was wondering about that mighty lord you told me about in your story. Ah, yes. Carsus. Mm -hmm. Carsus was perhaps the most powerful wizard that ever lived. The child who would be a god, the elves called him. And he tried. With a spell of his own devising, uh -huh. he endeavored to usurp in one fell swoop usurp? the power of the goddess of magic. Uh -huh. Mistril, she was called then. Boop. Imagine what Boop. it must have felt like. Boop. To be a god. To know yourself. To be untouchable. Thought he was wearing a to chicken hat? Oh my god, he does. It does look like a chicken hat. That's so to funny. Unravel. And with her, the entire weave. Too late did he realize what <laughs> he had unleashed. Chapter 2, From Humble Beginnings. The end of everything had not Mistral sacrificed herself. Lucid Loading? The yeah, he's definitely one of those smolder characters. You are correct. Magic. Boop, boop, By dying, the boop. entire weave was lost, and the spell that challenged I lost the god my weave. Failed. It was a crazy it was the night. End Mistral. The end of Carsus and the end of an entire. That's the last time I pay for a lace front. The child front. who would be a god was turned to stone. 
His empire came crashing down around him. Mm. The floating cities of Netheril were no more. An event that came to be known. Every time I think it's the last folly. sentence, he's like, and the, and the city was no more. And then another time. All right. Um. So in that moment, First all magic up, was gone. <laughs> Mistral was reborn as Mistra. No one would have known. Upon her return, the weave returned with her. Now, so many centuries later, I try to follow in the footsteps of Karsis. Not to destroy Mistra, but to prove my love for her. But to born her. I try to control only a fraction Sorry. of the magic that was unleashed that fateful day. I try to follow in the footsteps of the guy that tried to, to slay the gods. But instead of slaying them, to I'm gonna, I'm, we're, gonna, we're gonna bump business Gale's together. Folly, one might call it. History. Repetition. It's the way things go. Um... If you ever feel the Netherese magic overtaking you, what will you do? If it should ever come to that, if I ever know I am no longer able to stop it, I will do anything I can to ensure no one but me pays for my mistakes. I will find the remotest place on the surface of Faerun, or perhaps far below in the depths of the Underdark. Initial reality says Gale is either mildly ADHD coded or just very, very bored and lonely. I think it's I the second I one to be honest with you. Trust. I think you it's the second one. You kept me by your side despite the menace that I am. If worse comes to worst, I think I will be long gone before in my experience, falls. at least when in the, uh, for those of you that are new, I do have ADHD. I'm also autistic. Um, I have OCD collecting all the letters. Um, I think for someone who has ADHD, when you think about someone talking a lot in that aspect, and that's an aspect of them that they just have. For me, that leads a lot to like repetition. Like he tells very detailed stories from start to finish, like, you know, a lot of people that I've known in my life who have ADHD, if they do talk quite a bit, it's always something like, you know, yeah, I was driving to the store and they were out of pumpkins. Um, and you know, so that's, so I had to go to a different store to get the pumpkins. Um, the first store I went to was out and I needed pumpkins for my day, uh, because I needed to make pumpkin soup. Um, and it, it seems like everyone's making pumpkin soup because the first one is out. You know what I mean? It's the repetition as opposed to like, here's the entire history of pumpkins. I know what it is to hunger. And I know what it takes to keep that hunger under control. He's done that so far, despite his condition. So long as he sates his appetite elsewhere, I'm happy Different to give the benefit of the doubt. I'm on the spectrum and I repeat a lot. Don't even know why I do what I just do, says WDH. But look, it's not a bad thing. You know, I certainly wasn't doing that to, you know, be like, oh man, he does the blah, 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 blah. I hate it when people do blah, 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 blah. Not it at all. It was just more a matter of like, it's a thing that some people can do. And sometimes it's more like how i said it initially you know but i don't i don't think it's a bad thing i really don't where was that piece of clothing that i'd found it was a specifically only clothing that was also kind of magic that i think carlock can actually benefit from because she can only wear normal old clothing never mind normal old boring old clothing um it was a shirt it was like a special shirt that gives like cold resistance or something not that that comes up too much but like there it is robe of summer uncommon clothing yeah it's not even like light armor or anything i'm very curious to see if that's a thing that carlock can use comfortably um robe of summer boom, 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 boom. oh it has an oh it has armor class 10 that's a shame oh wait barbarian clothes no it is clothing yeah it's clothing so it's not light armor it's clothing i think she can i think she can use this without screwing herself up can't she Carlock, you're so pretty as soon as we get rid of that helm. Look at her and her finery. My baby's got all dressed up. Let's look at her go. She's doing her best right now. Look at her go. Woo wee, baby girl. Give me a twirl. Give me a twirl. You're looking good. Um, all right. So y'all did say that when I teleported back, they wouldn't be with me. But Carlack wasn't in my party before, which leads me to believe that it's really possible she could. Let's see. And in the meantime, we got Adakechi dropping 10 flipping dollars. Thank you very much, Adakechi. Uh, that's 22 minutes ago. I hope you're still here to hear it. Um, but thank you so much for the tip. Um, Adakechi says, hi, Damien. I have no idea what's happening in this game, but it's cool. I got into an accident recently. I'm fine. So here's some insurance money I got that I didn't need to have a good stream. Oh my gosh, Adakechi. Um, I am so sorry that happened. I'm glad you're fine, obviously. But like, wow. Yeah, Carlock is with me. I'm the smartest person in the world. I knew it. Um... I'm so sorry to hear that happen. That's actually terrifying. And I really hope you're doing okay. Um, please continue to take care of yourself because that's 
very spooky. Um, and I really hope, I really hope you are doing totally, completely, 100% fine. Again, very, very spooky. Um, and they, thank you for the insurance money. It is really funny. Um, I think, I think I'm probably okay to tell the story because no one's going to know who it is. Um, but a friend of mine was in town recently. Um, y'all know Austin. And, um, one of her friends, uh, seems to be in general, um, ballin'. And nobody really knew how or why. It's like, why are you rich? Why are you rich? How'd that happen? What'd you do? Um, and no one really knew. So eventually, like, it was just the vibe in the night where, like, Austin was comfortable asking, like, hey, man, if this is too much, like, let me know. But, like, you live in a really nice place. And you always pay for people for things. How, why? Why you? How you doing that? Um, and it turned out he got in a really terrible accident. Um, and it was with somebody who was, like, using a company vehicle. So, like, wait, can we just attack this? Oh, my God. We can just... Tarlac, you know what to do. You got this. Um, no, don't do that. Yes, that's the move, Carlac. Bust it down. Oh, that's right. I forgot. That's the thing. Um, great. So, this guy's here. We don't like that. We don't like that he's here. Um, let's do a murder, shall we? I want to do a murder on the map. Do a little murder on the map. So here's what I actually haven't been doing that I really need to do. Um, I need to use Wyvern Toxin. Um, no, I need to use Drow Poison. So let me do like a normal main hand attack. But adding Drow Poison is a bonus action. That's cool. And now I can just do a normal melee um, drop your weapon. No, not disarming. That was Lazo. Uh, defensive flourish with melee. There we go. 60% chance to hit. Let's go. I'm sure this will be fine. Everyone's got this. By my hand. Oh, it's a miss. Well, anyway, here's Vandervall for all of you here. That sucks a lot. Oh, God. He's getting rocked again. Oh, God. It's just like before. Carlac isn't even going to help. Um. Oh. Why are these glowing? Oh, we just start off with an extra attack. Okay. I'm not going to question that. Sure. Let's do that. It's great. This guy's clearly going to be our biggest threat. So why don't we do a proper proper murder on this man's... Um, Searing Smite is something that we haven't used enough of. 55%, damn, dude. Versus, um, you know what? Let's, um, let's rage. Anyway, time to rage. Okay, um, 80%. There we go. We're going to do it. Yeah, buddy. Oh, we're out after that? Damn, thought we had more to do. Okay, this is going to be wild for us. It's still going to be a really hard, um, battle for us. That's fine. Carlac's fine. Oh, the door got exploded. That's cool, too. <laughs> oh, Damien's about dead. That's always nice. Um, all right, buddy. That's a whole situation. Um, you definitely need a healing potion in a minute. What can we do about everything else? Uh, defensive flourish. Melee. Let's try it again. There we go. Stricken with drow poison. Now it's asleep. Now we'll maybe be okay because of that. And I'm going to use a probably better potion of healing than just the one. God, there we go. Potion of greater healing. 16 health. Look at me go. That's wonderful. Stricken with drop poison. Now we get to do a leave with her. Um. Oh, can she, oh, she can hit all three. Look at her go. That's my baby right there, man. Look at her in her new finery. I knew she'd be able to do this. She's awesome, man. I'll tell you that much right now. Look, people try to kill her. Absolutely not. You're not gonna be able to do it. She's too strong. She's better than you, dude. Um. Oh my God. Wait. Can I throw him? No, I can't. What can I throw? Nothing. Um. Extra frenzied strike. Because why not? Um. How much damage do you do? Six to seventeen. Just take this one down, guaranteed. There we go. That's nice of us. Harlack, protect me. I love you very much, baby. Dang, dude. That's my baby right there. She's getting hurt, dude. Um, and eventually, I'm going to have to murder this thing. Um, oh, Legacy of 
burning while line witch and wardrobe um yeah i'm just gonna do a normal murder on this thing main hand attack boom death to you you silly little guy can i is she actually on fire can i dip my weapon in her i can dip my weapon in her to make it be on fire that's awesome i'm so happy she's not mad that that happened that's so cool um all right so reckless attack mm, let's just do a normal main hand attack on you right now um let us do now reckless attack on this thing because he's a sleepy guy boom one more final frenzied strike on you oh buddy you're so toast i love it <gasps> is that gonna be a better weapon for carlac oh god are you okay carlac i'd love to thanks oh you're burning that's the problem yeah well don't do that well that's normal for you. isn't that part for the course Mask. All right. This place was rotten with Maragons. Their leader probably. I don't know what any of that means. Um. Oh my God. How is five to twenty-one? Deals an additional damage with fire. How is this less good? Oh, it's a halberd. It's not like an axe. Axe. It's like a um. Okay. Got it. So it just has extra reach. That's the whole point. So that doesn't really help us very much right now. That's still really cool. Um, we should probably get rid of that dead goblin at some point. And the devil foil mask is a thing that we got for her. That's, I mean, this is all just great. Look at her finery. Look at her go. She's gorgeous. We can also dye that. Um, all right. Where to? Where to? Uh, anywhere we want, baby. The sky's the limit. You and me. Hello. In love very much. Yet one more. Leader might still be around here. Eyes up. Oh, that's an interesting thing for her to say. Opulent chest. I mean, that's what this is all for, right? Hopefully, it's a good weapon for someone that is not one of it. You know what? It might be good to have a good. I want a good armor for someone. It's been a minute. <gasps> Better crossbow. That's awesome. It's a hand crossbow too. So we could now be that two-handed bard crossbow. Uh, deals an additional piercing damage to burning targets. And an arrow of salving. It cures your target of poison paralysis or blindness. So we literally just get to hold, we get to shoot an arrow at the ground and have it help our homies. Um, that's kind of sick. Uh, all right, let's see. So we found, we bought a zoo. We know that we bought a zoo um where is it supposed to speed um fire stoker so this does three to eleven let's see this we gotta switch to, to me. No one stop me yet. seven to fifteen versus seven to fourteen that's better dude this is better a better light crossbow and it's a hand crossbow no less which is cool because we did find another hand crossbow also oh wait does this sword do this sword does more damage but this other one allows me to do that special melody, which is kind of a big deal. Alar Aluve melody. Wait, have I not done that yet? Sword hums in anticipation, ready to burst into maddening shrieks or bolstering song. I, I haven't tried that yet. I don't even know if that's useful to us. I appreciate y'all not backseat gaming, but I'm sure there's so many people that are just like, oh my God, he finally saw it. Oh my God, he finally saw it. I've been trying to get him to look at that for a year and a half. Uh. I noticed some of y'all are bouncing out, and that is okay. Sleep well. Take care of yourself. That's important. That comes first. Um, light crossbow. Light crossbow. Um, Gale. You don't need that. Can, can Shadowheart use? Shadowheart, how are you feeling? Can you use that two to six? Yes, why not? Excellent. Perfect. Um, she's still down here. That's great. We still don't have a specific way to get over to where we would need to be, but that's fine. Uh, they said leaders around here, keep your eyes out. I am curious if there's something to be done around here other than, ooh, rusted key. There we go. That feels like that's gonna be important. It's so easy to miss things. That is so crazy to me. Old Letza. You know what, I'm gonna just do latest. See where we got it. 
Um, my scalps bring me troubly, troubling word that Moonhaven yet stands. Uh-oh, have you gotten for the three laws? All three of them. Would you turn your back on Mistress Shard? Tonight you will beg for Shard's forgiveness. Tomorrow I depart Moonrise Towers for Grimforge. A ten day hence I shall march the, jar, the dark justiciars to Moonhaven myself. By the time the first star trembles that night, the Selly Knights shall be slain and their allies routed. Speak your prayer thrice nightly. Um, demonstrate your devotion. That's Thorm. Again, we know Thorm is going to be kind of a big deal. Hmm. So let me let me just sort of get this straight here. Just to get our, our minds locked into what we were talking about. So we need to. There's the Grim Forge down there that we saw that was obvious. It was obviously the Grim Forge. Or uh, we need to do whatever is there. On top of that. There is an aspect to this of, um, you know, there, there was that other lever that we're like, oh man, that could really uh, bring us different places. Maybe there's a secret unlockable thing. So I'm sort of at an impasse here because I'm not seeing another way to do anything other than Misty Step. So maybe Misty Step was the special thing. Maybe that is the point. And maybe I can always get back to here and I should just, you know, because that's another, I mean, look, I could do a long jump from there if someone has got the jump spell. Maybe that's the point. Maybe you're not always supposed to be able to get to everything with its base level and you need to be able to like have somebody with a special skill in order to do that. In which case, you should always go back. You should all go back to the ancient um, forge here. Vibrant hair tonight. Thank you. I did a, a little re-die right before stream. Hence me starting at 640 instead of 615 or 30 or whatever. Um, all right. So we are, I mean, we're at the forge here. I definitely should... Um, Port rest. Ah, uh, ooh, ah, uh, ooh, ah. Uh. Um, okay. So she's dipped in poison now. I wonder if we can steal poison from her. So yeah, we've got all these different um little molds to make weapons for ourselves. So let's, I mean, honestly, let's head down here. And I do remember seeing something on TikTok that someone like jumped up from an area and landed down there, which is kind of sick. I don't, ooh, what are you over here? What the hell is that? That's interesting. Oh, wait, no, there was that, um... We had seen it before. There was an extra way to go around. Um, there was a little burning area. Is that down here? Maybe it is. I want to find whatever we had found before because I don't want to miss out on anything, right? There's a little spooky burning area where we could have gone through. I remember that. You're still live, says Gracie? Yeah, I've been streaming a long time lately. Um, I'm very curious if down there is a thing i feel like it has to be something has to be down there so oh here it is here it is that's what i wanted to explore down here what act are you in uh gracie i'm still in act one i'm exploring the hell out of everything let's get going let's get going oh you know what y'all i think it's time I think it's time, right? I think so. You know what I mean. Priestess gut. Priestess gut. In the arms of the angels, fly away. So that's what I want to do. I wanted to throw that mean old lady into the lava. And again, I know we didn't see her be mean at all and we had to murder her, so it goes. Um, turns out, turns out, uh, when I got a TikTok about it, uh, turns out she is not so nice. She's not so nice. Um, a mithril vein. Oh, survival. Anyone survival? Come on, man. No one boosted survival? Everyone sucked at it? Aw, oh, this is gonna suck. I think we found a pickaxe, though. Is that? Immune to slashing damage. Is that right? Let's try something else, then. Gale. Are you able to not... Are you not able to do lethal damage? Immune to fire damage, as well. So I'm curious if... Examine. Uh, resistance to piercing little bit resistant to slashing but not resistance to force it's weak to force which means magic missile baby that's why you do a little inspection am i right boop, boop, boop. Torment. 
Nordly deed ordered. Okay, great. Oh, we did it. Amazing. One lethal orb. That's probably what they were trying to tell me through survival. They're probably gonna be like, uh, gee whiz, boss. Uh, gee whiz, I think this, you can only blow this thing up with some force, huh? Because they all sound like that. You know they all sound like that. They're always saying. Um, all right, time to jump, Karlak. I can't believe how little we've done in this stream. To anyone who's watching these VODs, bless you, because I am taking my sweet, sweet time with all of it. And I'm having a great time, and I hope you are too, but also at the same time, like, damn, dude, I'm, I'm taking a minute. Um, yee! Oh, that's not as much damage as I expected from that. That's so fun. Why have I not seen this part before? I've watched so many gameplays. Um, maybe, Gracie Wilson, maybe, because I'm a pro lead gamer and you you can't anticipate me and all the gaming I'm doing on my own today. Mm -mm. Damn, it's good to be alive. Perlek, you are just, please don't ever change. You are just a peach. I just love you. Um, okay, so that's clearly more mithril over there. Oop, don't love seeing that little crumble. Really, one HP damage? Please don't kill me. Yeah, I think we can all make that little jump. We're all gonna be okay with that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we do have to make our way down here. Making our way down there. We'll be fine, we'll be fine. It's all good. Staring blankly ahead. Taking away through that lava pool. Oh no, it's pumpkin beasts! I don't know what any of that is. Oh, heat metal, you bastards! You made me drop my weapon. You made me don't do it. Oh, it's magma methods. I didn't know methods were a thing outside of the mud ones we found, and they're all doing so much damage. You know what? I really do hate that for me. I really do hate that for me. Um. Wow, they all get a big old turn on that for me on this day. I really do not like that it's happening there. The good news is because Gale is right there and they're all just in a straight line, he's just gonna be like, hey, do you guys like lightning? Well, too bad. Um, all right, well, my character's up at, at half health. Great. Um, let us send mayo and tomato on rye. Uh, let us do... Wait, what's the one that allows me to do extra uh, attack to two damage or two enemies at once? That's cool. Mobile flourish, um, defensive flourish, slashing flourish. So I would do you two. Yeah, th that's what I would do. Oh, such damage I've done. They explode? I don't appreciate that. <laughs> Sorry, beast boy, but you're too late. I've already murdered those beasts. <laughs> um, maybe I do a little pommel strike on this fella? Yeah, maybe I do a little pommel strike on that fella. Give him a little pommel on the noggin. Damn it! I didn't know I was that close to him. Pommel strike on that fella, a little bomb on the noggin. He's dazed, we're good. I really should have healed myself, but I didn't, and that's okay. Terminator's axe, we're disarmed. Now I'm gonna equip it again and that's my action unfortunately um but oh but nothing i can't even throw that all right well so it goes gail how would you like to be a lightning lad uh, oh carlax in the way i should have moved her no now she's not do it my guy Batui! there we go and it explodes on everyone that's super awesome that that happened right there um is she dead oh my god she's dead or she's dying can i I guess I can't toss this onto her either, which sucks. Hey, man. Get over here. Dewey! Nice. Um, man, poor um, Shadowheart. That actually sucks a lot. Um, all right, here's what we're going to do then. We're going to do my special little secret little situation. I'm going to go right down here. Close at hand. I know, I know. Just bear with me for a minute, please. You got this. You're going to be fine. 
you silly little guy. Uh, we need to throw this potion of greater healing on the ground at both of us. There we go. Helps both of us. Isn't that a sneaky little trick? Sneaksy little tricks from the hobbitses. I, I do think it's weird that he did that little like spin flourish. Yeah, I mean, we definitely should talk about that. That was a, that was a bit of a choice, and it, it was a. I don't think he's egotistical, but I also just want to say like he didn't. You really didn't have to. You know, it was a little bit like okay. You know what I mean? Totally torts. Wow, minimum damage for everyone. I love that that happened just now. We can try to kill this. Nice. At least that's dead. And away from us. Dang it. Next person's turn. Harlack, you remember how pissed you are about the thing that just happened, right? Got 10 health left? Yeah, you should murder it for sure. For sure. From afar. God, I can't believe that. Great. That's just enough to kill it. Now we go over here. Oh, yep. Looking real normal there, sir. I actually love that that's happening right now. My game is not about to crash. Yeah, that's its whole body. Did you guys know that in game, that's like what they're supposed to look like? So in lore, um, when they die, their bones turn to scabetti. Um, scabetti. Um, and that's, that's actually a thing that they do for sure. Keep metal, you bastard. Um, at least I saved on it though. Um, she needs to do mass healing word on everyone. And I love that she's able to do that. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Spaghetti. I need you to get out of that fire, dog. Yeah, there we go. Wow, how is Gale the tank of this, of this round? Gale is just fine. Yeah, Gale's dodging left and right. Gale's just like, oh, mate, this is light work. This is light work. Don't even worry about it, guy. Um, where is the other one? Oh, that's the one that's doing the heat metal on me. Well, my turn to trick you. That's right, I forgot about the explosions. You ever forget? Happened to me. Um, <laughs> cool. Shadowheart is Italian. It's like, it's like, yeah, that's right, in 28. I think it'd be like, Herzo di Ombra, something like that. I don't know. Trying to pull... Any kind of Latin, like, Corazon. There's so much crossover with Spanish. It would have to be something like Corazon. Nice. Shoot it twice, dog. Get Gale all blowed up. That's pretty cool. Man, this chat is kind of awesome and friendly, and I'm loving it. Oh, Vet Novice, I'm happy to hear that. Uh, Guess what? Spoiler alert. They are. I've been streaming four and a half years. People come, people go. But the really cool thing is the vibe has always just been really nice. Um which is such a cool thing and also a rarity. Um, hey man, what if we all went up here and stopped being actively on fire? Do you guys want to also do that? Yeah, sure. Um, all right, Gail, shoot it with a gun. For me, bum. For me, bambis. Rumblespan. Uh, Registry of Proud Followers, recruited by her loyal paladin, Ke Ketheric Thorm. <coughs> Their name is just like a bunch of things that are like almost one thing and not quite another. Uh, uh, Cuori di Ambra. Hey, hey Demo Nacho, I was close. That's not bad. Uh, pages spawn pages to fill the books. Some are only nicknames, um, but they're all sticky. Okay, cool. Um, so we got that book. Maybe it's a good idea to take that because we're like, oh, I need it for evidence. Um, hey, Shadowheart, can you do that healing situation again? Reserve life. Nice, 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 nice. Anything else down here? I don't, it doesn't look like it. Unless, maybe, nope. I do, they did do a good job of like building this game vertically. I'll say that for sure. Um, ooh, you know what? This is actually a good time to give ourselves a little bit of um, reprieve from that extra magma down there because we need to get through this. Oh, wait. Oh, to think we almost missed out on all the goodies of the books? Shatter, dement. We got a scroll of dimension door? Yo, hold on. Let's check this out because Gail, Gail might need this dimension door. Teleport yourself and up to one adjacent ally to a place you can see that ally cannot be larger than medium. So literally you like Rick and Morty portal your way out. That's so cool. Um, these are all really good things for Gail to learn. I kind of love that. Um, Gale, can you learn it? No, we're speaking as um, Shadowheart now. Gale, Dimension Door. 
learn spell wizard levels too low okay so eventually we can but y'all we're not even there yet we're not even as good enough of a wizard now yet um but let's get back to shadow heart shadow heart oh where were we oh where were we shadow heart can you make a little bit of wordier for our thirsty little tummy thank you um invalid target I mean invalid target there's fire on the ground what do you mean Why that? okay so that wasn't burning to start with but i guess the nature of the stone is such that like now that it's on fire it ain't gonna stop doing that and that's okay with us i guess fire beats water and it says baha muttering in what pokemon game unless you're using what is it scald which also does like a burn damage with all the water it does oh mold ejection laver so we can use this to make ourselves all kinds of things and i know we've got there um that mythical stone now I'll, I'll ask this of you because i don't want backseat gaming but i'm curious so i can plan we have got two things of mythical that we found do i get more or is this it Can't go there. What do you mean you can't go there? You can jump. This must be the forge. Um. To behold. I feel like you might need more of everything. Pish, I only found once as many of these. I think for now that's it, says Demonacho. All right. Um, mold ejection lever and then forge level lever. So let's eject the mold if there's already one there. No use. It's blocked. Just like my tummy. Um, all right. Well, then, let's see. You're currently missing... What does that say? Um, you're currently missing oh, sleep. Flip. Um, took me forever to find the second. Lol, lucky. Thank you. I'm a pro lead gamer, if ever there was one. Um, so this is the mold chamber. Um, all right. So let's take stock of the mold that we have. So we have a mace mold. Who cares? Shield. Uh, we don't have a good shield yet. There's a splint mold, which would be a really good um i think a splint isn't a splint isn't a splint medium armor um if you sprain your ankle get out of here heavy armor but we also have a well, a scale mail mold wouldn't scale mail also be hmm and then carlac Oh, wait, we're missing one, right? Unless, no, okay, it's the scimitar mold. Now, I will say, scale mail is medium, okay. And I've got a lot of people that use medium, but it's metal? I don't know. If... Hey, Matt the uh, Beans Schnitzel, um, dropping 200 bits. Thank you so much, I appreciate you, and it's a very sweet message. I'm really glad you're doing okay. Um, thank you so much. Um, truly, truly, truly. So we don't have too many people that use heavy armor. So medium armor would be good. Shield would be good. And then scimitar would be good because we have a couple people that use swords. We have this sort of screams, but I think between Asterion, between my character, I think Arlac could use adamantine scale mail. I don't, I don't think so, Gano H. Barmander, because she's a, she's a barbarian. She doesn't use anything but, um, light armor shouldn't Carlac have a higher ac i mean everyone in chat previously told me that um as a barbarian she uses light armor or just clothing because adding heavy armor of any kind um screws up her barbarians can use medium just not heavy are you are you serious are you serious right now don't give Carlac any armor except clothing not even a shield says zero cipher yeah that's what i thought zero cipher Barbarians can use medium. We said lighter medium. But then why are people saying that she can't do that? I gave scale mail on Carlag and I've been loving it. I'm a little mad. Her helmet is medium armor. So does that, is that what's making it? No, it makes it, okay. 
I'm a little mad, and that's fine, and everything's fine. I'm just a little mad. Um, I can't believe she hasn't had good armor this whole time. I've sent my wife into danger. Oh, it's boots and helmet. Well, let's see. Boots and helmet. Boots and helmet. Okay, so it does get boosted by not having any armor like that. Unarmored defense from Constitution. Got it. But it is a big benefit to have this helmet, and it's a big benefit to have these feet. So let me try something real quick. So she's at 13 with the fully unarmored thing. Right? Yes. So she's at 13 with that. Let's try then this. She's at 13 like that, and we can give her this medium armor that has immediately 14. I'm so mad. It's so much better. It's so much better to not use to, to be using armor. Oh my god. If I'm not mistaken, barbarians get bonuses for not using armor. I think it's just that though. I truly think it's just that. Uh, ah! Wow! Bit of a game changer, eh? <laughs> Leather boots and helmets are okay for for her feet. But also she's already up to 14. Like, why would I not at this point? Just let her do her thing. Um, wow. If this is clothing, can we use it as our camp clothing? No, we can't. All right, great. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. You lose the rage benefits with heavy armor, and that's the drawback. Okay. So then I think medium armor is usable by everyone, and shields are good for someone. Let's do the sword. Let's do the sword. I know we, I know we're doing, we're doing it. Um, all right, so let's do the scimitar mold. I want to see that. We can't use that right now. Oh, I just have to drag it. Okay. Scimitar mold. Until a barb has plus four or more in constitution, it's usually fine to use medium armor. Thank you, Nimisek. That actually makes a lot of sense, and that's sort of what I was feeling too. Um, so that's the forge lever, but we, uh, we need the crucible. So the crucible is where we would maybe put in the mithril, right? I'm assuming crucible is where the mithril goes. Why are you over here? What? Hey. Dog. Ugh. Gale, you too. Come on, buddy. Little champion. Some group, I guess. Right. Now, Gale, you go over here too. I literally cannot believe that we made it that far with Carl. No wonder, because I kept being like, Carlac just keeps getting keeps getting rocked every turn. Why is this happening? Poor thing. It must be the barbarian way. And now I'm just like, well, no. Analog TV subscribing for the first time. I'm very right, clever. Coop, welcome to you. Um. So okay. Uh, Crucible. I guess we can. We. I wonder if we can also make silver things but mithril ore is gonna make makes sense probably insert yeah we sure did mithril it successfully all right cool i'm so excited this is gonna be great hope i didn't miss any major cool armor things or anything forge lever oh my god This feels like a trap. 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 That did the trick, all right. And down it goes. You I mean down it goes? We're already here. Oh, maybe this is where I saw the boss fight. I don't. Um. Okay. Then I pick up the weapon from. Is that a? Is that a hammer? On the ground? No. It's just a, I guess I would have to in, eject it from the mold, then. Jesus right now. I still need the lava to bind. Oh, oh, lava valve. Interesting. Again, just, just covered in blood. It's a boss fight, baby. We don't get the reward until we've earned it. 
until we've earned it. So this is definitely the boss fight I saw on TikTok. So what people do in this situation, I didn't realize that there was this much involved in it. And that's actually super cool. And I'm down to just fight it normally. Level eight? Oh no, we can't do that. We can't do that. No wonder people cheese this. So what people do is they're a druid, right? And they can transfer 300 health. 300 health. Can examine this thing and just see if there's anything good against it. Force resistance, acid resistance. Oh my God, we're boned. Bludgeoning resistance, not so much. Um, it's nullified. So it's either halved or fully protected. Oh, because it's made of adamantine or ad yeah, adamantine. It's oh my god, I might be boned. I'm probably boned. So basically, what people do is they use like a potion of growth and then another thing of growth and then another thing of growth and then they're way the hell up here. And then as an owl bear, they just jump down onto it. And that for sure kills it. Um, so this thing is, so th hold on, I gotta look at that again. So it has 24, it has 27, 20, 24 constitution and, tw and plus seven of its, I can't even talk. The only thing that's good against it is bludgeoning. All these other things barely do a damn thing. Radiant, poison, psychic, all these extra things, it doesn't do anything. So I maybe need to get a little bit crafty with this. So fire ain't gonna do it, right? Fire ain't gonna do it. So I need, what I need to do is make this thing, you know what? I could curse it. Okay, minus D4 penalty to attack rolls and saving throws. That's Bane, what's curse? Disadvantage on saving throws or attacks. We deal additional damage and it robs it of its actions. I'm gonna save right now because that's, that's the move right there. Um, oh, I could I could do it's any of them. Wisdom disadvantage, uh, dread, skipping its turn. Intelligence disadvantage. Uh, you do additional advantage necrotic. That's not a good idea. Uh, constitution checks and saving throws. Charisma, dexterity, or attack. So either it doesn't really it does disadvantage to even try to hit us, or is a saving throw for constitution what allows it to just be hit? I'm gonna just try this for constitution. So it just takes more damage. You know what? No, I'm gonna make sure it does less damage to me because it has that high strength. It has a really high strength. I'm gonna bestow this. Are we all going at the same time, by the way? Yes, 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 yes. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do actually. Shadow Heart, I want you to bless all of us with a lot of blessings. We need that a lot from you. So, blessings for all of us here. Actually, no, that's um, that's five and we didn't need it. So, blessings for four of us here. There we go. So, it's going to be you and you and you and you and you. You're getting blessings. Um, cool. So, that's one thing that we did. I'm also going to summon a spiritual weapon right now as a maul because it does it takes a lot of extra oh it's force damage isn't it bludgeoning though it's bludgeoning force it's worth a shot maul does extra damage and has extra hit points i say why not put it right there we'll have it do its best um all right so she's gonna post up right here that's her turn great um back to me because I have this boost, I'm going to try to curse it so that it doesn't hit us very much. Let's try it. Ooh. Oh, it's saved. Oh, that sucks so much, dude. I wonder if I can... I feel bad safe scumming that, but I like... No, I'm going to see how this battle turns out. I'm just going to let it happen. Also, I have so many potions and so many like of these things. I'm just... Ooh. Only an ally. I was about to say, I can just push it off the door. Um, scroll to tech thoughts. Hold person. That's pretty good. It wouldn't be able to do anything. Versus, let's think about this. I can shrink it. Definitely shrink it. Nothing to animate dead here. 
Um, find familiars, whatever. Uh, again, hold person. Hold person is shrinking it, and hold person is... But they both seem like really good options. Control of fear, invisibility, burning hands. All right, so let's see. I'm going to try to shrink it. I'm going to reduce this puppy. Scroll of shrinking it. Diminue. Okay, so it's saved against both of those. I really do hate that that happened twice. Uh, that's actually pretty sick. Um, do your concussive smash with its high defense. Okay, there we go. It did seven damage as a critical hit. And it can fly away. Oh, no, it still gets the opportunity to attack. That sucks a lot. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Um, Arlac. Hey, we love you very much. If you don't feel like you can do it, that's okay. I don't want you to be sad and get hurt. Maybe do we like, un maybe I undo this lava valve. Oh, oh, these are hittable. Hold on, is there something above it? Where it's like, oh, you hit the, you hit the thing. Uh-oh, it, it's dead now. And also, what do you have? Scroll of Grease. I can make it fall prone. That's actually really good. Oil barrel. We have all the barrels. Not on me. But that's pretty cool. We could try that. We could try that. Oh. Hold on. I mean, it is right up next to everything, but like... Might be good. Might be good to throw a barrel at it. And honestly, if I need to reload after like dying here, I can very much prep myself for this fight. So easy. So easy. Um, oil barrel. Um, all right, so that'll be good and won't hit me or anything else, right? Yeah, I think. There we go. That'll work fine. Go on, Carlac. Okay, definitely hit all of us a lot. And I didn't know that that would happen. And it didn't do anything to him. I'm Tell you what, though. I'm learning so much. I really am. I'm learning so much. Piercing, not great for him. Yeah, it's a miss anyway. That's great. I'm going to probably need to redo this, and that's okay. Awaken, what does that mean for you? If there's more things, I swear to God. Um, superheated and threatened. So maybe I need... Okay, it's superheated. They made a big deal to show me that that's a thing. So maybe I cool it down. And also, if I did, like, wisdom disadvantage to it, like, that would allow me to do all these extra things. I'm gonna try... I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try it again. Strength disadvantage. Okay, it's cursed. It's got that attack disadvantage. That's actually awesome. Um, I'm not gonna dip anything in it. If anything, I'm just gonna heal myself up. Great. Gale, once again, my guy, you... I do want to try to hold person on here. Target has to be a humanoid. I can't. Yeah, I guess I would like doing that. That would be nice, huh? Says the game. I bet you flippin' would love that. Um, we're gonna reduce. We're gonna smallify it. <gasps> Little guy! Now we can do a proper murder. This is gonna be great! I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And now, see, he's got, he's just doing worse. Because now we can do all these things. Didn't work. Okay, that's fine. Everything's fine. Um, how are you doing, little buddy, little guy? Uh, you can't do an attack? Because you have to take, you have to do a short rest between hits of that special thing? I think that's stupid. Do your mall hit. There we go. Oh, and he's got prime. Interesting. Prime target when I try to hit it. Um... Hey, Bad Touch MD dropping five flippin' dollars. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you a lot. That's very, very nice of you. Um, all right, Carlac. Well, show him what time it is. Because you got to go do a murder on this man. Also, I am curious. He's super heated. They made that a, a very clear thing. Elixir of fire resistance. Actually, actually hold up. I know Damien character is right there, and I'd really love to use that. I really would with him. Um, but fire resistance potion is kind of going to be huge for all three of us. But let's go, baby. 
Yes. Oh, Gale did not. Gale resisted it, I guess, which is weird and stupid of him, but sure. Threat assessment. Okay, cool. Shadowheart, once again, um... Protect a creature, shield of faith. Um, I do want to save her heals for, like, healing, for sure. Um... Create or destroy water. I don't think water is going to be enough to cool him down, though. I am going to do... What? What do I do? I am going to do... You know what? I am going to do... I'm going to do Warding Bond on Harlack. Harlack is going to need extra armor through this, and it's going to be really important to keep her alive. Now you go over here. And we're also going to do Shield of Faith on Harlack as well. Wait, that got rid of their bless? No. Why would the... Oh, it's a concentration spell. That got rid of everyone's bless. That sucks a lot. Oh, how foolish of me. Bad Touch MD also subscribing for the first time. A very spicy. Clever Coop, welcome to you. Thank you. Um, Hey, that actually is very bad. The way we all just got murked like that. So what am I going to do now? I am going to do something even more better. Um, I could do Bane, but at a certain point, I do need to just start hitting this guy. Oh, he's back to being big. That also sucks. Great. This is wild. I'm probably going to have to redo this whole situation, and that's okay. Um, Gail, what are you going to do? You, my guy, my little friend, are actually not the best for this fight as we currently have you. <laughs> That's what I'm taking away from this. Um, so what are your scrolls? Sleet Storm. Douses fires, okay, and creates an icy surface. I do, I kinda actually just wanna learn it instead. Let's learn it. And now we can just know it. Oh, but I can't change it in battle. That was maybe, that was one of the dumber things I've done for sure. Um, so far today, um, shock and grass, tech thoughts, dimension door. Yeah, that was pretty dumb. Um, nah, everything's fine. Uh, <laughs> what, what do you got, Gail? Um, I guess let's just toss this potion of healing on yourself. This is not the loadout for this group. This is not what I needed here. That safe scum is appealing. It is. You know what? It really is. Um, I'll probably have to do it, but you know, I'll wait a minute here. Okay, prime target again on him. Uh, what is it like if Karlak just wails on him? Let's just do that. Use your rage. Despite all your rage, you're still just a little rat and a little cage. Pretty cute. Um, let's do a main hand weapon attack. Seven damage. I mean, this is... This to me is wild. What I need to do is do, I need to do Barrel Mancy. We need to go back to camp and prep with Barrel Mancy, like we said before. For those of you that don't know what that is, it is literally, <laughs> it's so stupid. But it's literally, um, like getting a pouch Filling it with a bunch of barrels that we have in camp. Um, sending them along with a throw and then um, blowing it up all at once. And I think we can do that. I really do think we can do that. I think we would be fine in our attempts. Healing word on probably ourselves too, right? Yeah. I mean, that is only 12 damage to Karlak. So again, with the like right loadout, I think we would be able to do pretty well against all this. Just, you know, not like this at all. Um, all right, let's see here. What is this mobile shot? That's really cool. That's pretty sick. Um, okay, okay. Thinking about this again. Sorry, folks. I'm just like really trying to get through this without having to, you know, load my save. Um, Defensive flourish melee. I mean, yeah. 
I can also just start, I need to start using my bardic inspiration. Who do I want to really succeed? I want Gale to really succeed. Gale, you got this, my guy. Nice. The bardic inspiration heals people and it also allows him to like have a better chance of actually getting things to work. So for example, if we want to smallify this fellow again, we're gonna have a better chance. Really? That's it? 35% chance? Oh, God. Dang it. Um, well, push for healing. Let's go. Bardic. Oh, I didn't do that. Ah, oh, come on. We're doing so poorly. Me, I am. Um, I wish we could have made him super small and then thrown him. It can't bleed, so lacerate doesn't make sense. I needed a like a giant hammer. That's the problem. Prepare, prepare. They need an 18 to hit. No, I'm not doing that. Extra attack. Still didn't hit. Damn. I'm gonna. I wonder if anybody has the ability to do anything icy she can create water she can do that uh, I just don't want to do that right now she has one one spell slot left dude it's a spiritual weapons gone we knew that we knew that would happen um range attack do I have any oh, arrow of fire arrow of ice we do have an arrow of ice okay um bet Tell you what then i'm actually gonna have carlock do that because we're too no we're all too close we all have to disengage and we get screwed over by that um that's a flourish melee we we'll do that again um oh but oil of accuracy plus two to attack roll okay you know what that's really smart um here we go better Gale, we, I sure should have equipped you with something icy or watery. Oh, he does hit you still. Damn it. Ah, oh, Gale's down. That's on me. That's really silly. Um, for her to disengage, she would have to... Disengage is a, uh, action, huh? But I still get bonus actions with these hits, right? Yeah. So I'll do a, I'll do a frenzied strike as a bonus action. There we go. And now I'm going to disengage. So she gets to sort of run away from him a bit. And then I'll go back. So she'll use an ice arrow in a maniac. I might as well try. There's such little healing left to do with her. I'm going to create water on him. Great water. 100%. Everybody's wet now. He is still super heated. Did that do anything? I you know what? I guess it does make sense that in the damn... Lava! In the lava, he's probably not going to cool down that much from the water, but he does take more damage from cold damage, it says. So I do want to try that. Critical miss. Nice. Critical roll. Um, Karlak, how you feeling? What can you do here? Can you do the ice here? Oh, wait, shoot. We didn't do the... the nope, nope. <gasps> no, I hit hide! That counts as a turn. Gosh, dude, I actually... I truly hate that a lot. I really hate that. All right, so you know what? You know what we're gonna do? We are gonna just do... We're just gonna point blanket here. Point blanket with your ice arrow, buddy. Nope, no, we're not, because that's a 20% chance to hit. That looks really bad. We're not gonna be able to hit it. Time for us to disengage as well. Um, so let's jump it jump. Um any items I can use here? Um push a feather fall. I think I think we're kinda screwed here. Other than you know, just shooting him with ice arrows. So if the ice arrow kind of unlocks something boss wise and it's like, oh my god, he's so vulnerable now. Like, look at him, he's sharing his feelings, he's so vulnerable. Then like absolutely I'll continue on. I think if not. I, I really need to fix my loadout 
at this point and i don't think it would be particularly worth it to try to like continue doing this right now you know what i mean i think i would just continue being kind of screwed um i will say level three for this force damage is probably fine cube 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 five is that there's like six damage it did like six damage, dude. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, God. Okay. It's going time. Um, frenzy strike. Enraged throw. Yeah, what can we throw? What can we throw that we're pissed about? So enraged, dude. I'm pretty enraged at you, my guy. An arrow of fire. That's great. Um, a bone. A war pick. I wonder if a war pick would do okay. Maybe. We kind of do have to attack. 20 damage by hitting it with a war pick that we throw? What? How does that work? That's awesome. Wait, she also has hammery stuff, doesn't she? Yeah, bludgeoning damage. Let's go. Concussive smat, let's go. How did you miss? I'm so mad. That's really cool. Um, oh, uh, opportunity cast of, yeah, we'll just do an opportunity attack. Because 12 damage with the bludgeoning. That's really great. I feel like we're hitting our stride a little bit. I feel like he's about to kill him. Kill her, there we go. Um, all right, so now we get to do a special little blasty attack with our ice arrow right here. 45 damage, let's go. Did that even do any, oh, it's saved with arrow of ice. So it could have done something to him. It just didn't. Okay, I love that for all of us. Um, that's super cool that that happened. Most reactive with poison. Targets must succeed in the constitution. Oil of accuracy. Again, um, antidote. Arcane cultivation. Uh, elixir of arcane cultivation. Drought poison is not going to help us, I don't think. Um, slime bomb isn't going to help us. I guess the void thing that I had before would kind of help us, but I'm like also not going to waste that really good item and lose out on all the different uh almost like merch all the different loot as well all right let's um let's keep this here for gail not doing too good my guy um that's a huge bummer gail you should sort of get the heck out of dodge here and you should also for sure heal yourself which you don't oh god no i hid Oh, I'm so mad. Because C opens everyone's inventory any other time. No, it doesn't. C is always hide. What game am I thinking of that does that? Oh, looks like Bloodlust. Hmm. Lit item. I'm so mad. Huh. I'm pretty mad. I guess throwing items is kind of good for them. Um, Extra thing. There we go. Yeah. Good job, Gail. You're fine. Everything's fine. Carlac. Throwing really worked for her. I'm curious if throwing other things is good. Obviously not a healing potion. We would never do that with a healing potion. But maybe... A juicy apple! No, it probably has to do with weight as well. Maybe the bones. Maybe we throw bones on him. This is stupid. I'm not doing it. Frenzied strike. You know what? You're getting hit anyway. Let's go. Oh, gosh dang it, dude. Reckless attack. Let's go. There we go. Another attack. Do it. Nice. We're actually... It's almost at halfway, and we may not be doing great, but at least we're doing something. Um, Produce flame. That's sure as hell not going to help. Um, Just hit it. Just do that. Hit it with a rock. Um, okay, that didn't work, which means... Learn my lesson over here. Um, let that item half go to you, Arlac. Oh no, half go to you here. Um, we're also gonna split this and give you one over here. Thanks for hanging out, y'all. I'm. Uh, I'm. This is probably gonna be the last thing we do on stream tonight. Um, I'm sure, understandably, I'm. I'm pretty sleepy right now. Um, I'm having a great time, but I'm pretty sleepy. Nice. 12 damage every time we hit that with that. I mean, ooh. Ooh, 30 damage all at once is not ideal. Okay, you hit everyone. You really did that, didn't you? Um, okay. Okay. So, okay. 
Okay. So she's down, like, for sure. Um, not my favorite thing to have happened so far yet today. Um, let's just go ahead and toss that on her, because that's going to be pretty important. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that sucks. Um, okay. Cool. I guess Ice Arrow can wait. Yeah, okay, um... Blade Ward is for Hansley. Yeah, there's just nothing else for Gale to do at this point, unless special scroll. Scroll of Shatter, Invisibility, Burning Hands, Fear, Hold Person, Tech Thoughts, Shock and Grasp, Dimension. Dimension Door could maybe get us to fly away real, real, real far, but still probably not super beneficial. Um, fire Resistance Potion. Um, okay, cool. So we're, we're fine. Okay. Uh, find familiar wouldn't help probably shot and grasp i guess we'll just i guess we'll just do this again cool. mm, 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 mm. Tube, 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 tube. okay cool fun love that for us carlac you got this homie yes queen actually hold on let's try this again what is super heavy that my other guy is holding on to daggers are good you can throw daggers those are weapons those are proper weapons um, what else can we throw? What needs to be icy metal? But it was screwed on to something. So icy metal was screwed on to something. I'm assuming that was a weapon of some kind and we would need to combine it. But I don't know yet. Um, what is heavy? Oh my god! Lumps Warhorn! We can call in our boys! This is literally our get out of jail free card and we haven't used it and I forgot this whole time. I'm assuming, I'm assuming, maybe wrongfully so, that if they hear, and smoke powder bombs. Oh, uh, there's so many things to use that I haven't been using. Um, literal bombs, that's amazing. Split, um, great. So I think it's time to call in the fellas. You who fellas, can you help us do a murder here, please? Um, all right. Wow, I can't believe we didn't do that before. Can you guys make your way to this forge underground? Are you just like here right now? Wow, they really were just chilling and waiting. Um, okay, they're on fire. Okay, that one's got most of its health gone now. Great. I love that for all of us. That's super cool that that happened already. So cool that it happened. Um... What, where did the, where did my exploder bombs go? Where are my exploder bombs? You literally just, I thought I literally just gave you exploder bombs. What is going on? I really thought I did. Oh no, here are the exploder bombs for you. Yeah, now's, now's the time to use all the weapons. This is a thing for sure. Um, exploder bomb, smoke powder bomb. Uh, is it gonna blow us up too? Maybe. I don't really care at this point. Let's go. Yeah, we did it. Yeah, it's so much damage against our friends. Um, that's cool that that happened. What other thing do we not need? A dagger. That's super cool that that we can do that. Yeah, critical hit and it's prone. That's actually so good that we can do that. Um, reckless attack. Awesome. 44% advantage. Yes, still missed it. Cool. We'll be fine. Oh, and he's just back up. He's not fine. That's great. Oh, my love, my darling, no! Wait, is she dead, dead, dead? <gasps> no, she's prone. Okay, she's not dead at all. That's great. Um, not even a little bit dead. We're fine. She's fine. Walk it off. Walk it off, hon. I love you. Walk it off, hon. I'm going to go this fancy model here. Um, I just don't want to hit anyone but my friends. I guess I have to throw it. Just at Shadow Heart. Nice. Up you go, friends. Oh, buddy. Oh, brother. Yeah, you got it, Lump the Enlight. Are you goddamn kidding me? <laughs> Are you goddamn kidding me? Are they about to die in the fire? They're about to die in the fire. I'm so mad. <laughs> Is that Carl? Is it Carlock dead? No. Carlock's fine. Carlock's fine. She's just prone. Okay, she's just lying prone. Help her up. 
There you go, buddy. Old pal. And I can't walk away now. I'm doing so poorly. Um, your turn. Hey, that's great. Um, frenzy strike. It's literally a 25% chance to hit. I'm I'm having so much trouble. Um, okay, here we can also throw a dagger again. We know. Oh, it's a 6% chance to hit. I should have known that. Damn it. Okay, cool. Threat assessment. Not great. 20%. Okay. Not great, not great. Everything's awesome, really, when you think about it. Um, she's just now getting up. She's in trouble, too. Okay, so Carlock's definitely down. That's fine. Um, pretty much everyone else is, too. I don't think I can heal them much anymore in a way that makes sense. Oh, is Gale just dead dead? Gale's just dead dead. All right. Wait, he's prone. How much health? Five health. So he's not dead dead. All right, great. So I'm gonna go ahead and blast this thing with a um uh wait does Bane get better? No. Um Oh god, Chalk is dead. Or he's prone. This is the dumbest situation. It is truly this is stupid. Um I wonder if we can jump to like here. Yes. Okay, so I can. And now I'm gonna throw another health potion like here to help both of my friends. Only Gale is who I'm gonna help. Come on, Lump, you got this. Yeah, Lump. Okay, so Acid Arrow is not gonna do anything to him. Wait, the lava goes away? As the cavalry arrive? Let's go. Let's go. Um, we very much need to help Harlock. Ah. Um, well, damn. All right, thank you. Go ahead and do your thing, my guy. I literally can't believe how little you guys have done. And it's pretty cool that that is the case. Um, she can't do anything for herself right now. I wish I could disengage. I can't. Um, her rage kind of has to end now. That's okay. Um, so you need to disengage uh, for her, sure. And walk way the hell over here. And heal yourself so you can heal people later. And we're, he's not even at half health, y'all. He's not even at half health. This is wild to me. Okay, now my guy is down. That's pretty cool that that happened. Okay, pretty cool. And then um, they're, I think, straight up dead. Are they prone or are they dead? They could be dead. I don't know. <sighs> Part of me wishes I'd save Scum. I'm going to hit you. He still has... No one has done anything. They haven't done anything. I think they're good for when there's like a lot of little guys. And they're like, we're going to make you pay, you bunch of little guys. That's always nice. But I think instead, uh, at this point, it's just kind of like... I don't know. Really? It just didn't... It just didn't hit. It just didn't happen for him. That's just not how it went for him. All right, up you go. Is it another turn of prep? Yeah, just go ahead and prep on up. Dash, you're almost there. Rage ended. That's awesome. I love that for us. Um, what else can I throw? What is good to throw? Anything heavy as hell? I, I so wish I restarted. That's such a shame. Smoke powder satchel. Or she can just throw smoke powder bomb. It does seem like a pretty good idea when you think about it or don't think at all. Did it get bigger? Is th that looks bigger. Maybe it's just there's no lava on its skin right now. Um, and I respect that. I love that that's a choice and that's fair. Um, ranged attack. Sure, let's range. No damn, no damn. Oh, is he just dead dead? Did he miss out on a saving throw? No, he's not dead yet. He's not dead dead. Um, I don't really know what else to do at this point. 
Eat doo doo, you poop head. Hey, Kiana, you're here at the worst we've ever done. There is a boss that's way stronger than us. We did not do what we needed to do to make it uh, actually manageable. It's rocking our beans, um, but it's lovely to see you. Okay, so he's dead. Damien's for sure dead. Like he's dead, dead. And I know we're able to resurrect him, but it's not looking great. R R Raggy, <laughs> get out of here. Don't, but like, that's funny. Um, okay. What if, what if we, save this for next time what if lump is carrying the very thing what we need oh warped headband of intellect what headband of intellect that's so broken increases wearer's intelligence to 17 if you can't read that that's absurd really how could we end combat? Enemy too close. So we could literally run and have everyone else. I mean, so I'm gonna I'm gonna take all this for sure. Because intellect is used for like a lot of like Kale's already fine for intelligence, but like a character like my bard, intellect is not there. Not there at all. And he still needs it for like random things where it's like, huh. I wonder what's inside the chest. I guess I won't open it. I don't know how to do that. No. I don't know how to do nothing in my brain. Um, okay, so scroll of revivify, first of all. First of all. Target's blocked. What do you mean target's blocked? By what? The amount of murder on his body? Right? No. There we go. How is it blocked? Oh. Close at hand. Oh, I get to choose where he goes. That's cool to me. Wow, I can't believe he's alive. So theoretically, we can run from this and try it again later? No, probably not. We're not gonna do that. We're not gonna do that. We haven't done damage on this thing in a very long time. I think it's time to say, when your character's dump stat is intelligence, that hat breaks the game. Yeah, no, I mean, what? Let's see, Carlac would be intelligence dump here. Yeah, so her intelligence is eight as a dump stat, but then instead of that, she would have intelligence across the board. Gale's fine. Shadowheart's probably fine. What's I think my character's dump status intelligence or strength? What's what's my uh, uh okay, so strength is at eight, but intelligence is also at twelve. Like that'd be kinda huge. Examine his stats again. I mean that's huge. Check the enemy's stats and his resistances. Alright, so basically what I needed to do was have blood. Oh now he's resistant to everything. How? How? He has, he has true resistance to anything. Everything is nullified. So what that means is... Mi Does the lava have to be on? Oh my god. He's only hittable when the lava is happening. Because when the lava is happening, he's able to be like... He's all malleable. Oh my god. So tell you what. We're going to run over here and I'm going to try to get... Um, I'm gonna try to get my damn item out of here. I'm gonna try to get my damn item out of here and see if that saves us and if we can just run after that. Um, because I need to get everybody to safety and then we, uh, then we turn that fire back on. Yeah, because nothing has been doing damage. That makes so much sense now. Holy going. beans. Wow. Still killing all my friends over here, and that's fine. But once that happens, I won't feel bad about um turning on that thing. Quake, that's awesome. He's back in the death state. No, maybe we just let Damien die. I swear I've never seen anyone brute force this fight at all. Oh, is there an entire situation of what I'm quote unquote supposed to be doing? Oh no. Was I really supposed to break these? Is that a thing? I'm supposed to break this and that and this, and I've been brute forcing it. <laughs> No, oh, no way. No way. Okay. So that's, you know, what's cool is now we know that. And that's actually really cool that we know that. And I think that's actually sick. And I love that. Can I just say, I love that everybody knows that. And we're all just so supportive of each other um, in knowing that and the fact that we know it. So here's what. 
I'm gonna do for myself, me personally, I think I'm probably supposed to get him to come over here and do the threat assessment thing. And then I hit it with this forge lever that goes bang. Um, that's clearly the thing that I'm supposed to do. And I'm a little embarrassed, but really in a, in a certain sense, it is, it's everyone's fault, but mine is the thing. So here's what I'm gonna do. Um, in the interest of like, I don't know, math and science. I'm gonna real quick, uh, just go ahead and do like a potion of greater healing onto my own guy and bring him over to help be healthy. Um, I'm not mad. I'm really not. I'm not mad. I'm, I'm angry. So I'm angry, but I'm not, it's not like I'm mad. Like you'd never say I'm mad, right? Cause I'm not, I'm not. And it's fine when you think about it. It is okay. It's fine. Um, it's fine. So yeah, so um, Shadowheart, she's all up over here and that's, I love that for her for sure. Um, I feel like my brain is firing on all cylinders and I'm actually like, I'm kind of losing it a little bit right now on account of what just happened and how mad I am about it. Um, you know, you know what I mean? Like it, it feels, that feels like a normal amount of anger to me. Just like a lot, like a lot of anger. <laughs> Great, so I'm, that's, this is all cool. Um, so I think we need to pull, here's, here's the deal. I, we need to go right there and then we pull focus in a minute. So he's going to do his thing and hopefully he doesn't hit me. He sure did. Huh, champion. Uh, champion move, my guy. Real champion move. Okay, so both my friends is dead. Both my friends is dead. Um, I can misty step away and we can, we can loot them later when you think about it. Um, I'm gonna misty step to like right here, just like right here. And then we, we gotta get someone like, is Gale dead? Uh, he will be, I'm gonna revive him later, but no, he's for sure super dead right now. And that's okay because I, I want it to be known that I am not restarting this fight. Yeah, that's the thing that happens next right here. So I'm gonna have Carlock on standby. Um, in fact, why don't you pull focus and meow? Watch this. Look at me try, look at me go. Yeah, threat assessment, yeah, prime target. Come and get me, beef beef. Come and get us, we will die as husband and wife. I love you so much, Carlock. You're, you're the only person in this whole world that showed me a little bit of kindness. And I know, I know that's supposed to be the bear mins, the little berry mins, a mum. But you know what? That we don't always get that. We don't always get the bare minimum from people when we deserve it. Um, you'd think, you'd want to, but no, you're fine. Um, so we're going to protect Harlack because, well, I guess we can. Um, we're gonna do nothing is what we're gonna, we're gonna do that. No, we're gonna do nothing. Everything's fine. You got it, buddy. Gail and Damien over there. You guys are fine. Yak, wake it up. Oh God, no, um, okay. So she's right there. I wonder if I'm able to just do this now. Here we go. Everybody else should definitely back up for sure, but I guess you can't. Oh, okay. Wait, what? Why, why, why? I am so angry. But wait, but wait, how did um I, I am just curious, hold on. How did Shadowheart die? How did Shadowheart die? Because she was pretty far from that. <laughs> Warding bond! You're so right. That's so funny, Warding Bond. So again, for anyone who doesn't know, Warding Bond, you do give someone extra armor, but you also connect. How long has that been happening? How long has that been happening? Oh no. Um, so Warding Bond does connect you health-wise. Like if they take damage, you take half of it. Like you're gonna protect each other. Um, the entire time, it's a genocide official. Okay, new rule. You're allowed to definitely say that when that's happening. <laughs> ah! 
Okay, so the good news, here's the good news. You guys ready for the good news? I have it, here it is. We may be going back, what is that, 31 hours? So we may be going back a full 30 plus minutes. But at least now we can prepare so well. But again, I guess we don't have to brute force it. We don't have to brute force it. Whereas before I was like, we need to get a, a, a sh the bombs and everywhere. I don't have to do that anymore. So, um, okay. That's really funny. Easy Hellcat is gifting a sub to Smart Poppy. Um, and then Anonymous is giving us up to the biggest tibbies. How dare you? Um, thank you very much. I appreciate it. It is recent. It hasn't been going the whole time. Okay, that's great. That's great. That's great. Okay. I think we're fine. All right, y'all. So then, that being said, that is a five-hour stream for you. Um, I need to have, um, some, some boy dinner. <laughs> <sighs> Woo! I can't believe all of that happened. And look at us. We didn't even enter with full health. I was just like, yeah, whatever this is, we can probably do with it. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna... No. So, I mean, if anything, I might come back and be a druid and just uh, do the owl bear trick. Oh, my God. Um, okay, okay, okay. So now we know, and we can still summon our ogre friends, and they will die too. From the top rope, exactly. From the top, make a drop. That's a big old owl. Um, it's gonna be great. So here's the deal. <laughs> I will of course read out all the resubscribers as I always do. Um, but we're gonna call that a stream for tonight. Um, thank you so much for hanging out, y'all. Um, I'm I'm gonna do the normal wrap up, so it's not quite done yet. But I appreciate y'all hanging out. This has been super lovely, and you're very nice, and I appreciate you. So how long was that battle? Like 30, 40 minutes? Yeah, initial reality. That was like 30, 40 minutes. But again, you know what? Games are about experience. Games are about having fun, trying to figure things out. And I may not have like beaten it. And yeah, it, it's only a waste of time if we didn't have a good time. And I think we had a good time. I had a good time. Um, but I did get absolutely rocked by that thing that I shouldn't have had to do. Um, hey, everybody, please give a spicy and welcome uh, and warm welcome back and thank you to Sean the Ginger for their second month, Irritated Nick for their ninth, we got Swoop for their 25th, Raccoon Jess for their 14th, Daniel T for their 35th, Kimmy Cola for their two year club anniversary, Kimmy Cola Golden Moogles. Oh, uh, no, actually, you just get the blue cake. There we go. I almost did the blue uh, Golden Moogles. Um, uh, Kimmy Cola, thank you so much. I appreciate you, Oodle. Uh, Jepperhead, uh, no. Winding it back. Sorry, I got a different message that made me confused for a minute. Um, uh, but, 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 Jimmy Cola, thank you for two years of support. I greatly appreciate you. Here's to 10,000 more. Um, Jepperhead for their 32nd. We got Curvrito for their second. Board Blackbird for their third. Debs McLeod for their second. Anna Phipps for their 28th. Uh, Felix Hugo for Aldarius. Love that Fire Emblem fandom. Uh, for their ninth, we got The Fade for their fourth. Brian Calhoun for their 28th. Uh, Tama P for their second froggy for their fifth and then sir philip for their second welcome back everyone and thank you y'all i might stream tomorrow night it's my friday night um i want to relax i want to chill and it kind of feels like it would be nice to just play some video games and do it with y'all um let's let's plan out then the the sleepover stream the like movie night stream um i'll do that sometime during my break the the one week break in early september i know it's been a long time coming sorry about that but um yeah, I think that's the move. So maybe tomorrow night I'll stream a little bit more Baldur's Gate. In the meantime, tomorrow I'll upload the next uh, stage of Baldur's Gate streams to the YouTube. These long streams really are fun. I appreciate that ton of dance. Look, I mean, it's it's fun for me too. And there are gonna be other games out there that I'm like, eh, these are fine. Like, you know, uh, it was three hours and it was fun and it was fine, but I don't wanna play more than that of this game right now. We'll come back later. This is obviously the kind of game that like, I don't know, I'm like 50 hours in and we're still in act one just because I am loving exploring every little thing and talking to y'all and all that good stuff. Um, so anyway, thanks for being here, y'all. I really appreciate you. This has been truly, truly, truly lovely. Hey, you know what? I've got another friend who um, is addicted to some video games right now. Let's take a quick peek at what's available. Yeah. Um, so, uh, my friend Sefi, aka Persephiroth, is streaming right now. And she's also playing Baldur's Gate, and she's super addicted, just like I am. Probably way, way, way more so. I don't know where she is in her game. If you want to hold off on seeing things because you're watching through this one and don't want things spoiled, entirely understandable. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and raid just so we can send her a, a lovely, like, raid message. Um, 
uh, and, and get that number really big. Even if you got to go, totally understandable, but I just want to send that her way. So let's see here. Kiana, thank you for popping in. And y'all, Kiana Mai, um, fantastic artist. Follow her on uh, Twitter, on the YouTubes and all that stuff. Actually, I'm sorry. I just realized I don't I don't believe I know you for now. Oh, sorry if I misspoke at all. Um, and you also don't have to say... You also know okay i just looked up on your twitter is she hers there we go um please follow her on the on the twitters uh marvelous artist um so 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 fun and just drew all of the smosh faces in the coolest possible way um all right y'all so here's the raid message um mm, let's see here oh who is she right no uh no uh it's gonna be like um uh friendship battle there we go that's more my speed friendship battle Boom. So we're going to copy and paste this. Um, all right, y'all. And now we have the, the cool see you later emote. Um, uh, courtesy of Lola-chan. Um, Lola, thank you very much uh, for making these wonderful emotes. I'm excited to see your response, but no rush on that unless you already did, in which case I'm sorry. And I'll check my email. Um, so Clever Coop, as I always say, whether you tip, you subscribe, you throw bits my way or... You just support me by watching with your eyeballs. I so, so, so appreciate you. I love this community, and I could not and would not want to do this without you. So thanks for hanging out tonight. Gosh, it's already tomorrow. It's already today. Until next time, Clever Coop, you are dismissed. Here's the emote. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.